Howdy y'all, my name is Price, and welcome to some Pesticide Not Required. Uh, this is a game, it just came across my feed, I don't know much about it. It is a bullet heaven meets farming game. Um, the thing, like, looking at it, it's basically, it reminds me of, like, Vampire Survivors meets Atomicrops, if any of y'all saw that game forever ago. Let's see how this goes. Plant seeds by walking over empty farm plots, cool. Uh, move around or use LBRB to change the seed in my inventory. Walk near thirsty plants to water them. Okay. My water count is visible in the upper left. Okay. Walk near water to get more. Visit the merch ant at the end of each day to buy seeds and other goodies. Focus on buying weapon seeds. Buy weapon seeds in the shop and grow them. Harvesting multiple of the same weapon will level it up. Ooh, use movement direction or aim weapons or use twin stick controls. Uh, I want to do twin stick. Uh, finish. This is how I roll. Okay, we're planting some seeds, it looks like. I guess maybe these are like basic seeds. Oh, these are seeds for like the weapon that I currently have, I think. Which seems to only go to the left of me. So it's kind of like the starter whip of vampire survivors with a single attack so i need to man i should go looking around there's like minerals and stuff over there so i need to go zipping around once i kind of get to doing this let's get some more water let's really try and level this stuff up chalice crop growth speed attack frequency less apple spawns higher pickup range and knockback attack duration and projectile speed minus frequency and minus grit damage i need it a little bit faster let's go with this guy I don't know apples. I'm sure apples are like out in the wilds. Uh, projectile speed or planting, pickup range, resistance, move speed, attack size. Let's do speeds. Um, I think definitely worth it. So is this just like a level up thing, I think, right now? Mining yield when a fish is caught. Coin gain when a weapon is harvested, minus damage. Plus damage per 1% apple spawns, minus max health. Let's do a reroll. I don't know about those health regen effectiveness to future coin gain changes increase so there's some push and pull on this max health and resistance but minus crit chance let's go with health regen i feel like you know i'm gonna experience some issues now where is this merch ant see i'm gonna need to look around for this guy i assume that he spawns near base oh if i just sit here for a little bit i just auto mine that's cool Ooh, and that was a lot of money where is this merch ant He's not, like, inside the house, is he? What if I can get more farm plots? Probably, right? Oh, look! Oh, shop opened! There he is! Oh, okay, I thought it said at night, but I guess it's morning? Okay. Crossbow seed. Cro crow boom seed. Wood axe seed. Twin scythes seed. Pumpkin seed. Crop thirst XP yield. So the the... Okay, <laughs> I'm getting it a little bit. All right, we have 515. Let's go for place a scarecrow that explodes when an enemy walks into it. Chops down enemies in each diagonal direction. Slice on both sides simultaneously while rotating around you. I like that. Let's do max. Okay, which was two. Um, oh, and it looks like I can only buy one set of weapon seeds. Or did I just buy all of the weapon seeds? No, I think only one because I wasted 200. Okay, very unthirsty. <laughs> Very thirsty. Grapefruits seem very good. Wheat is what I've been doing. Very thirsty. Let's grab some of these grapefruits. All right, I grabbed as many as I could. We are Baroque as a joke. Let me swap. Wait. Did I not get them? I'm trying to cycle through my seeds. LBRB is not. Oh, up at the top. It's up at the top. Up to planting speed, up to growth speed, up to yield, minus to mining, minus to fishing. Oh. Let's go with beefy. Gosh, enlightenment's good, but you minus coins. Let's go with just beefy. Max health, attack size, damage. We're just going for like a basic thing, you know? What other seeds do I have? Because this looks like... I guess that's all my seeds? I'm, I'm trying to cycle through at the top, and it's not really doing it for me. But maybe I have to wait until there's space? I don't know. Or I already planted it all. I might have already planted it all. Might have been automatic. Oh yeah, because I got the... I got the scythes. Heck yeah. Okay. Let's get some more. Now, when it comes to watering, here's a question. Do these... Does going near that water count? It looks like it might. It looks like it might. Okay. Now my question is, do I want to get more grapefruits? Or... Oh, I'm out of seeds, period. Okay. 
So I need to buy a lot of seeds. I might want to buy a bunch of the wheat seeds then just so I have like a nice big backlog. I thought I had like infinite basic seeds, but I guess not. I guess not. But you get tons of coins from fighting these guys. So that's great. I would love to explore the map a little bit more, which maybe today I'll feel a little more comfortable doing that. Um, ooh, look at them gems. Okay. Now we have a bunch of radish seeds for 42. So these are the ones that are going to be the most... Um, you know, the best for me in terms of gaining more XP real fast, I think. But, okay. Orbits around you accelerating its speed over time while cutting down enemies. Spends a lawnmower towards a random enemy. Slows down after colliding. And Katana swipes downwards on your left or right side. Is that kind of what we already have? Let's buy one of those. And let's buy... Gosh, I cannot afford very many seeds. It's just two of those, right? Oh, stock eight. Do they come in? No, 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 that's their stock, not my stock. Okay, well, that's all we can do for right now, I think. It's fine. Right, I could have done a reroll, but, you know, it is what it is. Ooh, okay, I leveled up, nice. Resistance and attack size minus the frequency. Chance to gain an additional pet whenever recruiting one. Attack frequency, projectile speed, attack duration. Frequency is nice. Just attacking more often, I'm cool with that. Uh, crit chance and mining speed down to projectile speed. Projectile speed, attack frequency minus to knockback. XP gain, coin gain minus to move speed. Let's go with nimble limbs, I think. Okay, so seeds wise, we have already maxed out our seeds. So it's just about making sure we, um, what you call it, water them. So yeah, right now I'm going to go around mining because last time we found out that's a good way to, ooh, 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 getting surrounded a little bit here. Um, that's a good way to generate some extra cash, you know? Now let's go see if I can't get my weapon upgrade here in a sec. Because I'm assuming something has either, yeah, it's either needing to be watered or it has been upgraded. Okay. Ooh, apple. So I'm still not sure what the apples are. Because I don't think that they're big chunks of money. Maybe they are, you know? Okay, okay, jeez louise. This is such a neat little game though. Like obviously you don't get to the point where it's like, okay, difficulty is getting a little ahead. I'm wondering if there's meta progression. Apple spawn at the start of each day, max health, water capacity, minus mining, fishing speed, projectile speed, and planting speed. Let's go for the ones that don't cause us any negatives right now. Um, ooh, those katanas. Do they auto target or is it only to the left right now? Okay, I have a lot of stuff happening to the left, you know? Oh, interesting. Enemies despawn at the end of the day. Okay. All right. We got a ton of money today. All right. So let's get more scythe. And part of me wants to get a bunch more scythes, you know? Let's get one, two. What are these guys? Hay bale. Sends out an unstoppable hay bale in front of you that crushes enemies. Basically the whip from that one game that doesn't have vampires in it. We're going to max that one out. Okay, and then we're going to max out potato. Oh, potatoes take a lot of water, so I'm going to need to stick around. Grapefruits don't take a lot of water. They're kind of a set and forget. So we're going to max out the grapefruits. Um, maybe I should have taken something else, but this way I can do more of the, like, walking around, right? Because we noticed last time that going around and getting, like, minerals is real good. Like, that's the way you're going to get your big monies. Ooh, boss time? Our first boss. Our first boss. I hope you don't have any, like, uh, ranged weapons. Schmoop, schmoop. Schmoop, schmoop. Trying to aim my attacks, you know, get a little out of it. All right. I need to be getting money, though. And this stuff. Plus two amount, plus two attack size, plus two amount, plus the damage. Like, more damage. Let's get the attack size, um, amount or projectile speed, attack size, or damage. Ooh, attack size. This one, I like the idea of having it be way bigger. Okay, let's get some more monies. Like, obviously, I'm not doing a ton of damage to the guy. I am staying far away because I'm worried about these, like, um, crickets slash locusts. But at least the enemies right now seem to be moving a little bit slowly. So as long as I'm kind of on top of my location, this guy is going to be hard to kill, though. I don't think I'll kill him before daylight. Yeah, it's almost daytime. So that's interesting. Okay, let's water you. Okay. Oh, no, he's still here. Okay. Amount, crit, crit, damage. Amount, frequency, damage. Let's go amount, frequency, damage. Less about crit and more about hit. 
Okay, what do we got here? Bouncy balls, bounce between enemies dealing little base damage but high crits and knockback. Wood axe, chops down enemies in each diagonal direction. I like that. We got a bunch of money. I can afford... We'll do five. And then the other half we will do... More grapefruits, honestly. And I got 59 left, so we'll just go with that. We got some water. We're going to sit here, like, hovering this for a bit. I think I spent a lot of time getting money before, and now I would like to get upgrades. Because I need to be able to actually kill this guy, I think. And right now, that's difficult. Ooh, we got, like, some weevils going on now. Okay. Now, I can swim. I can swim. And this does not increase my water knockback and frequency fish spawns and ore spawns up but resistance down crop growth speed watering speed but crop yield down let's just do knockback and frequency again i don't want to like nerf my growth mechanics you know okay okay i need to do a big a wide run man this boss is going to take me like three rounds to kill that's hilarious all right i dig the whole like mining and fishing thing Projectile speed and frequency damage and attack frequency minus to crit. Let's do damage. Amount, damage, attack size, frequency. Attack size and frequency. So this one's diagonals, right? Oh, weird. Gosh, they all attack in a single direction and it's all to the left. All right. That, I need some kind of impact on that. Every single weapon does that? So far? Like, it's at all directions, right? All diagonals. But do I have to, like, upgrade it enough to get all the diagonals? Because, I don't know, I feel like it's not doing what it said on the tin. You know? All right, tons of money. Tons of money. So I think I need to upgrade it more in order to get it to actually attack in all directions. Just like everything else. All right, I want to do this before you leave. Okay. Let's get... Fires out a set of blades that fan out and then return to you. Ooh, bow and arrow. Or not bow and arrow. Boomerang. Uh, all of them. All right, now I will just stay back because we have a ton of seeds that I can be working on. Pumpkins. Let's do these. These have a better growth time. Okay, exit. I have a lot of things to both. How do I get more field space or maybe that's just a high limiter on this one almost got hit there man these uh these ants these guys are fast but you need to stay around my crops as much as possible to keep them wet because i would like to level oh he died awesome open the chest applies fast grow to crops making them grow faster look at the damage scales with level i might need the help from the cat but the capybara is too cute to pass him up so that's the one, I think, where if I had gotten that one thing that increases, like, enemies, or when you get a pet, you have a chance to get another pet. Maybe I would have gotten both. Mining, fishing, and planting, but damage and frequency up. Projectile speed and planting speed. Max health, move speed. We're, we're going with the, this one. Okay, okay, okay. Plant some more. Water, though. Let me get some water. Ooh, apple. Okay, oof. Amount, uh, plus four amount, hell yeah. I just need to be hitting things, you know what I mean? Oh my gosh, now we got a giant spoiler. All right, I'm a little worried now. Okay, crit damage, crit chance, attack size, resistance, health regen, pickup range, damage, watering range, water speed. Ooh, I like the watering range and speed because like I said, I'm just kind of hovering over here right now, trying to get these things to grow. Oh, and there's the wells too. I forgot about the wells. I'd love to know how to plant or how to get more planters, if possible. Do, 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 do. Oh, I love this. This is like chill vampire survivors. Like, it's still difficult. Don't get me wrong. Um, but it's like the pace is just a little bit slower, you know? More mower blades seems like a good idea. More whips is also a good idea. But let's go for the, the mower blades. I just feel like, you know, it's pretty good. Grapefruits again. Okay, which, what has the lowest growth time? The yams. They require a lot of water, but they got a good growth rate. So we're going to go with those. Eh. Okay, water. Let's grow some things. Uh, piercing. Heck yeah, plus four piercing. Frequency attack size damage. Projectile speed attack duration damage. 
Let's go the the more piercing. Oh yeah, look at that. Oh, does this one not aim? Oh my god. Nothing aims. Why does no weapon aim? <sighs> like, oh great, all above me. Yeah, what if what if they're all below me? What if they're all below me into the right? I'm useless. Crit damage minus the apple. Oh, apples heal. Got it. I guess we're going to do knockback. I could do one more reroll, but knockback's not a bad idea. Because I bet above me that'll work pretty well. Yeah. Okay, y'all. Get wrecked, please. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Okay. Okay. We're dodging. I think I got hit a little bit. My gosh, look at all this. All the death, all the destruction. Crit damage, coin gain, crop yield, apple spawns, minus to water capacity. Oof, I can't do minus water capacity. Already I'm struggling. Crit chance, crit damage, attack frequency, knockback damage. Let's do that. Please tell me you can circle around me a little bit more now. Okay, they're getting a little bit wider on the arc, so that's nice. But to the left, of course. Everything has a leftward bias. I don't like it. Oh my goodness. It's like, go to the lower left corner and then run in the direction uh, of the enemies. Man, there's so many enemies now. We're going to keep going with the mower blade for now because I want to get it to surround me. Um, and then, okay, and then that's the max because you only get so many just weapons in general. We are going to just wait on buying seeds. I have a lot to get through. So I don't think there's any reason for me to keep buying them. Uh, for now, if I can just save up my money and then we'll just get weapon ones. Because, like I said, like right now, I'm, I'm just struggling to even get my seeds done. Uh, fast grow! Ooh, or plant seeds for you. Let's do fast grow some more. I love the idea of plant seeds for me, but... Ooh, I should have done attack size. But these still do, like, hit everybody. Okay. When they're above me. Slash around me. Okay, run to the left, run to the left. It's your only chance. It's their weakness. The left. Ooh, wow. Are they, uh, well, we're not gonna get into the politics of it, but you know where I was going. Um. Okay. Got this guy. What day are we on? We're on day eight. Just trying to get an idea for how long this goes. Okay. Shop prices when weapons are harvested. That's neat. So this is like a growth one. It's like uh, in Balatro getting like a multiplier. Oh boy. Oh boy. All right. Need to circle around again. Would love to get close to my field. But y'all just keep on spawning, huh? Schmoop. Get him. Schmoop. Okay. Uh. Gotcha, 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 gotcha. Water the field, water the field, water the field. Okay. Okay. Plant the field, water the field. Plant the field, water the field. It's almost morning, I think. All right. This guy's still gonna be here, obviously, but, you know, we deal with that. Tons of money! Reach max level on the mower blades! Plus 999 piercing. Damage amount, piercing, projectile speed. I think we do this. I think it's better to be killing the ones that are nearby before we worry about all that. So, mowing blade, we reached max, so having five more seeds for it, I don't know what the value is. I could buy a pet! Bye! Yes, now we have the toucan as well. He's going to do the auto um, planting. So let's build up our wood axe then. So we're going to get one, two, three, four, five. And then we'll also get the sword. One, two, three, four. And then we're going to get the sides. That's the last bit. So now I have a little bit of a spread. And let's get some more. Grapefruits don't get very thirsty. Potatoes grow fast. Let's do the potatoes because we now have the auto planting as well. Look at this little beagle over here. Expand your farming plot. Oh! Woof, pet the dog. Expand your farming plot. That's what I needed to be doing. Okay, okay. I had been curious, now I know, now I know. Okay, look at all those mower blades. That's awesome. But they still don't surround me. They're max level and they still don't go everywhere. There's still issues at the bottom. Oh, man. Okay, okay, okay. I need to get around you. I'm going to have to probably take a hit or two. It's fine. 
All right, I need to be circling my my plots. But now that I know I'll be able to buy more plots, like that's all I'm going to spend money on for a little while. Obviously. Damage and attack frequency, crit damage and resistance, damage and crop thirst. Minus to crop thirst, but plus to their damage. We're going to go damage and frequency. Again, I just want to be attacking a bunch so I can just be kind of, you know, surviving. Ooh, he hit me a little bit, but I can get this now. Plant seeds, waters plants for you. The combo, y'all, the triple. These little guys, all of them together, are going to be giving me all the XP in the world. That's wonderful. The pets are great. Oh, and I get two capybaras. I thought I would just level up the capybara. All right, plus two, the amounts. Now, should we attack in every direction, please? Yes, okay, it goes all the way around us. Beep, boop, bop, boop. Great. Great. Okay. Fish spawns, fishing yield, damage, and knockback, attack size, crop yield, minus to apple spawns. We'll do that. Because I did get that thing early on that gives me regen. So I'm hoping that by just being good at dodging for a while, I can deal with the fact that my HP is not the best. Oh my gosh, look at all this money. We're going to head out this way first. Just to get as much of that as we can. And then let's go see this guy. Damage, fre attack frequency. And attack and growth, growth speed. Now let's do attack frequency first. Just the basic. Okay, we then want, let's get whip. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, and then we're gonna spend the rest on fast growing wheat seeds because I just need to be, oh no, I didn't mean to do, I meant to buy more stuff. I got so caught up in my thing. I got so caught up, it's fine. Crit damage, crit, chance, attack duration, damage and frequency. Consistency is my, my goal. Oh, wow. They're all fast now. Aphids? Oh, but they look- they also look like cows. They're bull aphids. I didn't realize that these are like... different kinds of critters. Oh boy, oh boy. We're- we're- we're dodging. We're going left and right. We're going all the ways. Pets! Thank you for doing my business for me. Damage and projectile speed. Let's do that one. Okay, knockback's looking good, pushing them away. Okay. Having the one that plants seeds, and then the one that waters seeds, the one that makes them faster. Heck, if I can get one that can harvest seeds? Okay. It's like, how long can I sit here before they get too overwhelming? It's really the... The spoder that I'm concerned about, but these guys, they seem to move slow enough for me. Okay, more field space price. Price defer. You have way too many. Uh, way too many seeds and not enough everything else. Oh, it's so much bigger. Yes, wonderful. Look at all of this. Look at all of that. Wow, wow, wow. See, I should have been leveling up so much more before. Accidental hard mode is what I would like to call what uh, has happened here. But that's great to know. That's great to know. Next time I play, I'll be upgrading that alongside myself the entire time. And uh, we'll be cool there. But honestly, like for a first run... Like, I'm getting a little overwhelmed here. I think we might be in a little bit of trouble soon. But maybe, just maybe, having bought all those giant fields now, maybe I'll start to, like, really rapidly uh, grow a little bit here. It's the goal. It's the goal. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Toucan, what you doing, man? Oh, I guess you're just waiting for stuff to, to be picked, huh? Damage, watering range, watering speed, but more thirst. Attack duration and crop yield. Heck yeah. Only goods. So a little elephant isn't like hyper speed when it comes to watering, but oh, that day it took longer to get to morning. Interesting. Okay, more soil. More soil. Ooh, another pet. Okay. What if I do a reroll? Oh, I was hoping for a different pet. Okay. Well, we'll buy a few of these as well. Exit. So that we can just kind of level it up. 
Do, 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 do. Projectile speed, crit chance, attack size, XP gain, and crit chance. Let's do projectile speed. Although I do think XP gain is a fantastic idea. Always. More watering! Fertilizes crops, increasing yield. Ooh! Y'all, the little friends. All of the little friends! Coin gain at the start of each day. Damage, resistance, minus to growth speed. Don't want that necessarily. We're going for a knockback and stuff. Helps a lot, we've noticed. Size and frequency. I'm not worrying so much about crits only because I've already taken stuff that kind of reduces crits. I've kind of gone for a more consistency build than anything else. Okay. Okay, my little ones. Let me get more water. Grab more water. It's just like constantly zooming around. These little bee guys are a little scary because of how small they are. Hard to see, you know? Yeah, I need a bigger watering can. So maybe I should have gotten the other elephant. Does seem like that might be my limiter. Fishing yield and damage, crop growth speed and attack frequency minus apple spawns. That's fine. If I get to the point where I need a bunch of apples, I think at this point I'll already be too far gone. You know what I mean? I've not been building up my resistance as much as I've been building up my offense. Okay. Ooh, look at all that. Shmeow. Zreow. Need to get over to my field. I wish I could pick up water from the the lake. Uh, knockback, minus damage, crit damage, fishing speed, damage. But minus mining speed, effectiveness to future coin gain changes. Oh, so that's like building... If I get another thing that gives me plus to coin gain, that would be more. That's an interesting one, because that's an only combo one that requires some other things. That's neat. Knockback and frequency, attack duration and crop yield, fishing speed. Okay, we're going to do attack duration and crop speed. Because, again, we're just going for trying to uh, get all this stuff covered. All right. We are going to buy a little more field. We are going to buy... Because, again, I'm probably good on weapons, right? Maybe not. Five of those. Just in case. And five of those. I assumed it wouldn't let me get them, you know? And then we'll get all these guys. Okay. Exit. So I just need to be doing everything I can to just constantly be over here. Look at all of this. Okay, I would like to be switching to my, my weapon-based ones first. Projectile speed, attack duration, attack frequency, damage, damage, knockback, attack size. Attack size sounds really good for me right now. Okay. Okay. Water, circle around. Effectiveness to future fishing yield spawns, fish spawns, knockback and attack frequency and pickup range. Let's do attack frequency. Ooh. Woo! So many of them. Now it's getting a little a little wild. It's the speed. It's the speed. I was talking about it earlier. It's really not so much about the their effectiveness as it is about just overall speed. If they move quickly, I can't kill them before they get to me as well. Amount and speed and attack size. Amount, damage, crit, damage, frequency. We're going to go with speed and attack size. Oh, yeah, they're constant now. Almost. More attack size. Yes. The bigger, the better. The more enemies hitting each other. Okay. Okay, that's good. That's good. We like seeing this. We like seeing all of this. Damage and crop growth speed, but enemy spawns are up. Let's do that. More enemies, but growing faster as well. Okay, see, now we're at the point where I have actually gone through all of my seeds, which is incredible. Amount, damage, attack size. So in the next one, we will buy the cheapest, fastest seeds we can. I might not, I'm not going to worry about getting more planting space now um, because I have more than I can use. See, if I had somehow... Um, if I had been doing this from the beginning, ooh, more crop yields, where I had the extra plots, I probably wouldn't have bought as many as I have. Okay, growth time. Uh, the fastest would be these guys. So I think we're going to max out on those before anything else. Yeah, and that's that. Um, there are the weapon seeds. We'll worry about those next time. 
Because, yeah, I just want to plant as many seeds as possible. With all these little dudes who can plant for me. Yeah, look how quickly that goes. We're almost fully planted. The water uh, necessities are pretty high. Damage and move speed. Double edge. Look, that's from Final Fantasy IX. Minus resistance plus the enemy spawns. Apples, healing, damage, and ore. Resistance, health, regen, pickup. Let's do this. Double edge. We're getting to the point where I'm like, I'm willing to risk. Because we're in such a precarious position. Oof, y'all. They're getting close, but my knockback and damage is pretty dang good. You know? Oh, boy, oh, boy. Move speed, resistance, crit chance, fishing speed, damage, attack duration, attack frequency, crop yield, resistance, and crit chance. I don't want to reduce my crop yield right now. Because I'm really focusing on my crops right now. Gosh, this game is neat. I really like it. I, uh, I'm recording this on a Monday. I might try and get this out immediately for y'all on, like, a Tuesday morning, even though... I, if you're watching this when it comes out, I'm probably streaming over on Twitch. Just so you know. Okay. Ooh, double boss! Okay. Okay. My goodness. Look at all this money, though. Wow. Wowzers. We're zooming around at the speed of frog. Going kind of slow, but it's all that I know. Oh, all these bugs, they are coming for me. But I am a frog, which means I'm gonna eat. Uh, attack duration, projectile speed. We'll just do the projectile speed on its own. 12k we got. All right, let's get a little more. I could get another one of these guys. We might. Uh, all right, let's get five of you. Well, there's 71 stock for these guys. Um, let's get five of you. Let's get five of you. Let's get the rest are y'all. Let's exit. Do, 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 do. I just love that I have the the elephant doing the watering for me just it helps when i have to like keep running pretty far health attack size damage let's do that frequency is also not a bad idea amount and damage and duration yeah let's do that Dude, the the crosses okay now i'm looking at my weapons okay Level three, level four, level two. So each seed is not like an upgrade. That's where I was kind of confused. I was like, is it an upgrade per or what? And it's like, no, each seed is like an XP chunk. So next I will buy a lot more weapon seeds to try and max them out. Uh, damage attack size not back. Okay. I'm curious if anything happens once you reach, you know, if there's like synergy things. I've seen some pretty wacky stuff in like the trailer. Uh, so I am curious about that. Collect 20 apples in a single run. All right, your boy's getting some achievements. Reach max level on Tongue Lash. Okay, cool. Crit chance, attack size, frequency damage. Let's do the one with more fangs. Oh gosh, ran right up in him. Cool, I didn't die immediately. That's nice. I was worried about that. Okay. Ooh, boy. What time is it? How long has this run gone? 30 minutes. Way longer than I expected for my first run. I wonder how many days there are. I wonder... If it ends or if it's just endless. Okay. Seeds are all already planted. Whoa! Wumbo! What? What happened? How did this? Why? Why did this? How? I survived summer. Retrieve loot drops for you. Waters plants. I had just, I had just said I wanted something like that. Chivo's unlocked. Reach max on mower. Reach max on tongue. Survive summer. Win a run with Joe. Eliminate a boss while Wumbo. Collect 20 apples in a run to unlock Dr. Hop's frog. <sighs> this game is so cute. Wow. Damage. 999,000 on that one. 528,000 on that one. 1.149 million on the katana. 490,000 on the axes. I expected this one to be the most. 2 million on the mower blades. Y'all, I won the first run. I won the first run. Okay, we're going to keep going. Y'all know how I like to do. I like to do long videos. I'm going to take a quick break myself. Uh, I just got a text, so I assume that's from Chrissy, so I need to figure some stuff out. Um, but I'll be right back. Oh, hold on. Okay, we're in a little house. I'm not going to do anything. We'll do this right when I get back. Oh, hey, it's 2 o'clock. All right, let's see what we got in this like room that we have now. I'm guessing this is the meta progression. Um, 
I'm wondering if we were supposed to win on the first run or if I just, you know, got lucky, did well, whatever. Um, very curious. Okay, what do we got here? Chivos! We unlocked, we unlocked a Hopsfog! <laughs> I'm so excited. I'm so excited. I didn't know there were, like, other characters or anything like that, so I'm stoked. Plant 50 crops in one day. That can totally be done. Win a run with less than 10% health. Like, less than 10% left, yeah. 200 or higher max health. Reach 75% or higher coin gain. Reach 20 water capacity. I didn't see any way to increase water capacity, but maybe that was like, maybe there's an item that does, or like a weapon, and we used, we got all of our weapons. Reach 100% or higher projectile speed. Finish around without getting hit. Possible, I'm sure. Went around with less than 100 crops harvested. Catch fish 50 in one run. Catch or mine 50 ore in one run. Occupy all farming plots. So far, 48 is the max. Harvest 500 in one run. That I would like to go for. Get 10 pets. Reach 75% or higher crop yield. Land a triple crit. Reach 75% or higher growth speed. Okay. 50% or higher enemy spawn. Okay. So a lot of this is just like focus a build and get real far on it. Okay. Well, let's let's pick this guy. Plus to max health when an apple's collected. Oh, at max health and more apple spawns. Plus projectile speed and movement speed. Effectiveness. Okay, he's apple focused because an apple a day keeps the hops away. Um, but minus a thousand health regen, minus the healing, minus the frequency of attacks. So it's very much you need to be collecting apples, it seems. Okay. Interesting. Is there another thing? Maybe we have to wait and then this stuff will get built? What's in here? I assume this is back out onto the farm. There's a well. Okay, no, this seems like something else. Like, this might be meta progression. Like our, our meta farm, you know? It must be. Must be. Okay. Can I get things to plant here? Can I buy things for here? I'm wondering if the game is gonna, like... Okay, there's no, like, other menu. Okay. So I'm guessing it'll just slowly unlock these things for us. Because we did this, right? We know we have the bedroom. So maybe next run, it will unlock one of these as well. Um, we looked at this, so we know a bunch of the Chivos. Whoa, there's way more. It was the characters that I looked like before. Survive different times. Oh, right, because that was summer one. So that was basically the easy month, I'm sure. Okay. So some of these you get gems for. That's interesting that you get gems. Are gems external currency? And what do we use them for? Select a season. Autumn one, winter one. So we can pick all the other seasons or we can stick with summer. Let's go with spring. I wonder if there's modifiers to these. Like, oh, you get less seeds or yields. You know, one's more difficult than the other. Okay, is it only going to be to the right of me? This one's a hard one because of how slow it is. I need to be mining. I think that's what I'm going to need to be doing. Where are the minerals for me? I think this is going to be my best way to get stuff early on until I get another weapon, you know? So maybe I try and even focus a little bit on mining, you know? I need to smash you. Smash. At least it hits a bunch of them. It's a slow attack, but it's an AoE. And I could probably make it even bigger. I would love it if I could get more so it goes two sides. You know? If I can get it to go both sides, then that'll be great. Okay, so I get max health whenever I grab one of those. So it behooves me to grab every apple. Obviously, I could leave some on the ground because that would be, you know, heals. Come on. Come on. Smash. Cool. Thank you. All right. I know I'm taking a little bit of damage, but that's kind of part of the risk I'm willing to take. Fast and frequent. Attack frequency, projectile speed, crit damage. Let's... Damage and move speed. This increases enemy spawns immediately, but... Doing that early on actually might be, you know, easier, more coins, you know? Okay, what weapons can we get? Because that's what I need to focus on, pretty much. Let's get... Okay, I think the boomerang will try. I think I should just try, you know, whatever's new. And mole turret. Ooh. I like that. One of those. And then... Yield-wise... I think potatoes... 
if I can get them all growing, you know, done. Like the problem with these are like plot spaces, right? Limited area. Okay, let's do this. I see an apple. Let's get our max health up and get that last little bit of healing back. I see some minerals down here, so we're gonna go mine these. Smash, smash, smash. Ooh, he's got, he's got big going on. Knockback, mining speed, damage, minus the fishing speed. Attack frequency, projectile speed, attack duration. You know what, we're gonna go with the mining. I think, like I said before, I think mining is gonna be a much more significant part of this build early on. Frequency and watering speed, minus to ore spawns. Don't wanna do that. Coin gain. Move speed, apple healing, crop thirst. We'll do that because it boosts apples. Which, you know. Because if there's a thing later on that's like, oh, apples um, also give you a boost to attack speed or damage or, you know, temporary, you know, whatever kind of thing, as sometimes happens in uh, games like this. Um, that'd be cool. Okay. Yeah, we're getting good. Uh money off of like doing the mining and stuff because I do really want to get the larger crop space but it's going to cost me like 1200 or something right so I don't think I'll be able to afford it today oh look at that little mole turret I want to level that guy up so hard oh I need water okay uh, attack duration and crop yield. Damage, attack duration, frequency, minus to crop yield, plus 20% knockback. Let's go plus crop yield. If anything, I'd love to go for a crop yield build. That'd be neat. Ooh, golden retriever. How much to, oh, it only costs 440 for the first one. Perfect. Okay, let's get another boomerang. What's this guy? Tadpole spews, spews out a bunch of little tadpoles in a cone. We'll get that. We'll get that. And then with our last little bit, let's get some, let's get some pumpkins. We're going to have more space so I can get those started and let them sit and not worry so much about them taking up too much space. Okay. It's nice having the boomerangs. What are the, what are the, okay, no, no, that's just, that's just spring. I was like, what are the pink petals that are falling? Are those mine? Crop growth and watering speed, minus to yield, hmm, minus to yield, or increased fishing. What's the fishing doing? Is it worth money? I guess we'll go with the, let's do a reroll. I have a couple of those always, right? Attack frequency, XP gain, crit chance, projectile speed attack frequency. Let's go with gain and crit chance, you know? Now, do the, the boomerangs actually target enemies? No. Seems like they just kind of go. Okay. Okay, we're going to go looking for some apples. And looking for some minerals. Do, 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 do. I wonder if that dog will be for sale again or if it'll be different critters. Minus enemy damage, but minus to my damage. Attack size. Frequency, watering speed. Minus to response. Let's do attack size. Oh, cool. There's the cone of uh, tadpoles. Neat. Neat. Okay. And it goes in the direction I'm facing, right? So that's also really helpful. Once I get that boosted, that'll be a nice little... It's almost like daggers. I mean, it's funny. Oh, wait. Is it only to the right? Please tell me it's not only to the right. I thought it said it goes in the in, in front of you, but maybe in front always means to the right. Uh, it's a little frustrating. Feels like that's not exactly in the spirit of what that's supposed to be like. Maybe these cost more every round that increases. Pet is not available. Sucks. Um, but we will spend that. Then we got lawnmower, water beam. Blast a beam of water. Ooh. Well, let's buy five of those. I could buy six. But I want to buy some XP things. Ooh, let's get the watermelons. And then the rest will get these guys. Cool. Okay. Let's get everything planted. So yeah, it's all to the right. That's too bad. That's so frustrating. I love the mole turret. Whoa, what's that guy? Is that like a... 
A wasp, maybe? The tail is the only thing that looks, it looks more scorpion than wasp, right? But it also only has like four legs, so maybe it's something mutated, you know? Do, 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 do. Water beam, amount, attack size and damage. Let's see. Oh, neat. Ooh, love it. If we can get the duration on that increase, that'll be nice. Ooh, yeah, and the damage. But like duration, if we can have it almost always going. Gosh, that'd be incredible. Frequency is good. Crit chance of mining speed, but minus the speed, move speed, apple, healing, crop thirst. I think that this is good for us. Atta uh, projectile speed, I think, will apply to the um, that, which means that it will rotate faster, which I think uh, would be very helpful. All right, yeah, give me these, give me these apples. Do, 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 do. Move speed, crit damage, fishing speed, damage and attack frequency. We'll do that. Okay. Um, let's start leveling up our weapons more. So let's go one, two, three. One, two. One, two. I would like to get... Let's go five of those, five of those, yeah. I think that's good. It's like I want enough seeds to really be taking advantage of, you know, my field. But you also want the ones that have the high yield. Yes, that rhymed, didn't mean for it to. Okay, man, give me the elephant. I need the elephant. Water my plants while I'm gone, friendo. Okay. Ooh, is this like a rare one? Fish spawns up, ore spawns up, apple spawns up, plus the enemy spawns, minus the growth speed. I hate reducing the growth speed. All the spawns up. Let's, let's reroll. Mining yield when a fish is caught. Pick up range and knockback, attack duration and projectile speed, but minus frequency and crit. Let's, okay, direct, uh, duration and projectile speed, yes. That's kind of what I asked for. Projectile speed, a frequency, amount, and attack size. Let's do more of them. They're piercing, right? So I think that that kind of... Growth speed and water capacity. Watering range. These are both real good. Um, I know that it reduces my apples, which is kind of like the opposite of what I should be doing. Um, in many respects. Not necessarily, though, right? Piercing... Amount and speed and damage. Let's do amount and speed and damage. Uh, attack size, frequency, speed, damage, damage way up, and duration up. I want frequency. I just want it out more consistently. That's good. I do want more damage on it, though, because it's, you know, not perfect. Ah, that was a whiff on that beam. That was much better. Okay, more attack size, more XP and coin gain, damage attack. Let's do the attack size. I don't think there's a downside to that. Eek! I do think I was doing a lot more damage last time. I might have just picked very good weapons early on. Who knows? This guy's still going. Sup, man. How you doing? I need to level up my weapons. I think that's a big thing. I need to level them up more. Plant seeds, waters plants. Waters plants. Because that's the thing that I'm more consistently missing because I have to run away, but I can usually get them planted. Apple spawns and knockback. We can lose max health, yeah. Um, okay. Cat does attacks enemies damage scales. Sure, we want cat. All right, I can get up to eight. One, two, three. Four. Okay, and we're going to do the same with the tadpoles. I think that one to me seems like a better one to upgrade. And then let's get a couple of these guys. 
couple of these guys. Okay. And maybe next time we will get more um, land. Because I do think I'm starting to utilize this pretty well. But I don't think I've needed more land just yet. We've gotten through all of our seeds, I think. So I think maybe getting a little more land and buying a... I should probably buy a ton of seeds. That's probably what I should be doing. I think I need a lot more boosts. Attack frequency damage and knockback. Let's do it. So like this time I got weapons, but I think next day I want to get some... Let's add the piercing. Uh, I want to get some like uh, passive upgrades now. I've gotten a lot of good upgrades for my weapons. Attack, size, pickup range, watering range, but minus to frequency. Let's go with size. Like, I know that that other one would have also given us that other stuff, but again, I'm, I'm focused on making sure to keep growing. You know? Okay. Whoop. All right. Do, do, do. Question, guys. Okay, okay, okay. Oh yeah, that's nice. Now, I would love to get the dog because the dog does retrieval for you. You know, because he's a retriever. Um, okay. We are going to get... Cauliflowers are kind of a mid. Oh, I think potatoes are... I mean, yeah, the... The thirst level is a little bit higher on the potatoes, but I mean, you know. Let's go with the potatoes for now, mostly. Eight, nine. And we will get one of each of these. And then the rest we will spend on these guys. Fast going. Okay. Do, 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 do. Apple spawns and knockback. Mining yield, but nine is to fishing speed, attack duration, projectile speed. Let's go with the mining yield up. I haven't been fishing, haven't been focusing on fishing at least. So, uh, yeah. Do, 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 do. We're running! Nice. Okay, piercing, frequency, size, knockback, damage. You know, normally I would go for this because it's frequency, it's attack size, all that, but I want a big damage boost. I need something that's doing some more hits, you know? So if these boomerangs can kind of start hitting a little harder, then I would love that. I'd love to boost my little turret guy too, you know? Cross grow faster. Cool. The combo. Coin gain when a weapon is harvested. That's cool. Fishing speed and... Let's do a reroll. Damage and frequency. Damage and attack size. More enemies. Crit chance and attack size. Minus the resistance. Let's get the summoning blade. There's a pink one. Okay, now I'm curious. Um, there is a little thing in the lower left. Let me Let me look at this. Okay, cool. I can look at all my items and stuff this way. See all the pets up at the top. And where our items are at. Okay. And we're on day seven. All right. Um, attack frequency and watering speed minus to ore spawns. Health regen, pickup range. I love the health regen and pickup range. Although I don't know if the health regen is even effective in any way. Because our health regen is minus 1,000, right? I think it's just like impossible to have regen with this character. I think that's kind of the, the downside. Minus shot prices, plus to move speed, minus to health. If I look at my menu, how, can I look at the actual number of health? I have 126. So losing 15 isn't that huge. Fishing, frequency projectiles. Oh, let's do that one. Fast and frequent. I like that. Okay. Oh, our little capybara. Our little elephant. Okay. Should look around for some minerals and some apples. Okay. Mine. Yeah, I was gonna say, 
I mine a lot faster now, so figured it might work. All right, apple and apple. And let's go here. Let's grab all this. Okay, cool. We're going to get a little more soil. Uh, and then we're going to get one, two, three, four of you. One, two, three, four of you. One, two, three, four of you. We are going to get five of these. We are going to get five of those. The rest of the money will go on there. All right, we're cool. Nice. Um, crop yield and apple spawns minus the capacity. I could do that, actually. More mining yield, though, as well. Let's get that. Because I don't know what happens when you max out a passive, if maybe it, you know, can go into the whole, like, synergy stuff. Um, like other similar games, so... I would be curious on that. Elephant, do your thing. Goodness, these guys. They're beefy. They're a little beefy. Uh, amount, frequency, projectile speed, attack damage, damage. I mean, piercing is nice. For sure. For sure. Alright, are we planting? Are we planting? Yeek! Oh man, I wish I could control the direction of my attack. <gasps> oh my god, I can! Oh my god, y'all. Y'all. It's twin stick. I can actually aim. I can actually aim. I didn't know this. I beat the whole first level without moving my stick. So when it says in front, it means you point it. Wow. Wow. I'm so used to... Uh, oh, look at that. I'm so used to Vampire Survivors where you do not aim, you know? Um, crop yield and spawns, frequency up, but effectiveness to future frequency changes is down. Enemy loot up, enemy health up. Let's do the crop yield. I'm okay losing the three capacity because we increased by three capacity. So, okay, now I'm gonna be even, I'm gonna be so good. Watch, now that I know this, I actually end up doing way worse. Oh my goodness. Oh, I'm so silly. Okay. Let us do this. We definitely want the toucan. We want a little more space. We're going to focus on upgrading this guy. But we will also get a little bit of this. Okay. Do I have any more money? No, not enough. Okay. Oh my gosh, that's so silly. That's hilarious. That is hilarious. Okay, I need to escape. Just because now I can actually, you know, go in a direction, uh, you know, follow that direction. It's pretty nice. Okay. Wow. That's so hilarious. Minus to coin game, plus uh, so many enemy spawn boosts. Let's do the mining speed real quick. Um, again, I don't think the enemy spawn boost thing is necessarily bad because I gained a ton of money, right? Ooh, look at all the minerals. Let's get those going. Clear me out, please. Okay. So the longer I like take a little little bit of a stop. Oh cool, he's dead. Awesome. Waters plants, fertilizes. Let's do that. Let's go. A little bit of each. I would love to get the dog. Plus to damage, plus to move speed, minus resistance, plus to enemy spawns. Apple spawns, healing, damage. Apple spawns, knockback. Let's do the that. Apple spawns literally will replace that health. Um, damage, attack duration, attack size, knockback. Crit chance, crit damage, attack frequency, projectile speed. Let's do that one. Okay. Okay, let's grab a little bit extra money. I don't know how late he stays open or if he just goes away after the first time. Um... But, you know. Okay. Soil. Let's get five. Let's get ten tadpoles. Let's get five grapefruits. I want to get a couple of them and then the rest of those. Exit. Okay. Now, let's grab some of this money while it's easy to access. Okay. 
Damage and frequency. Move speed. Apple healing. Let's do this one. Okay, amount, crit damage. Okay, now we will do some piercing. As much as I would love the more amount, now I think having them all pierce with this many enemies spawning is going to be really nice. Kind of shooting behind myself here. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Let's see if we can't find us some apples, huh? Oh, what's hitting me? Was there a guy on top of me, or...? Oh boy, there's an apple. Oh boy, and that's a big guy, though. Okay. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! Okay, 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 okay. Are there any apples? Ah! Down this away. Come on, Dr. Hops Frog. Okay. Grab that one. Grab that one. Grab that one. There's two of them. Oh, no. Um, I would love to just max out on the little dude. Then... Max out on the raspberries. Long growth time, but just... That means I won't have as much... Uh, as many that I have to cycle through, you know? Um, more piercing, or... Let's do this one. More of the amounts. Okay. So we've reached the max on that, so that's neat. Damage and knockback. XP gain up. Let's do the, uh... XP gain up, to be honest. Uh, attack duration and speed. Damage and move speed. Attack size per 1% resistance. What's my resistance at? Minus seven. <laughs> uh, well, let's do that guy, I guess. Wow, I do not do enough damage. Okay. Oh boy. Oh boy. All right, I might be in trouble here now. The no health regen is rough. Okay. Damage and duration. Amount, frequency, and crits. Let's do damage. Uh, amount, piercing, projectile speed, and damage. Save me, little turret. Save me. Amount, duration, size, and damage. Let's do the piercing a little bit. I need these guys to protect. Oh boy. Oh boy! This may be the end! Uh... A lot of piercing. Just take out all the enemies, my little friends. Give me that! Oh, dang! He got me. I thought maybe I would get away with it. Okay, okay. Apple. Apple. Oh, gosh. Oh, dear. Survive until morning. Oh, awesome. Okay, okay. Give me that apple. Knockback, mining speed, damage, XP gain, crit chance, projectile speed, attack frequency. Reach 100% or higher. Projectile speed. Cool. All right. Took out one of them at least. Get another cow. Let's, um... Let's get a bunch of them. I need some XP growth. And I need it fast. Okay. Uh, exit. Okay. Let's get all this stuff planted as soon as possible. Oh, money. Dang, I should have grabbed this before I went to the shop, right? Retrieves loot! Awesome. Awesome. Go, puppy, go. What? I have one of every pet! Is that a thing? Because that should be a thing. Duration, size, damage, damage, crit damage. I just want a lot of damage. I need something that's throwing damage down the, down the field. Growth speed, water capacity, minus the spawns, knockback, mining speed, damage, attack frequency, watering speed. God, at this point, I'm not really mining that much. You know? Do, 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 do. Though there is that achievement that's like mine 50 veins or whatever, right? So, if I can, I should. How many days are there? I wonder. 
Look at my little turret moles. Oh wow, oh wow. Help me out here, help me out here, world. Come on, come on. Frequency up, please! Oh, I'm in trouble. I'm in trouble, Bubble. Where is an apple? The health frog needs an apple! I see one over there. I also caught a fish, apparently. Oh, thank goodness. Okay. Uh, we would like... More of this guy, and more of this guy as well. And let's get some more space, and let's get some of this guy. Maybe five more of those, then let's get five of you, and five of you, and the rest on you. And let's exit. Okay. Ooh, boy. Uh, move speed, mining yield, fishing spiel, uh, the fishing spiel. Minus to attack size, minus to health. Gosh, let's reroll. I don't want to lose any more health at this point. Again, health regen. I don't think I can come back from minus 1,000 health regen. Effectiveness to future fishing yield changes. Fish spawns per plus 1%, minus to attack size, minus to gain. Well, let's do this one. Uh, amount. So infinite piercing seems pretty good to me. Plus 30% damage, though. The piercing is just necessary once we get to so many enemies, I think. Uh, knockback and frequency. Let's do that. Let's grab some money. Let's go look around for some apples. Gosh darn it. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Let me through! Let me throw! Okay, 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 okay. Alright, got an apple. Wow, the healing on the apples, though, is not that good. <laughs> Maybe I've reduced it too much, because I think I've done it once or twice. Oh boy. Oh boy! This is dangerous times we live in. The bonk hammer! Go up in amount and let's go up in frequency and amount and knockback and damage per plus one percent move speed. So if I get this, this is going to do a good job boosting my attack frequency. I'm not going to get any more boost to attack frequency, but to be honest, I think we're close to the end of the day or the of the round so i'm gonna go with it oh actually what's my what's my boost to move speed right now plus 20 percent so i could get plus 10 percent damage we'll do attack frequency water beam max damage frequency size duration speed or way more amount and damage let's do the higher damage i think i get that having it basically like eight of them instead of four is pretty good Attack size. Oh boy. Oh boy. I wish harvesting a crop healed you a little bit, you know? It's food, come on. Okay, big guy. Can I kill you real fast? I think I can. Give me your stuff. Um, more enemy damage or more crop yield? Let's get another cat. All right, where are we at on our weapons? Okay, we need to boost the hammer, but that's it. So let's do like 15 of those, 20 of those. There's no way it needs more than that. Okay, then we're gonna go that, five of those, max out on those, and now we got a ton of seeds, we're good. Okay, I want to try and stay here as long as I possibly can. I do think at this point, harvest one of at least each crop type in one run. Oh god, oh god, this guy is like right on top of me. This is hard to see. Frequency per knockback, damage, attack size, enemy spawns, enemy speed, damage, okay. I don't want to make the enemies worse. Okay, sure. Okay, okay, okay. Hee <laughs> This is worrisome. 
Okay. All right. Okay. Here we go. We're doing the thing. Okay. Okay. Let me get back to my field. So maybe I can harvest some things to give myself a little bit of an advantage. Amount damage duration. Sure. Amount size knockback. Amount damage frequency. Oh, now it hammers in a lot of different directions. That's cool. Okay, there's an apple right over here. Help. Help. Help! Dr. Frog is in trouble, man! Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy, okay. There's an apple down here. There's some crops down here. Amount attacks by his frequency, knockback, and damage. Let's do that. Oh my god, three, four bosses. Okay, another dog. Buy. Let's buy a bunch of land, okay? Let's get a bunch of those. Bunch of those. Max out on those. Okay. Okay, let's try and survive. Um, I think this might be the last one, because I just damage-wise, I don't think I'm doing enough. I need a big damage boost. 5% damage, I don't think it's going to do it. But it's better than nothing. We're just going to slowly move along, Mr. Frog. Oh boy, oh boy, I think we're coming up on the end of it. Oh goodness. It is just... Move slightly along. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. I'm trying to take my little openings, but I have to be careful because when my moves are going, it's kind of hard to see the enemy sometimes. I saw an apple fall back there, gosh darn it. Okay. Come on. Day's got to be almost over. Occupy all the farming plots at once. Look at that. Your guy. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Wumbo! Yes! Oh, made it. I made it! Oh, okay, cool. So it's like day 15, it seems. I love this. It's just the... Just the smash it. Ooh, it was close too, y'all. That was close. Alright, we reached a bunch of max levels, so what do we unlock? Plotty Frog. Bubble Frog. Collier Frog. My goodness. I love them. I love them. All right. Let's keep going. Let's continue. Let's see what happens in our home. We got a bunch of the gems. Is that our kills? 5502. Maxed out every weapon. One of every pet. I feel like that should have been an achievement. Or maybe it's going to be more than that. Or maybe there's like a vet character. That would be so cool. Oh my gosh. Someone tell Anna. All right. What's happening over here now? Boobity boobity. Kitchen. Oh, here it is. Here it is. Okay, so move speed. Okay, so this one is for planting. This one is for like your stats, your base stats. And then this one is maybe economy. Coin gain, move speed, pick up rate. So it's like support. Wow, what's the bo uh, boost? Crop speed. Wow, okay. And we have 12,000. So I think I'll like spread it across a little bit. Let's get some damage. Buy it. Okay, buying one gets you the unlock to the next tier. Okay, cool. Crit chance, speed, resistance. What's up here? Duration, health on level up. Where's the one that gives XP? I'd love whatever gives more XP, whatever gives more gold. Gem gain, move speed, pickup range, rerolls, enemy loot, knock back, XP gain. Okay, so oh well, that's for apples. What about these guys? Planting speed, watering range, apple spawns, fishing yield, mining, crop yield, crop thirst. Okay, maybe nothing actually gives straight up XP. Okay. Okay. 
but it's like by doing stuff for plants that's how you're going to boost your xp okay let's get a little bit of projectile speed let's get a little bit of attack duration right now i'm just kind of um getting going in the the direction here it doesn't i like this it doesn't look like it's like vampire survivor where as you get higher and you're trying to get the higher ones the prices go up maybe it is and it's just it's slower but um yeah Okay, planting speed. I do really think getting a lot of, um, and by what I just said, I mean like the base price, right? So this price is going up, obviously, but the price of these other items is not going up. Whereas in Vampire Survivors, there's like an overall slow increase for every item, basically making it so like as you get further into the game, it costs more to be able to do it, which I get it. It makes sense. It's a balancing thing. Um, okay, pickup range, yes. Gem gain, win weapon, and coin gain. And what's this guy? Minus shot prices. Hell yeah. Oops. I still have a little more to spend. Um, let's get... I do really think... Buying some more of the watering and the planting. And let's build... Oh, boosted fishing per mining and boosted mining per fishing. This is going to be some great... Uh, <laughs> it's reminding me of uh, WoW when I played WoW back in the day of like trying to get stats that boost each other. So there's like this like nice... Every time you get a boost, it's a much more massive boost. Um, yeah, let's do a little bit of that. A little bit of both of those because then I can unlock crop yield, which I think will be nice. Okay, minus the crop, there's going to be a good one. Plus the water capacity! Permanent water capacity boost? Yes. Health regen would be wonderful. Oops. I keep it in B when I don't need to. Plus 0.1 max health on level up. I mean, it's not nothing. And base piercing. Okay, see, these are the ones that you want to get at the top, which are like the real level boosters right xp gain when you gain an apple rerolls on level another reroll right crop growth uh speed incredible because these are like permanents right this is like every time you harvest a crop you gain plus 0.2 percent crop growth speed for that round right so it's cascading and i think it's the same for a lot of these um so this one probably like plus two percent xp gain when an apple is collected that doesn't mean Oh, okay, I got plus 2% for a little bit. It means like every apple you eat is going to be another plus 2%. Um, so, very cool. Do we have enough to buy another thing? I think... Oh, let's get some more move speed then. Cool. Uh, all right. So then, do we have anything? Okay, well, here's our bed again. I guess maybe it shows it like that. Either that's a day one glitch, because this just came out today. Or it's a uh, thing because we unlocked new characters, new frogs. Okay, whoa, who? Human. 50% effectiveness to future projectile speed changes, effectiveness to future duration, future attack frequency, bad crit, bad at boosting damage. So he's all about like throwing a bunch of them very fast, like chip damage. Good to know. We did the frog. We beat one with the frog. Damage when an ore is mined, mining yield at the start of each day, ore spawns, effectiveness for mining. So he's mining, mining, mining focused. Minus to damage, minus to enemy loot yield. So it's really all about mining. That's neat. I like that. Plotty, fishing yield per occupied farming plot, mining yield per occupied farming plot, minus to crop growth speed. Wow. Which actually mo that boosts that well because it just means like you can like plant them at the beginning of the day. And once you have all the fields, that's a lot, right? Um, but then at the end of the day, you can grab them. So you want like slower growing, bigger yield um, plants to occupy all of them. Plus the percent to future max health changes, damage per max health, ooh, okay. Minus damage, minus effectiveness to future move speed changes, minus effectiveness to future damage changes. So he's all about health. The, wow, the, the different characters in this are significantly different, like max health, max health, max health, max health. Damage, not worth it. Attack speed, not worth it. Everything, uh, or actually, move speed, not worth it. But max health, max health, max health. Big time. Okay. Oh, boy. Well, I think, you know, I was I was liking trying to mine a bunch. So I think we'll go with Collier or Collier. I don't know. Um, I know someone whose last name is that, and it, they pronounce it Collier. So that's how I'm going to pronounce it. Is there anything we can do out here yet? I'm assuming it will tell us when we can. 
Okay. Um, all right. I'm again going to take a little break here in between rounds. Um, for y'all, this will be like instant. Um, so yeah, see y'all in a bit. All right, y'all. Let's uh, jump back in. We did our upgrades. We changed our character. More things to worry about. Okay, 10 pets in one run. There it is. Um, catch 50 fish. We mined 50 ore, so that's how we got him. Land a triple crit. Bean frog. That's if you harvest. Look at this little guy. Did we look at him? Okay, his image is messed up in here. Is it messed up out here? I think, because if we look at him here, he looks like a little farmer guy. So I think that the images got swapped for a different guy. Um, that's my guess. Okay, let's go mining build. I love the idea behind this. Uh, we will try autumn. We're gonna go through all the first, on the, the, the stage one ones. Part of me feels like spring might have been harder, but that might have just been because of the build that I had. Um, so let's see. Now, what is the weapon that we have? Oh, look, I think this is randomly throwing the bombs. Yeah, I don't have much control over that. Okay. So what I'm going to want with this one then is increased frequency. So I have a better like spread. I'm sticking around here, you know? I mean, I guess there's just because I have reduced crop yield stuff doesn't mean I shouldn't plant, right? Or maybe I should, I don't know. Like, I'm trying to think, like, they're still going to give me stuff, right? Oh, I wonder if the different times of year have longer nights. Maybe not, but I, I could see that being a thing. And then that leading to, like, maybe more difficulty. Oh, right. That's right. Enemy spawns give me, like, nothing. But mining gives me a ton. So I need to be just mining as much as I can. And I want to upgrade mining stuff every opportunity I get. Right? Okay, shop is opened. Let's do this real quick. Crit damage and coin gain. Fish spawn and ore spawns. Let's do that. Mining yield. Let's do mining yield. Uh, damage, attack. Okay, max health, attack size and damage. Damage, attack size and crop yield. We're going to do beefy. Again, even though like crop stuff isn't so great for us. Um, you know what we can do though? Let's get Weed Whacker. Orbits around you, accelerating speed over time. Okay, I love that. Unstoppable hay bale. Let's um let's get both of these. Because there's only two, right? And then like honestly, I'm gonna buy some soil on the cheap. And I guess all of these are roughly the same, to be honest. These ones have the lowest thirst so then i got <clears throat> i spend less time around but yeah we want to do our weapon ones first absolutely attack size and water capacity damage and crop thirst move speed mining yield fishing yield yes because we're already kind of abandoning crop yield anyways right all right is everything planted mostly look at these daddy long legs this is so definitely the seasons change which enemies are around um do ore spawn everywhere? So far, I've seen them in, like, this corner and then in the mining spot. The, like, kind of area over there that I th I'm assuming is a mining spot. I haven't really seen them in the upper right, I feel like, but I, maybe I just don't spend enough time up there. Come on. Gimme. Give Gimme give that money. And I need my weapon plants to grow, please. Attack size when an ore is mined. Love to see it. Love to see it. Okay. Oh, whoa, the weed whacker. Okay. Okay, it does have a timer on it, though. So I thought maybe it was like a constant orbital. But I bet, again, like, as often as the case with these things. Okay, let's get this ore first, because it's going to be a nice little boop. Now, let's be looking at my... What is it that this did again? Wait, did I not grab it? I did. Attack size when an ore is mine. So let's look at attack size. We're at plus 12%. Um, okay, he can fertilize for me. Less important. Bouncy ball. Well, I haven't tried this guy. So let's get that. 
Let's buy another soil again. Because, like, it really doesn't matter to me to plant these guys. So we'll get the, the biggest ones to take up the least spots. Plus damage per move speed. Crit chance, crit damage. Planting speed, crop growth speed, crop yield. No. Max health and health regen. Totally worth it, I would say. Yeah, let's do that. Okay. Weapons are planted. Let's grab some of you. You all watered? Yes, seems like it. Okay. Pickup range and knockback. Damage, crit damage, frequency, watering speed, minus to ore spawns. No, we'll do the pickup range and knockback. Knockback will help me to be able to sit like a little more still to unlock things. I'm just trying to get my weapon here. Ooh, cool. There's a thing to mine. Uh, amount or damage and attack duration? Amount. Let's just get a bunch of these going around. Oh, cool. I like that. They kind of curve as well. So it's almost a little like a uh, chain lightning in a way. Okay. All right, let's get to mining. And I should look around in the other corners, see if any minerals have spawned. My question is, do they despawn over time? Or is there just like, oh, wow, that one respawned immediately, huh? That's cool. So that's my question is, or do they spawn as like, do they have a certain amount? Attack duration, crit damage, fishing speed, damage, no crit damage, effectiveness to future crit changes. I think duration makes sense. Although part of me thinks I should be re-rolling every time just to see if there's a mining related thing, which I may do. Because if I can get like super increased mining speed and then I can just run around and it's like one hitting the minerals, that'd be pretty great. My knockback looked pretty good there. Wow. Okay, come on. Here we go. All them pumpkins. Whenever I get crops that are like basic crops, I'm going to um, get the most expensive ones. Let's, ooh, pitchfork stabs towards the nearest enemy. I like that. Haven't touched that. We don't have tadpole. We do have weed whacker. So let's go with one, two, three on the weed whacker. And let's go with... The pitchfork. I'm liking trying out all the different uh, weapons. Okay, we got the crop space. Let's grab all those that we can, and then we'll grab all of these that we can. And we're gonna even just save this money, I think. Because again, I don't even want—I don't want to be spending the time that it takes to plant these things. You know what I mean? But when the, the minerals spawn around here, then it's like, okay, I can—I can do it, I guess. Okay. Any more minerals. I need all the pets. Because then I can have them handle... Because essentially the thing I mostly need the plots for is the uh, weapon upgrades, right? And then beyond that, it's... Sure, things are a nice bonus, but don't really need from it. Amount, duration, and size. Let's do duration and size. Um, or spawns per mining speed. Let's do that. Uh, okay, so real quick, what is our mining speed? Because it's probably pretty high, right? No, it's only plus, it's plus zero, huh? I can't quite fully line those up. I think it says plus zero, though. Um, so we'll, we'll want to boost that, obviously. Um, but where's our attack size at? Attack size, attack size, attack size. Plus 23. It is growing. It is growing. I don't think just from uh, upgrades. Do, 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 do. Give me those. Oh yeah! Give me all that nonsense. Um, okay. Oh yeah, that's right. I guess I do need to be still getting crops really for XP. So it's like not necessarily that I want to um, mess with that frequency duration. Let's reroll. Loot yield, move speed, projectile attack frequency. Let's do that. Okay, no minerals over here. Let's go a little bit further out. Let's see. Any up here? No. Poke. Poke. Okay. Yeah, so far, I don't think I've ever seen any minerals up this way. Shop has opened. Let's mine these guys real quick. I am curious about, like, if there's a limit to how late he's open. Uh, health, attack size, damage, projectile speed, frequent. Let's do another reroll. 
health regen, attack size, pickup range, watering range. We'll do that. That's fine. I think the attack size is going to be my my benefit. Okay, well, no pets, so we will we'll buy another plot cuz why not? Let's I don't really want the book hammer. Let's max out these guys. Well, one, two, three, and then we'll get some of these hay bales. I haven't tried this weapon yet. So then the rest are going to be high yield. High yield slow. Crit damage and coin gain. Damage, watering range, watering speed, but thirst up. Knock back. Let's do a reroll. Damage, crop thirst, move speed, damage. Well, let's just do move speed. I don't want to be like, you know, messing with all that like enemy stuff right now. But, um, straight damage boosts are like so nerfed for us right now. Okay, let me get some water for this, I guess. Okay, minerals. So it does seem like the minerals kind of all spawn internally. Like there's there's a limited number of spots where like the nodes are. Apple spawns, damage, knockback. Honestly, I'm okay with reduced water capacity, that's fine. It's gonna make it harder for me to plant the few things I plant, but Overall, I think the benefit outweighs the cost. I should be closer to these uh, these things. Do, 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 run back and forth. Run back and forth. Amount, knockback, frequency, damage. Amount, damage, crit chant. Let's do the knockback frequency. Because I do think the bigger thing for me is just keeping enemies away. Duration, pickup range, planting speed, and yield. Duration's nice. Let's go for duration. I know I could have like waited to try and get a mining thing, but... Oh, whoops. Ooh, the hay bale's big! With boosted knockback, that thing's probably real good. Mining yield! Do, 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 do. Gimme. Uh, oh, I didn't get those. Okay, that's fine. Watering guy, nice. Um, bouncy balls, I think I want a good amount of... Let's boost the, um, the hay bales, see how that turns out. And then again... Slow. Exit. Okay. Amount and damage. Amount frequency and damage. We're going to do the frequency. Again, I think just having things working on the knockback for me is going to be real nice. Oh, dude. Y'all, I love this game. You know, it does... Atomic Crops was a game that I really enjoyed, but the pacing of it was kind of hectic. And um, sometimes it made it a little tricky to, like it just got it got stressful sometimes, um, you know, as some roguelites do. This one feels like it's at a pace, and maybe this is kind of like the appeal of Bullet Heavens. It's like the pacing is a little bit more kind of like consistent, and they give you enough time to like build your build. Speed, duration, damage, crit. Okay, we're doing this. Do 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 do. Uh, speed. Like that. Oh. As one as one boss almost dies, another enters. Okay. I'm I'm focusing on trying to kill these bosses right now just to like kinda like save myself a little bit. I need to boost this bomb move that I have, this base move. Planting and watering speed, pickup range and knockback. I'm looking for mining, 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 mining. Ooh yeah! And there we go. We'd love to see it. Let's do that one. Get like one of each. Uh, speed regen, damage frequency, projectile speed, looking for mining! Attack pickup, watering range, sure. I wonder if you can skip. Uh, uh, oh, you know what? There's probably a limited amount of those that you can unlock, maybe. Like the. Uh, like, you know, similar games. Well, let's do it again. Okay. Uh, ooh, there's a big chunk of mines over there. All right, let's build this, uh, our base move up. Let's get five on those. Let's get the other four on these guys. Let's 
buy some more plots because we can um, and high yield okay pew 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 Dude, I love the different kinds of builds you can get. This, you know, you know what it is? You know what it is? It reminds me of uh, um, Deep Rock, where you have the mining component in the Deep Rock Survivor. Um, you can have builds built around mining, right? Um, like, oh boy. Oh, I j that's so cool. This, like, new sub-subgenre of... It's, it's, how would you say, like, resource gathering. Bullet heaven. Waters, plants, plant seeds. Perfect. All right. That's wonderful. Because I didn't get any of my stuff planted this morning. I was too focused on getting, uh, those things mined. Do, 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 do. Cool. I can aim the, um, the hay bales, which is neat. Um, and they can go at kind of any angle, it looks like. Frequency per knockback. What is our... Our knockback should be pretty good. 5%. Hmm. Let's do a reroll. Knockback mining speed. Uh, size. I love knockback. Oh yeah, because damage damage boosts are bad for me. Or like just just lesser. I forgot about that. It's a very important thing. Okay, uh, amount and damage, amount, size, and frequency. Yeah, I gotta remember that. Getting just regular damage ups is not worth it, right? Damage, attack size, duration, crit chance, crit damage, projectile speed. Well, in this, the the attack size and attack duration, you know, I think are worth it on their own. Okay. Day eight. Wow, we're only on day eight. Wow, it feels like we're deeper into this. It feels like enemies are more dangerous than that. Um, crap, can I look at my weapons? Why? Okay. I should focus on one and just max it out, I think. Let's buy another plot. Let's max out... I think Bouncy Ball's doing some good business. So we're going to just get all ten on that. And then Raspberries. Max out on those. Maybe get a couple of those. Okay. So, we want to sit here as long as we can to plant these. Little dude will help, right? Oh, you have to be pretty close to plant. To the to the spot. Okay. Yeah, look at that bouncy ball go. I think it'll be a real good to upgrade. Okay. Seeds are all planted. Wonderful. Elephant will get to doing his business. Um, we look around now for... Minerals. I think next we'll play the fishing guy, because I haven't really been doing any fishing. Um, seems like it's very much like mining. A lot more limited area. I'm sure you can increase the spawns of the fishing just like you can with the... Um, I'm actually, I'm positive. I know I've seen that stuff. Um, with the mining, so... Um, it's it, That part's interesting. I wonder if it's like... With the mining, they have consistent payouts, because you can see what type of mineral it is with fishing it's like maybe it's a little more chance based right each fish you fish up could be any kind and then maybe there's like a oh, a quality booster damage frequency speed and knockback damage crit chance attack size duration i want the frequency up uh, crop thirst oh mining yield Okay, let's grab these, and let's get in here. Cap B, Bat B, and another plot. We have them all. Let's, uh, Y. We're on level three on the bouncy ball. Let's get five bouncy ball. Let's get the rest as bombs, and then let's get maybe that, yeah. I don't want to get the full suite of seeds this time around because I'm just curious how many weapon uh, opportunities I'm going to get on the next one. Because last time there was a point at which there were like 70 available. Um, so, you know, just to get it done faster. 
Damage, crit chance, attack size, speed. Attack duration, crit damage, knockback. Again, because the damage boost I don't think is that good. I may have read it wrong. Maybe, like, weapon upgrade damage is good and just, like, passive upgrade damage is not. But um, I think it's just in general. I think it's probably all damage. Fishing speed. Can't do anything to my mining. Attack size and water capacity. Pickup range. Let's do the attack size and water capacity. I pick up range would be good. There's lots of stuff just everywhere right now. Damage, knockback, size, crit damage, crit chance. Let's do this one, I guess. Uh, okay, we uh, leveled up that guy. Okay, reach max level on the bouncy ball. So what happens if I had extra seeds? Because I feel like you can overbuy weapon seeds. So do they then... Um, give you XP, maybe? Move speed, projectile speed, projectile and planting speed. Projectile speed would not be bad. Attack frequency, size, yield, apple spawns. Nah, that's fine. Crop yield, not so much. But the attack frequency, I think, is worth it. More watering plants, I think. And now that we're getting close to the weapon upgrades being done, then I can get more just focused on XP. So maybe we'll do a little bit of that today, because I did save a lot of money. Okay, um, I did the thing where I didn't wait until I actually picked up the gems. Weed Whacker. 13 of them? I bet we only need 10? Maybe a little more? And then the rest we'll get for hay bale seeds. And then I guess we'll buy all of those. Five of those. Go. Okay. Let's get to planting. So there's a planting range increase, right? That'd be pretty neat just to be able to like, you know. Do, 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 do. Now real quick. What's my ability again? Ore spawns, future mining speed changes, damage when an ore is mined, mining yield. Okay. Um, projectile speed, crit damage, damage. Attack duration, attack size, damage. We'll do that one. Do, do, do. Oh, I need water. That's why I got another elephant. Okay. Ore spawns. That's real good for this build. Knockback size, frequency. Yeah, knockback size and frequency. Okay. Oh, look at that blade. Oh man, getting a higher amount on that would be neat. That weed whacker, though. All right, yeah. The, the ore spawns really starting to pick up. You can tell, because I think I'm doing pretty good damage to these guys now. Oh yeah, that... Or spawns per uh, mining speed, because we have a lot of mining speed. Boss guy's taking some hits, but honestly, like, you know, for a boss, not too bad. Weapon upgrade? Yet. Yeah. Movement speed, mining yield, fishing yield. Yeah. Cool with it. Do I have any other weapon things growing? Are they just taking their time? Okay, I don't think I'm going to be able to end this guy before I get in here. So, Weed Whacker, we are at not maxed. Um, back. I wish I knew how many more I needed. We will get five, and that's got to be enough. And then we will max out our bombs. Then we will get a bunch of watermelons, because those are big yields. And we will exit. Okay. Land them all. Fish spawns, ore spawns. Well, gotta do it. Like, the fact that mining ore also boosts our damage is, like, that's the, the whole thing here. It's like, okay, every time we increase our mining speed and our ore spawns, we're increasing our damage. Okay. You know? Amounts, projectile speed, duration, frequency, damage. Yeah. Bombs. Amount, attack size, knockback. Yeah, that sounds cool. 
Wow, look at all the bombs. All right, cool. And all of our seeds got planted. See, it's nice to have... Let me look at my pets again. Yeah, the toucan uh, and elephant combo is great with the capybara growing it faster. And obviously the, the cow helping with yield, although with this build we're probably at like the lowest yield possible. Attack enemies, damage scales with your level, applies fast grow to crops. Let's, let's do the cat. I don't think I have a cat yet, do I? I need a retriever. I'd love if I could get the all the pets. Um, we're looking for mining. Health regen and projectiles. Yeah, 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 let's do that. Let's do that. Uh, amount, attack size, frequency, knockback, and damage. I think, yeah, yeah, yeah. Of all the things that will boost, that's what we want. All right, so then the last one to upgrades are the fork and the hay bale. Pickup range, loot yield, crop yield, apple spawns. Do do. Well, we'll do attack duration. Okay. Dude, this game is so good. I love it. I love it. And I do think we've reached sort of a tipping point in this build. We are keeping enemies at bay pretty well. Like, the knockback's real high. And the damage seems to be working. Which, you know, our kill yields aren't great, but keeping them away allows me to mine more, which those yields are fantastic. Like, you look at all of our money. Oh, yeah, we're going right over there. Uh, okay. Oh, yay! Retriever! All right. Now, I wonder if there's an endless mode. Oh, man. Let's get five of these. And let's max out on the forks. And then... Wow, there's 60 wheat seeds available. Let's get all the yams. And what are these guys? Cauliflowers. Let's get 10. Yeah. All right. Again, the main reason I'm doing this is just for XP. Um, these things are growing pretty fast, jeez! Or were those already there? XP gain, coin gain, crit chance, apple healing, move speed, damage and attack frequency, knockback and attack frequency. Well, let's do the knockback. It's working pretty well for us to have all that knockback. Okay. And man, oh man, my hay bales. Duration, speed and damage, attack size and frequency. Let's do this one. Okay, I'm out crit chance. I'm cool with that. I'm out attack size knockback damage. Yeah, let's do that. Pew, 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 pew. Okay, let's go this way. Let's go to the field of minerals. I have a feeling with as high as we are on spawn rates and whatnot, I might be able to just literally sit in this field and they'll just keep spawning on me because of how many need to be spawned at a moment, you know? But man, I mine them fast. All right, maybe not, maybe not. But there will already be a ton of them down this way. Dude. The knockback, you know, it works really well against the, um, the, the adds, right? The basic enemies. Um, but that allows me to run really easily from this boss. Which is nice. Uh, da, 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 sure. Okay. So, we're at four. All right, let's do the same thing we did last time. Like, five of these, and then the rest will be hay bales. And then... We're gonna go... Ten on the pumpkins. Five on... No, let's, let's just do some more. And then we can have these guys. Just plant as many as we can. I think at this point we're so close to our weapons being done. And honestly, to the level being done. Um, do, 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 do. Oh, more spawned already. Let's go help plant. I have my two can, but you can only do so much. Frequency, size, knockback, damage. Yeah. Better frequency. You know, crit chance, not there, but... Like I said, the knockback seems to be doing a lot of the work for us. Mining speed! Um, yeah, more seed planting. 
just like just had that complaint. It wasn't really a complaint, but it was like notice it like that's something that's slowing me down. Uh, damage, frequency, speed, and knockback. Yeah. Okay. Where's some minerals? Where are some minerals? There's some. Plant 50 crops in one day. Hey! That was achievement! I didn't even realize. Like, I knew that was one. I didn't realize I had planted that many. I'm not, like, focused on those. Um, no. Or spawns! Dude. The, the, the build gods have given on this build. I'm loving it. This game's great! I know I've said it already, but man, I am loving this one. Okay, let's grab some gems. Let's, if there's anything here to grab, let's grab it. Just kind of make a nice little circle. All right, what up, Ant? Um, we'll buy, that. you know, that's probably enough. Potatoes, wheat, pumpkins. Max out them pumpkins. Taters. All right. So it's like the way to do that achievement. Was it plant or was it harvest? You want stuff already growing before the end of the night, I think. So then you can harvest it midday and then plant more. I guess like you want uh, uh, fast growing stuff and you want to stick around. Frequency projectile speed. Let's again, we're just yeah, mining, mining, mining. Okay. Then we will do projectile speed. Do, 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 do. Dude, uh, this, it's so cool. It's so cool. I love being able to have builds like this where like, it makes it less of a, every build is a modified version of the same thing, right? Oh, you start with a different weapon, but you're gonna play the exact same way every time. In this one, it's like, no, there, you have to play differently. Four amount, damage, frequency, knockback. Crit okay, we will do the, uh, yeah. The more of them. And the knockback. Okay. Shot prices and move speed. Max out them at 128. What's our knockback right now? Plus 55. But I want damage. Crop thirst is fine. It's fine. We've got all of our weapons. Obviously, XP is nice. Okay, let's go get some minerals. Dude, this field of minerals is quarry. Shop open. Pet! Ten pets in a single run! Dude! Killing it! I love it. Max out on those guys. Dude! Hell yeah! <laughs> the uh, lack of water. Okay. Fishing yield when an ore is mined. Wow. Mining speed when an ore is mined. Self-sharpening. Oh, where was this earlier in this run? I mean, obviously, we're doing fine. Although right now, we're starting to see some enemies getting close. Um, but, like, woof, that's a builder. That's Bob right there. Do, do, do. Oh, the Blades of Doom! Because, like, the mining speed is now going to increase, it's, again, it's like, with the number of minerals that spawn, with all the upgrades that we get that build upon the minerals being mined, like, wow. I got exactly what I wanted out of this run and more. Oh my gosh, level two of that? Jeez Louise! I want endless mode. Attack enemies. Do, do, do. 
Move speed. Yeah, why not? I think this is the last night. I think we're gonna go Wombo in a second. Right? Yep. Wombo! <laughs> oh, I love it. Wombo! So I wonder if the level twos go longer. That'd be neat. Okay, what did we do? We unlocked Billy Bob. Okay, so I think the image was wrong for the one character here. It was wrong here. So this is Billy Bob Frog. Um, we got Mignon. And we got... Oh, we want to run with Collier. Cool. Cool. These runs have been going great. These runs have been going great. Okay. Oh, what's new? Oh! So cute! Oh my gosh! Wander! How cool is that? It's Wanderbot, y'all. Good friend of the Stump channel. Oh my gosh! That is so cute, Wander. Love you, buddy. Miss you. Uh, oh my gosh, these are so cute. So you can spend gems on these as well. Well, I mean. Wander, you gotta come hang out with me. And I want this little guy too. Okay. Cute. Oh, is he gonna like walk around in here? If I click on Wander like that, is he around? Ah! <laughs> Wander! That's so great. I love it so much. All right, we have gems to spend here. Um, I think this time I might go fishing, right? We might go the other way. Um, so fishing yield. Let's build that up. Water capacity. Ah, I just spent my... That's fine. That's fine. I know I could refund, but, you know. Crit chance, damage. Planting speed is nice. Is there... There's crop yield. Minus the thirst is not bad. Plus the capacity is not bad. I'm trying to see if there would be a way to increase their growth rate. But doesn't look like it. Coin gain, gem gain, pickup range, move speed, enemy loot, knockback. Wait. 2% enemy loot yield at the start of each day. So does that mean when they die, you still get a percentage of it? That's pretty cool, if that's the case. Okay, let's get some increases to fish. Let's get an increase. Whoops. Eh. Let's get an increase to watering range. Uh, let's not do planting speed. Let's do something like base damage up. Uh, What's this guy? Wait. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, I got, I got confused. I thought this was like an arrow to go further up. <laughs> um, okay, let's get then... Let's get another damage. Yeah. Why not? Still nothing out here. Yeah. Okay. Gosh, this game is so cool. We got Wanderbot walking around out there. That's incredible. Okay. Uh, all right. Well, then we're going to go to Winter uh, 1. And then from there, um, we're on to the level 2s. Will we get to there this episode? We will see. It's getting a little bit late. I got to make dinner and stuff. Um, okay. Oh, no. Nope, 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 nope. Quit. Yes. My first loss <laughs> was a quit. Uh, home. I thought I changed. I didn't. Oh, there's a new room up there. Hold on. Wow, I guess because we've won enough to do that stuff. All right, so we got Billy Bob Frog. And then we got Mignon. Gain one of each pet. 100% chance to gain an additional pet whenever recruiting one. Minus planting speed, minus watering speed, minus damage. Pet build. Okay, and then Billy Bob is the farmer boy. Okay. Well, and then what was this guy's fishing? Build. That's so cool. And then there's Human and Bubba. 
All right. I kind of wanted to do the fishing guy, but then now that I think about it, like we just did a resource based one, right? We did the basic one. We could go for Bubba or Mignon. I like the idea of let's do Mignon. Gosh, this is so hard. No, let's do Billy Bob because last time we didn't do like any farming and now it's going to be like only farming. <laughs> okay. And what's up in here? Oh, fish record. Okay. So fishing build, that's going to be good. Oh, there's one mineral that we have missed. Okay. What's this? So these are just, uh, these are our achievements. Wait, there were tabs on the side. Right? Hold on, get my mouse over here. What are these about? Nothing. Oh, that's not tabs. That's like the, got it. The book binding. Um, all right. I think we're good. Yeah, farmer guy. Billy Bob Frog. Let's go to the winter. So it seems to me like it doesn't super matter which um, season you go. As far as I can tell, there's no issues with um, growing, you know? Do, 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 do. But yeah, we're going to do our best to just stay in the field or stay near the field, you know? Let's go get some water. Do, 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 do. Watering range ain't bad. Oh. Do, 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 do. Okay. Definitely want to get some little helpers. Damage per health, effectiveness to future knockback, coin gain. We're looking for farming. Crop growth speed and water capacity. Well, let's do that. Mining yield, fishing yield. Tax size crop yield. Yeah, crop yield. Let's get some more water. Tax size, enemy damage, crop yield. Okay. Because what is it that our bonus is? Attack frequency per planting speed, shop prices per crop growth speed. So we don't gain anything from the crops um, in terms of like damage, but we're going to be able to cycle through them faster, which is kind of the, uh, that's the benefit. Once you can start planting more each day, you know, it'll cascade. Okay, give me that. 604, there's a couple more coins over here. So it is gonna be like, slow. All right. It is 200. For another plot, let's do it. Pumpkins. Let's max out on radishes first. Then we'll buy some yams. I want things where I'm actually going to be growing a lot of them. Oh, I didn't buy weapons. All right, let's buy one weapon. Crow boom. We haven't seen the crow boom. Okay. All right. Crit chance, fishing yield, damage, and attack size. Attack size and crop yield. It's nice. I got a big enough field that we're like... Wow, the ice fishing, man. That's so neat. Oh, that's the crow boom. That's the, the scarecrows. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They're like bombs. If they run into them, they're like mines. What are these creepy dudes? Okay. Do, 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 do. Get wrecked. Knockback mining speed damage. Fishing yield. Okay. Crit damage and crit chance. Projectile speed and frequency. We'll do that. Oh yeah, did you see the crow boom? Once they ran into it, it was a boom. Okay. Projectile speed. Just, just straight up. Totally fine. Okay, damage and enemy damage. Like, I do need to be getting other things, but, like, I like kind of just going to the wall on this one. All right. Now we just get a flat damage upgrade. Because the way I'm seeing it is, like, the more you can plant and gather, right, the more you're going to be able to buy, but also the more XP you're going to be getting. So you're going to be making up for stuff like 
um, by just being able to buy more as we go through. It's just going to take some time. Once I can get so much money that I can just, like, you know, build on that. Crop thirst and water capacity down, but damage and coin gain. Kind of want to get this, though. Let's get this. It's just, like, let's get a little bit of a damage boost. Like, not everything has to be crops. Like, right now, my crops are done, so I might as well do this mining, you know? Come on. There we go. All right. Uh, oh, let's get little dude. Waters plants. Wonderful. Thank you. Good to see ya. Let's get some weapons. So, I think... I want the molter. Oh, fairy dance. Okay, we'll get that because, you know, I haven't seen that. Let's get... Let's get these guys. And then some of these. Okay. Do 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 do. Okay. Oh, yep, there goes all my seeds. Those were spendy. Okay, attack frequency and speed or damage attack size duration. Let's get damage attack size duration. Do 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 do. Okay, so they are just straight up orbitals. Got it. Neat. Do 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 do. Okay. All right, I can spend a little bit of time away letting my axolotl do the watering because all of our seeds have grown. So it's like, or have been planted. Ore spawns, apple spawns, fish spawns, no. Plus the planting speed, which builds something else for us. It increases our yield, maybe. Let me look. Shot price is down, nice. Okay. All right, do your thing. Just do some fishing. So did I get any money for that? I don't think I do. I get, oh, maybe you get XP. Damage, attack size, enemy spawns, enemy speed. Let's get level two, might as well, might as well. Do, 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 do. Okay. I can't quite tell the the payout for fishing. Um, okay. Tadpoles were good. We've seen all of these, so now it's like pick my favorite. Um, we'll max that out. I kind of wanted to get more land, but I have so few dollary dues. Let's go for, let's see, wheat seeds cost 46. What's the the yield? It doesn't say what the, like, money yield is, only the XP yield. Alright, let's just get as many of these as we can. Plant as many as possible, right? Okay. Do 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 do. Pick up range of knockback. Crop thirst down, water capacity up. Love it. Let's do it. Okay. Get him! Plus two amount, projectile speed and damage. Let's do that. Do 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 do. Okay. Okay, he's gonna be a bit of a pain to kill, I think. Fish spawns, ore spawns, apple spawns. Planting speed and watering speed. Yeah. Okay. All right. And yeah, my payout's not huge right now. Minus crop thirst plus to water capacity. Sure. Do, 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 do. Plant seeds. Sure. Now I got double duty being done. 
See, I need enough seeds to be able to be planting all day long, essentially. So I'm hoping I get to like that turning point soon. Oh, gosh darn it. I didn't gather the things first. Mower blades. Let's get a couple. But honestly, right now, I want more seeds. I want to be building. Let's do this. Yams are spendy, but good. Radishes, you can make a lot of them. There we go. Okay. Not a bad amount of seeds. Not a bad amount of seeds. like to see it. I like that our watering capacity is at 13. Definitely nice. Okay. Oh yeah, the mower blades. Do 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 do. Cool. It does go in the direction you point. That's awesome. I love that I beat one and a half rounds without knowing I could use the other stick. You know. I feel like that's an accomplishment. These little guys, ew! Winter bugs. The worst of the bugs. They come inside because they're cold. Tax size when an ore is mine, crop yields. Yeah, I have so much watering capacity that losing that is totally fine. Okay, effectiveness to future fishing yield, tax size per resistance. What's our resistance at? Zero. Um, reroll. Mining and fishing. Crop yield, sure. Reach 75% or higher crop yields. Uh, crop growth speed. Awesome. We're, we're, we're balancing, you know? Uh, apple healing when it's collected. You know what? We will go for this. I do need some just general boosts. And I've basically doubled the power of my crops, so. I think I can handle it for a bit. Ooh, jeez. But man, oh man. Still, not making as much money as I would like to be, considering this is such a crop-based build. And then I look and it's only day five. It feels like it's been so long. But I guess it's one of those ones where it's like the whole time flies. So it's like, it feels the other way, not because it's boring or something like that, but because I just lose track of time. Okay, more on the blades. Three of those. What's going to get yield me the most money? You know what I mean? Let's get as many of these as we can. So we can just plant all day long. See how this turns out for us. Okay. Coin range, pickup range. I think we might be at the point where we're like almost um, maxed out on all of the farm stuff. So let's go. Let's, well, let's do another reroll just to see. Projectile speed and planting speed. Well, well, well. I spoke too soon. Do, 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 do. Wow, we have enough space that I could plant all of these plants already. Are they, or does the wheat grow so fast that I have already harvested some? Do, 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 do. Axolotls can do my business when I have to run. Piercing in speed, piercing frequency, attack size damage, and duration. Let's do this one, frequency. Fire faster. Duration and yield. Repurpose tools. No thank you. I would like my tools to be tools. Come on, thank you. Waiting on those. Tax. Ew! It's one of those beetles where their eyes are up on top. Frequency. Crop growth speed, watering speed, minus to yield. Growth speed, attack frequency, apples. Enemy damage during the night. That's, wow. Let's do the attack frequency. I mean, that one is neat. I will say that one is neat. You know, you put yourself in danger, but... Okay, I'm thinking it is harder on the different levels, just because look at how many bosses they just threw at me, you know? Do, 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 do. But I think I'm putting out some good damage. 
Okay, that guy didn't drop a thing, so maybe like the three of them are considered a single boss. Yeah, it looks like it's that. Plant seeds, retrieves loot. Wander, you're coming along. That's so awesome. I love that. That's I'm so happy for Wander for that. Okay. Let's see. Uh, fairy dance. We had that last time, right? Um, or do we have it right now? No, we have it right now. That's right. Let's get five of those. Five of these. Five of those. Two more of those. And then, seeds-wise. I made a ton of money last time, and that was with all wheat seeds, so we might do something like that again. There, it's, I think it's probably less XP, but more money, is my guess. Growth time is a little bit more. XP yields a little bit more. Thirst is a little bit less. I'm not worried about the thirst. So we're going all wheat again. We'll see how that goes. I probably should get more planting area, but I also get through all of my stuff pretty dang quickly. You know? Pretty dang quickly. Because they grow so fast, you know? My planting speed. Like, look at that. Uh, amount and damage, amount, crit chance, frequency, and knockback. Let's go, let's go for damage. We just need to be putting more damage out there. Oh, whoa! Are those guys, like, right next to me? Amount, piercing, damage, duration, amount, crit chance. Let's do this one. Yeah, there's, like, little guys! Eek! I don't like them. They're little and fast. Frequency, speed. I, I think I need that. As much as piercing is nice, you know. Gosh, these little guys. Okay, they may be the death of me. Just because of their speed. And they're really hard to see, so it's like, they're hard to avoid. Okay. Give me the water. I don't like those guys. They're like... Oh, no! I'm in trouble. Damage. Health regen. As much as I can get. Knockback. Okay, that could help. A little bit. Eek! What they see, they're so hard to see. They just come out of nowhere. It's like he must have, he was just sitting in my field. Do 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 do. Luckily, I've got the pets that are helping me. I have an elephant, right? I think I do. Pretty sure I have a toucan. I know I have a wander. Okay. Enemy damage, mining speed, crit chance, knockback duration resistance, crop growth speed, attack frequency. Let's do that. All crop build. Damage, move speed. Just projectile speed. Works for me. Okay. Five of those. Another five of those. Let's get more planting area. Okay, yeah, I need I need weapon boosts now, I think. <clears throat> I've kind of put those off in favor of like trying to gain money. Oh my god! The B level apparently. Uh y'all. Oh boy. Ooh, oh boy. Crit chance and attack size, damage attacks, frequency, projectile speed. We're going to just go ahead and start getting some just straight up attack boosts and things. Okay. Oh, he was stuck behind that tree, I think. Good thing to think about. Let's get a little more piercing. Apple spawns, health regen. Let's get more health regen. Like, the damage on the the boomerang things is pretty good. Low on crit, but I don't really care about crit. If I can just have consistent... More watering, I guess. Because what does Wander pick up? Is it coins, or...? Because it says he picks up... Loot. can't tell. Oh, yeah, he's, he's gathering money. Okay. Oh, yeah. All right. We're getting some money. Let me have a apple, please. Okay. Yeah, we got money. Okay, cool. I did it again. 
Went inside before the money procked. All right. I want five of you, five of you. The rest will be yours. Two more plots. Let's get five of you. Let's get 10 of you. 10 of you, max. I do think having the uh, faster growing ones, but a lot of them, I think it's more valuable. Feels like it might be. I might be wrong. Might be wrong. Do, 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 do. Amount duration. Let's do that. Piercing damage. Let's do the piercing. Between that and the like shuriken, the mower blades, that's what they are. I think that's pretty good. Attack size and damage. Ink! Ink! Again, it's like the little ones sneak up on you. It's nice to have so many axolotls because I can't really get away to um attack size is nice. Um because I'm struggling to be able to get to one of my water sources. So them being able to kind of help with that has been very nice. Move speed, projectile speed, apple healing, straight up damage. Attack frequency up. Crop growth speed bonus as well. Look at that. Frequency per knockback. What's our knockback at now? Minus 5%. 20% damage could be really good. I know planting speed would help. We've already reached plus 75% planting speed, right? Or is that growth speed? Either way, I think we'll get there. It's only day nine. Move speed, crit damage, crit chance, projectile speed, and frequency. Damage and crop growth speed. It gets my damage up as well, so we'll take it. I don't love making the enemies stronger. I already struggle a little bit. That water. Give me all that stuff. Get another one of those. Ooh, attack duration and crop yield. Okay, there you see, I waited that time. All right, more plots as far as weapons. Oh, we got all the plots. As far as weapons are concerned, five of you. Five of you, rest of you, as far as plants are concerned. Twenty of those. Fifteen of those. All right, and then... Yeah, I should max out on those. <laughs> Look at that. Very few seeds left to be purchased. Do, 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 do. All right, now I need to just be getting all my water going. Water capacity would be nice. Knockback minus damage. Let's do that. Try and get my knockback out of the negative. If it's negative, does that mean it was pulling them towards me? <laughs> I doubt it, but that'd be hilarious. Pickup range and knockback. The pickup range... Like, knockback, obviously, right? I've talked a lot about how knockback is very helpful. Eek! And, like, in that instance, not having any was scary. Um... Tadpole... Yeah. Just the amount would be nice. Okay. Give me more. Water. Let's max that out. Do, 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 do. Let me look at all my crop based things real quick. Crop thirst minus 30%. Crop yield is 101. Crop growth speed is 100. Planting speed is 42. So I could use more planting speed and watering speed just for, for upgrades, right? For the achievements. And unlocks. Do, 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 do. 
Apple spawn and move speed, max health and resistance, damage per apple spawn, crit damage, resistance and crit chance, attack size, pickup range, watering range. Uh, that, that seems good. Watering range. Okay. Almost used all my seeds. Crop yield. Yeah, and damage wise, not doing too poorly. Not doing too poorly. When a weapon is harvested. Hmm. It's a little bit late to be doing that one, I think. More pickup range and knockback. Kill him. Take this. Um. Fertilize. Yeah, I love it. Okay. Um, we have 15, so once again, we will do five, five, five. Potatoes. Let's max out on these raspberries. And let's max out on the potatoes, and then we'll max out on these guys. And we literally have bought everything in the shop. I could reroll. Let's do a reroll. I wonder if it gives me more. Uh, I thought maybe it would give me more stock on these, but it does not. Okay. Well, there we go. I do like that it plants weapons first, by default. You can, like I said, you can cycle through and um, turbo piercing. Yeah, let's do it. I love it. Uh, amount, damage, duration. Duration's not as important as, yeah, like getting more of them down. Like once they're close to me, the things blow up pretty, pretty fast. 100% effectiveness to future damage changes. Wow. Slows you down, but makes you way stronger. Again, that's a good early one. It's it's day 14. No, day 11. I, I still think it's not necessary. Watering speed. Right, I talked about how that could be one for um, achievements. Frequency, size, knockback damage. Yeah, let's do that. and speed. Sure. Go ahead and get one that I've already got. Wow. Give me some water. Got a lot of these uh, potatoes to plant, it seems. I also have so many plots. It's wonderful. Do, 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 do. Oh, let's get some water. Oh, man. Love it. All right. Attack duration, frequency, and watering speed. Let's do it. Let's see if we can't get to the 75% uh, watering speed. Do, 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 do. Attack size and water capacity. Attack size is nice for the mower blades now that they hit everything. You know what I mean? Okay, let's harvest all these. Watering speed. Water capacity. I think there was another one that was like, get to like, I don't know, 20 or maybe 50 water capacity. 46% watering speed, 42% planting speed. So both of those worth checking out. Hey, another little water, buddy. Same as always. Five, 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 sixth. Max on those, max on those, max on those. We still got money. Damage duration frequency minus to yield. Damage coin gain plus the thirst. Damage planting speed. Love it. Do 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 do. Ooh, these mower blades are perfect for these little dudes. Attack size, projectile speed. Frequency, duration, damage. I like more consistently than being out. Size, duration, crit chance, damage. Do the bigger damage. Damage and growth speed. Yes. We're almost there. Oh, wait, no, no, no. That's growth speed, not plant speed. Um, yeah, that one. Oh boy. 
Dude. Heck yeah. I think my little uh, axolotls, now that I have so many, they're doing a real good job keeping this stuff watered. Now it's just about me moving around to plant because I only have the one toucan, I think. Do 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 do. This game is so good. This game is so good. Planting speed. That probably does it, right? 64%. Okay. Oh, that's right, because the last one wasn't planting speed, it was gross speed. Alright, we need 11% planting speed up. There's 10%, and that did watering speed as well. Are we on watering speed? 56. One per- yeah, one percent, that's right. We knew it was 11. One percent on planting speed. About 20 percent, I think, on watering speed. All right, that'll do it. Right? Was that not one? Maybe it's not. It was an assumption. Maybe I already did it. Waters plants for you, fertilizes crops, and increases the yield. Sure. Speed and frequency, resistance and attack size, health regen. Pickup range and watering range. Planting speed, watering speed, watering range. I want all of those. Okay. What up, my little ant? Five, five. We're just going to buy them out. Max these out. Max these out. Max these out. Let's even do a reroll. Uh, more wheat. Oh, man. <laughs> Look at all of that. Wow. Look at all my dudes! Crop yield speed. Yeah. Dude, this, the attack size on those guys. It's because I get attack size for planting speed, right? Damage, resistance, move speed, attack size. What's my resistance? It's not good, right? Zero. I can lose a little bit of attack size, I think. Amount, duration, frequency, size. Yeah. Okay. Max level in fairy dance. I mean, I've maxed out like every weapon I've seen so far, right? Do, 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 do. Whoa. Oh, Scarecrow, I needed to do still. All right, we will do that one now, mostly for the size again. <laughs> so yeah, let me read my thing. Attack frequency per planting speed and down on the shot prices. So it's actually the, the rate at which I'm firing that's going up. Damage and knockback, fish spawns and yield, XP gain and crop thirst. I'll take the damage and knockback. I'm not a fisherman. Harvest 500 crops in a single run. Nice. Projectile speed, attack frequency. Let's do it. Like, let me look at my plant stats again. 106, 68, 32, minus 30%, 141, 150. I mean, yeah. They're growing a lot. And the watering range is great because then I can like run over. I just got to run like fast back and forth and then we're good. Pick up range and watering range. Love it. So like, yeah, the, the watering range, I like just run back and forth a little bit. By the time I get to the other side, I've watered a ton of them. Who boy. Still have a good amount of seeds. Damage and crop growth speed. Let's do it. Reach 50% or higher enemy spawns. Wow. I wasn't even paying attention to that being a thing. Wow, y'all. Killing it. Um, all right. And we're maxed out on all of our weapons. Let's just buy all of you. And all of you. All 68 wheat seeds. Um, okay. <laughs> Jeez. That's hilarious. So many seeds. Look at all the scarecrows, man. And those things explode. The problem is that, like, I spawn them so quickly that they're not, like, uh, I don't think they're exploding. Because they're just spawning new ones. Now they are, because they're hitting stuff. Okay. Just need to make myself a little pathway over here. Uh, what you got for me? 
Oh, that's good. Chance to gain a pet when you get a, when you uh, get one, when you buy one. I think it said, but still. Damage, watering range, watering speed. Okay. Doom, doom. All right. So after we finish this one, uh, the knockback ain't bad. Um. Painting speed, watering speed, watering range. Yeah. Uh, what was I thinking? Oh, so then we'll, we'll try on the harder difficulty, right? The level twos. And so we'll see what that goes like. Why not? I want like 32 cans. Um, let's go ahead and just finish out projectile speed. Because we've got one more day. Do, 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 do. Getting, like, uh, we got one more day, so, like, getting more, like, trying to reroll for everything isn't, I, I think, like, that necessary. So many plus one rerolls. Let's just get pickup range. Why not? All the money in the world. All right. Oh, another water guy! Okay. Let's get, what's the most expensive one you got? Grapefruits. Let's get those. Let's get away from the wheat seeds. Got a, I got a few of those. I have like 68 of them. Reroll. Pet the dog. Um, let's get more raspberries. I have so many seeds right now. I certainly cannot use them all. Having the little water guys is going to be wonderful. Because with as fast as these things grow, the water speed, or the growth speed kind of Gets it. <laughs> Here we go, more. Uh, grow speed during the day. Let's do it. It's the last day, but let's do it. I'm really curious to find out if there's synergies. Because that would be awesome. Do -do -do -do. These wheat grow so fast. It really is the water. Which is great that I have, like, five of the little dudes. Dude, 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 dude. dude the weaponry. Okay. So we will be going Wumbo in not too long. Look at all that. My goodness. Almost planted everything. That'd be an achievement for me. Personal achievement. We're at 16 left. We're Wumboing! <laughs> the Wumbo is so funny. I love it. My goodness. Win a run as Billy Bob. Survive winter one. We done did it. We've now unlocked Sprout Frog. For having the high crop yield. We've got Swift Defrog for the higher crop growth speed. Reach level 50. So that was our highest one, which doesn't shock me because of the um, how many crops we grew. Truffle Frog. He's a little Grim Reaper. And went around with Billy Bob. No. Wonderful, y'all. Absolutely love this game. Absolutely love it. Oh, we got one last... New thing? What are you? Renovation. Oh, this is for like the, the, the outside and the inside. I, so this is just probably visual. Right? Like this is all cosmetic. So this gives you stuff to do once you um, have gotten all the upgrades you want. Or if you just feel like doing it. Look, pet the dog. Werf. Werf. Carpanter. Oh my gosh. Let's grab some plank pathways you know let's see what those are all about is that out here or did i just turn it off let me go back i might have turned it off yeah come here do 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 
Aha! Okay! This is what our plots are going to look like for out here. I'm really curious what it's going to be like. Who neat. All right. Well, this will be cool to, to slowly build through this game. Next time, um, if, if y'all are enjoying this, next time we'll try the harder difficulty. Um, and we'll try some new frogs. We got a bunch of them. We got... What are y'all about? Bean! Plus the damage when a crop is harvested. Attack size when a crop is harvested. Oh, attack speed goes down, but damage goes up as you harvest crops. Interesting. But your weapons get bigger, so it's that's interesting. Sprout. Damage per crop yield. Effectiveness to future crop yield changes. Minus attack size, minus effectiveness to future damage changes. So similar to Billy Bob Frog, but less about speed of growth and more about um, growth quality. Swifty, attack frequency for 30 seconds after harvesting a crop. Effectiveness to future crop growth speed, so growth speed and water speed here. Got it. Plus six water capacity by default. Okay. Oh, and then truffle. Crop yield during the day. Enemy loot yield during the night. Minus coin gain during the day. Plus to enemy spawns during the night. Wow. They're all so different. I love it. I love it. Okay, y'all. Well... Uh, with that, that's going to be our uh, our first look at what even is this game called? Pesticide Not Required. That's right. <laughs> this game's great. This is a fantastic bullet heaven type game. Um, we're doing really well so far, but it's just been on the easiest difficulties. So I will be curious to see when we move up to the next one, kind of what the uh, progression, the difficulty ramp is. Um, so, yeah. Yeah. But um, with that, y'all, I hope you enjoyed. Uh, obviously, if you did, leave a comment down below. Let me know which of the frogs is your favorite. All right? Let me know. There are a bunch of different frogs. I have unlocked many of the frogs. You start with just Joe here. Basic frog. Joe basic frog. Um, but you unlock lots of other frogs as you ac accomplish certain achievements. Um, so... For the benefit of people on stream, let's play as Joe, so you can see um, the basic gameplay loop. And then we'll move on to um, playing some of these wacky ones and maybe moving up to the second difficulty. Because the second difficulty I've yet to beat a level on, um, so it'd be nice to kind of get into that. Um, but yeah, we got a lot of silly frogs up in here. You can't see behind me, but there is a Grim Reaper frog. I'll, uh, I'll quickly do that. This little Grim Reaper frog over there. Do you eat bugs? You attack bugs, and from them you gain money. So, if that sounds like eating. Uh, okay. So, yes. No. Whoops. There we go. Joe. Um, what else do we have? Down here, we can look at our pets and buy them um, skins. So, as you can see, I have... Wanderbot taking place uh, of the Golden Retriever over here. Um, I also have an Axolotl taking place of the Elephant. These creatures actually um, do stuff for you. So, we got Wanderbot, our friend, friend of the channel, Wanderbots. Awesome that you're in here. I had no idea. So when I started playing the game and I saw Wanderbot, I was just like, I think you'll see it in the footage, but I like jaw dropped. I think I straight up jaw dropped. Uh, okay, so then beyond that, just like other survivor-like games, we have our tech tree here where I can upgrade stats. Um, Y'all don't need to worry about that too much other than just know that I've been upgrading. And then there's like fishing and stuff, so here is where your little like keeping track of your um, progress on that stuff is. Okay, let's play some game. We're gonna start in... We're gonna start in spring because I think there's a fish that I need to catch here still. Um, okay, so here's our farm plot. Uh, we run around, we plant seeds, and uh, as a result, we will um, gain some money from those seeds. Um, I need to turn this up in my headphones. Is this loud? Uh, loud enough for y'all? Um, so you'll see that we need to water these as we're running along. Um, so we just have to like walk by them and have enough water. In the upper left, you can see my water. You can see um, my... I think that's my number of kills. Um, and you can see my... Um, money um there's basically two resources that you want to be getting xp and money um right now if i walk by these little ripples here i start to fish 
And I do that fishing while I'm doing other stuff, right? A little louder for the game volume? Okay. Let's do that. How's that? Um, okay. So, now we get a little upgrade. Coin gain and pickup range, not a bad idea. Coin gain when a weapon is harvested. I like this because we're, we're on day one. So I can start building this one up. Um, so let's do that. Um, oh, and another upgrade. Let's grab, we have crit damage and coin gain. We have attack size, which I like. Or we can do a reroll. You can do one reroll every um, uh, round. You know, I might shrink my camera a little bit. I'm noticing that I just, I'm taking up a lot of that screen over there. Okay, so then I think we'll just go with attack size. Though I would, you know what, let's reroll. Maybe I can get some damage. Increase spawn rates, effectiveness to future. Okay, so this could be really good if I'm going to focus on fishing, which good amount of XP that you can get from fishing. It's nice when you're having to run circuits anyways. So let's do that. Um, fishing gives you XP. Mining gives you money. Um, and crops give you X, uh, uh, XP. And killing enemies gives you money. Um, okay, attack frequency. That's like... Um, how frequently like the attack triggers, right? It's different from attack speed, which is like how fast they move. Um, we'll, okay. I might go for a little bit of a fishing build because there are things that you can build off of fishing to like earn your XP really fast. Um, let's keep going. Resistance and move speed, projectile speed, attack duration and crop yield. So duration is good for like having things last longer. Cute game. It's a wonderful game. And so, you know, I, I mentioned... Hey, who was that? And let me know, how loud was that? Was that too loud? Do I need to turn down my notification stuff? I don't actually know exactly how to do that, so we'll have to see. I apologize if that just blasted out your eardrums. It shouldn't. It's a little loud? Sorry. Okay, here's what we'll do. We'll turn this down to here, and then I'll turn up this music in this game. I apologize. That happens. Love of Dragons, thank you for using that Prime sub. Um, it's good. I hope it didn't blow out your eardrums. Like I said, this is one of those having to re-get everything in order types of streams. Okay, um, let's keep going. So, um, so yeah, with the fish, I should be able to level up faster, um, and that will, like, pay for itself, essentially. Okay, the shop opens today, and guess who runs it? Ants! Awesome, right? Okay, a lot of stuff here. Let's run through it. I didn't get a lot of money. But I got enough, I think. Okay, so we can buy. First, we, we don't have the opportunity right now, but up above me, there can sometimes be a little crate with a pet in it. And so you can get the pet. Um, and the pets help you with stuff on the farm. Um, you can buy extra soil plots. You can see here, I don't have enough money to afford one. Um, I only have the 198 you can see up there. But you can buy more farm plots. You can have a larger farm area. Very useful to get as you're going along. I can buy weapon seeds. This is how you upgrade your weapons. You don't get those through XP, you get them through planting weapon seeds. And we got that item earlier that will give us boosts to our coin gain for every weapon seed that we um, harvest. Um, so getting it this early on, we're going to get the maximum payout from it. So I am going to buy these, the bouncy ball seeds. Um, this is almost like a chain lightning type thing. We're going to buy the maximum of those that we can. That leaves me with 24 coins. None of the plants that are down here I can afford. Okay. Lastly, you pet the dog. Isn't that cute? So cute. Okay. Uh, so we'll go with that. I'll plant my weapon seeds. <clears throat> Excuse me. I, uh, I just ate. Um, okay. Mining yield minus to fishing speed. Don't love that. So instead, we could just do mining speed, mining yield. Projectile speed, attack frequency. We're going to go with the mining. I'm feeling okay on, on damage right now. It's only day two. I think we'll be fine. Um, so upgrading our mining and our fishing is a good way to kind of... Um, Oh, and here's a great one. Here's a great one. This is like a permanent up, uh, upgrade, right? So I gain plus 1% mining yield whenever I catch a fish. So every time I catch a fish, that stat is going to go up. Like if I hit Y, you can see over there all the stats. So you can keep track of it. I really like that. I think Vampire Survivors has a similar thing. Um, 
So because of the way that I'm currently building, I think this is a really good skill to get. As far as I can tell, there is no limit to how many passive skills you can get, so I don't think I have to balance that. Um, so I, I haven't run into that issue at all. I have won many runs on the level one difficulty. I have not won any runs outside of that. Um, okay, so... Do, 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 do. All right, we harvested those. I would love to get over here and mine some of these now that I have those. Oh, and so the, the way that the mining stats work and the fishing stats work, yield is how much you get from it. Speed is how long it takes to like make that thing happen. Spawns is how many of them show up at any given time. Um, that kind of thing. Okay, let's go with, I would love some damage. Let's go, if we're gonna get from these guys, let's go with the crop growth speed. Minus to thirst is good, just they require... Yeah, let's do minus to thirst, actually. Requiring less water means I have to spend less time at my fields. Okay. Oh, and you see, I got the bouncy balls. I, uh... Got, I, I got those plants. So, um... Like I said, almost like a chain lightning kind of thing. It bounces around. It's great. Uh, let's get more of this guy. More of the fire potion. More damage. We're gonna be spawning more enemies. We're not making the enemies more diff <clears throat> Excuse me, we're not adding HP or anything like that. Um, so... Um, having more of them to me is not like a huge deal. Alright, tons of money today. Okay. Ooh, capybara! We're getting a capybara, alright? Applies fast grow to crops, making them grow faster. So that's the benefit of the capybara. Gohan, what's up? Okay, we want to get as many weapon seeds as we can. You can see at the bottom, it has a stock number for the weapons. So you can only get so many weapons every time you come in here. Let's get tadpoles. Uh, the closest thing I can think of to this is like the daggers in um, Vampire Survivors. So we're gonna buy max, which is three right now. Every day the maximum number of stock increases. Let's buy another uh, plot. Every day, the cost of the plots goes up. Now, you also tend to get more coins every day, right? The whole game is kind of a little bit growth focused, but getting them early on, cheaper, um, you know, it is what it is. Now, let's go with buying as many wheat seeds as we can. They're cheaper, um, but you know, that means we'll be able to plant a lot more. We just need to be around them more because of the crop thirst. So I just need to stay on the interior. Um, Oh, I guess the other thing, I have yet to really see any resources on, like, the major outside of the map, so I don't really go out that way too much. Um, but if you're, like, running away from enemies, you know, you might need to. Oh, yeah, 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 let's plant first, huh? Okay, so having the Capybara is going to be nice because he will um, increase the, the growth speed, right? Um, okay, I got my tadpoles. You'll start to see me shooting them. They almost look like feathers. Uh, oh, by the way, I'm playing this in twin stick mode, which means I can aim my weapons with my right stick. Um, there's also a non-twin stick mode, so I think it just does it sort of Vampire Survivor style, which, where it kind of, like, picks it for you. Okay, do we want more amount, or do we want, um, piercing? Let's go with piercing first. As more enemies show up, it'll be nice. Okay, yeah, let's do some mining. Um... If I stop mining something, it's okay. It's like it has like a, uh, a health bar almost. So it will, um, when I come back to it, it'll already have the process going. Uh, let's go with mining speed, mining yield again. I'm surviving the enemies right now, so I'm not too concerned about focusing on damage-based stuff. Because being able to get more money means being able to plant more seeds, which means being able to get more XP from the seeds, you know? Oh, I need to increase my water. Here we go. Uh, oh, I guess the thing you'll notice after I go to the shop, I didn't mention this, at the top, you'll see the seeds that I currently have. Um, Empty Null played Tidus Laugh. Did that show up? I didn't hear it. Is that a thing? Did it show up? Or is it not? Because I might not have that going. Did it go? That might just see that might be like a jazz and Enna thing. I don't know anything about that one. Okay, hold on. Hold on. You played it, so I'm going to make it happen. Hold on.
Did you hear it? I could do it again if it wasn't loud enough. <laughs> oh, man. So good. All right. Um, let's get back to this. More fish and ore spawns. Again, I, I've been getting a lot of stuff based around fish and, and ore. So the more the merrier, I'd say. Um, and, like, you can legitimately build runs that are, like, so, like, all you plant uh, are the weapons. And that's all you need to plant. Um, so you you definitely there's there's a lot of variety up in here. All right, we've got 2k now. Let's buy another plot Let's buy for our weapons Let's get water beam. Let's go full squirtle up in here. I can buy max Okay, and now we still got 1396 to play around with so let's get some more let's buy like 10 wheat and then let's get something more expensive y'all can't see there's there's wheat behind me um, the merch ant. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. There's also a, um, oh, what is he called? It's an architect or an archa architant, something like that. You know how it goes. PC man, what's up? We're playing this awesome survivors like. Uh, we're gonna buy maximum of yams and we will buy one pumpkin. Okay. Exit. All right. Let's get to planting. This is an awesome. Awesome survivors like damage and crop growth speed fishing yield and damage. This one gives us more damage Crop growth would also be nice, but we're, we're fishing y'all. We're going fishing like let me get my things planted. I Want to get a toucan by the way toucans will plant for you. My axolotls will water for me Cows will fertilize things. Ooh, ooh, we're a little slow. There's our water beam. We just got our first one of those do, do, do. Oh, you will see at the center of the screen, um, <clears throat> we get uh, five weapons. Five weapons max. So I think I have one more slot. Amount, size, and damage. Amount, frequency, and damage. Let's go with frequency. It's a beam, so I want it showing up more often. Oh, and then plus amount, so now there's two. Now it goes both sides, which is nice. Okay. We got this, like, what do you call it? Is it like a s ant wasp? Scorpion wasp, what are they called? Um, damage and knockback minus the fishing and mining. What are my fishing and mining speeds right now? Fishing speed is only plus 10%. Mining speed is only plus 20%. So no, I would not like to reduce those. Um, let's reroll. Crop yield, apple spawns, XP gain, damage per plus 1%. Apple spawns. Apples are like um, floor turkeys. Let's get the... Oh, let's get the uh, XP gain. We're gaining a lot of coin gain, so I can lose 3%. I'm probably above that. Um, let's actually see. What, what's my... Come on. Okay. Uh, what is my coin gain? My coin gain is at 7% after the, the lost 3. So, um, cool. Because we have that thing where we gain it for, ga uh, uh, yeah, for gathering weapons, for harvesting weapons. All right. Uh, oh, and there are 15 days. Okay, attacks enemies, the cat. Let's do it. Let's do it. Look at that, little kitty cat running around attacking things. The pets are great. Okay, fishing speed and yield. Let's do that. Okay, I want to I wanna water my plants. And now I want to go over here. We're going to do a bunch of fishing before I go and talk to the ant. Do, 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 do. Now the enemies will start coming, but I'll be fine. Uh, crit chance, resistance, health regen, minus to projectile speed, minus to movement speed. Don't know how I feel about that. Watering speed, watering range, capacity. Sounds good. Or damage and frequency. Let's do capacity. Water capacity, I like that. Watering things faster. Fish spawns and ore spawns. XP gain and crit chance. Effectiveness to future fishing yield changes. Love it. All right. Let's go spend our money now. Because the enemies will be, yeah, attacking soon. Um, okay. Now we'll get the last of that. Okay. Gimme. All right. Weapons wise. Okay. I can boost my tongue lash more. So we'll do that. Cheese fighter sub in for 74 months. Thank you so much. My goodness. My goodness. Uh, drop them bears, y'all. Let's buy some some tongue lash. Let's get that up there. And we got 1990 left. We can buy. Let's buy a bunch of these. The grapefruits first. Those are the big guys. Then we'll buy radishes. 
And that covers us. I should have bought another plot, probably. That would have been a good idea. Okay. Okay, these guys are getting close. Don't love it. I do. I probably need more attack frequency, I think. Um, duration and crop yield, damage frequency, minus to all of our gro uh, growth, sp uh, uh, not growth, gather stuff. Let's get knockback and frequency. Because if I can't attack fast enough, then maybe I can knock them back far enough. Amount, size, and damage. Amount and just damage. I mean, amount and damage looks pretty dang good. Um, amount, frequency, and damage. Yes. Okay. All right. Now I got some, some good tongue lashes going on. Just want my attack frequency up. So next, I would like to focus on damage, I think. For a little bit. Let's do some fishing. I need to be doing fishing and mining more. I've been messing up on that. Uh, let's do a reroll. Attack frequency, projectile speed, <laughs> that's minus damage. I wanted the opposite, but it's a lot of frequency. Those tongue lashes look an awful lot like the whip from Vampire Survivors. Let's look at the description. Um, oh, you can't look at it here. It literally sa <clears throat> says in the description that it's like... Um, it's, uh, it's a tongue attack that looks an awful lot like that whip from that one game. Do, 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 do. So, yeah, they know. <laughs> they're very obvious. Like, they're, they're very much tongue-in-cheek with that. Uh, crop growth speed, crop yield, planting speed. That's all, but I lose my, my stuff I want. Uh, all right, let's just do some knockback and frequency. It's a basic ability, but, you know, kind of need it. Shop is opened. Let me make sure to plant the stuff or water the stuff that I currently have. Okay, I'm on. Hey, a toucan. Cool. He will plant things for me. Um, of all, oh, let's buy another plot. Let's buy boomerangs. Eight of those. They're just like the crosses in Vampire Survivors. Let's buy these more expensive things. I'd rather not have to spend that much time around here. Um, so, let's get to planting. Water capacity and growth speed. Knockback duration resistance. Effectiveness to future damage changes. Minus to frequency. Oof. Let's get... Let's reroll. Damage watering range and watering speed. Duration and yield. Frequency. Farming bullet heaven. Yes. It's very good. I really, really enjoy this game. Um, damage and crop growth speed. Let's do it. Okay. Let's catch some fish. There's a lot of them over here. Fishing pretty fast. All right, speed, health regen. Let's do the speed. More speed will mean that my my water beam will like rotate faster. Should be nice. Let's do some mining. Let's do some watering. Fish spawns and ore spawns up. Let's do this one. I lose damage, but again, the, I think it balances out more. Uh, amount and size. On the boomerangs. Um, max health per 1% resistance. How much plus resistance do we have? We do have some. Let's do it. Because I have been actually getting the resistance boost item. Frequency and knockback over crit. You played gnome for a thousand. What's, the, what's supposed to happen with that? Because again, I don't think I have those things set up. I don't know. When those were made, did Jazzy and Enna just like make those at some point, or has this been around for a while and I just have never had it happen on my stream? Crop growth speed per crop yield. That's nice. So that's like it boosts itself kind of thing. Oh no, I did this by accident. Do 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 do. Okay. But yeah, I have so much built around fishing and stuff that I need to be doing it more. Um, all right. So as you can see, the enemies die at morning, but the bosses don't. Plant seeds. Let's get more seed planting. 
Do, 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 do. Jazz and Anna just have them on for their streams and forget to turn them off. Yeah, that's that's the more the way that it goes. Got it. Okay. Oh, and by the way, the gems, those are the external currency. So those are what you use to do like upgrades and cosmetic stuff um, outside of this. Let's get five on the tadpoles. Let's get four on the lashes. Let's get a new plot. Let's get two new plots. Let's get the most expensive things we can get. And then let's get the next most expensive things we can get. And that's our money spent. Okay. So because I have the toucan now, my plants should get planted at least relatively quickly. Um, I will still need to be coming through and watering them because I do not have my axolotl yet. Which is unfortunate. Bosses drop pets, by the way. Do, 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 do. Okay. Fishing speed and yield. Duration and crop yield. Damage, watering range, watering speed. Let's do that. Amount size and knockback. Um, amount piercing, duration damage. Not worried about crit on this run. You know, different builds. You can get towards like a crit run and stuff. It's just like Vampire Survivors. You know, you start building something and then it's like, okay, now I know what to focus on. Okay. Damage, crop thirst, damage. Tax size crop. Let's do this. Okay. My watering range is now really good. Okay. Grab that. Oh! It's more- I, I got to him immediately as morning broke. Let's max out on the bouncy balls. Let's get some more garden plots. We are now at the maximum for garden plots. Let's buy the most expensive seeds and then the rest of the other seeds and then there we go. Now I do think if you want to make the most money or like the most XP, you probably actually want the um, ad break in four minutes. PC man, you can see that. Thank you for the uh, the note. There will be an ad break in about four minutes. So if you're subscribed, you'll avoid that. Otherwise, you're going to see it. So make that choice. Um, I don't want to increase enemy speed. Uh, you know, attack frequency is something that I've just been building up. So, you know. Does the beagle have a name? Not as far as I know. Not as far as I know. You can see that now. That's super helpful. That's awesome. I love it. Love it. Okay. We're fishing. Look how fast I fish. Or was I just by them earlier? I must have just been by them earlier. Uh, fishing yield, health and duration, knockback, mining speed, damage. What's our fishing speed at? It's plus 30. Let's just do fishing yield. More XP. Just give me the more XP. Give me some of them floor apples. Do, 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 do. It's available outside of mod view? Even better. Damage and duration. Do, 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 do. All right, amount projectile speed. Yep. Again, like I said, haven't been focusing on crits, so I'm, I'm going against whatever the crit ones are. Okay. I'd love to get over... Yeah, here we go. To the minerals. Uh, damage crop growth. Definitely spawning lots of enemies. It's dangerous territory I put myself in. But a couple of our items... A good amount of our weapons actually are piercing, so... That helps. Now, piercing for some is limited. Um... But, like, our beam and our tongue lash have, like, infinite. Whatever you would call it when it can pierce through as many as possible. Come on. Come on. There we go. Hey, Axolotl! He waters him for me. Wonderful. Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. It's not like he does it too fast, but it's, it's you know, faster than me having to run around. Hey, and a Wanderbot! We got a Wanderbot. All right, we're gonna buy five of these. We're gonna buy seven of these. Buy the most expensive. Goodness. Like, I kind of want to save my money now. I mean, like, it's not, it's basically that I don't think I'm gonna be able to plant all of them anyways, so why not wait? All right, I did get a little hurt there. So let's get some fishing done. 
So you might notice that my, my number of seeds up top will be slowly going down. Do, 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 do. But yeah, as you, like, I guess, so the thing to know is that you get zero XP from killing enemies. You get zero XP from minerals. You get zero money from plants. You get zero money from fishing. So you gotta balance those things out that way. Crit damage and damage minus to projectile speed, resistance and attack size minus to frequency. Ooh, we have that thing that boosts our, what does it boost from resistance? Is it health? All right, ad is incoming, y'all. If you're subbed, don't worry about it. If you aren't subbed, worry about it. Um, more piercing, attack frequency, size, knockback, and damage, or damage and attack duration. Let's do this one that kind of builds everything. More piercing, more frequent. Let's do the more frequent. It's already got some piercing. Okay. All right, I do have a little bit of water, so I can help. Damage, knockback, minus to my speeds. All right, what is, what is my... My mining speed is at only 20. My fishing speed is at 30, so I haven't boosted those anymore. So let's let's just go with this. Okay. Tadpole. This one gives a bigger damage boost and get, gives more piercing. So it kind of balances out that last time I didn't take a piercing boost. Uh, attack frequency and projectile speed. Okay. All right. And so, yeah, Wander goes around and picks up little bits of uh, minerals and things. All right, we're going to buy five of those. We're going to buy five of those. We're going to buy three of those. Let's buy the most expensive seeds. Then we'll buy, I guess, a bunch of those. Not going to waste any more money right now. Rerolling does not give you more ticks, um, like stock for weapons. So there's no point in doing that. It's basically like if you just don't like the weapons you have available, you could try another one. All right, we'll do the, the crop growth speed, not worry about apples. Do, 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 do. It's really neat because there are builds, there are characters that allow for very different builds, or at least boosts to very different builds. All right. Starting to get a little overwhelmed by the number of enemies. Not the damage needed to kill them, though. So, attack frequency and speed are what I would like. Fishing speed and yield. Mining speed and yield. No, no, no. Yield for both. Sure. Again, I'm not super relying on the plants. Okay, bouncy balls. Uh, let's get more frequency. Definitely want that. More weapon. Thank you for watering, my little axolotl friend. As I am beset by monsters. These are like those murder hornets, right? Okay. We would like to build our bouncy ball. Well, we'll get five of each. That's what we'll do. And these are all cheap seeds. I'll buy 20 of each. Basically, I'm not buying, like, all the seeds because I had a run once where I ended up having, like, 400 seeds just sitting around. Uh, let's get more mining speed. Let's run by some minerals. Do, 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 do. So, um, there are upgrades in the, you know, in the passives menu, the external menu. Um that make it so that fishing uh, speed, I think, builds fishing, or builds mining speed and vice versa. Um, it's either speed or it's yield. I'm not exactly sure which ones. Um, crop growth speed per yield, XP gain. Let's do the XP gain. Again, our coin gain is actually really high. More cat. 
plus eight to amount. Let's do that. Duration and frequency, mining yield, fishing speed. You know, boosting our fishing speed could be really nice. Just run. Let's go up here because there's probably a lot of fish just sitting in this pond because I haven't been up here for a bit, yeah? Oh, by the way, you can mine and fish simultaneously. Um, okay, this is the one that I was saying is nice because we have also been boosting our resistance. So yeah, situating yourself between a fishing spot and a mineral is optimal play. Do, 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 do. Right, let's harvest some of these so my little dudes can plant some more things. More amount damage and size. My watering speed's real good. Um, damage and attack size, yes. Ore nodes and yield would be good, except that, like, I have so much money. Like, I'm actually realizing, like, I don't really need <laughs> to be mining that much. I should be fishing, you know? So hopefully I'll get another thing that will boost my fishing um, speed slash yield. Uh, new cat! Pet dog! Or... Uh, five on those, five on those, five on those, one more on that. Very expensive raspberries, let's get a bunch of those. Um, and then 20 of these guys. I did go through most of my seeds this time, which is nice. Okay. Damage, frequency, speed, attack size when an ore is mined. So this is one that's like one of those permanent building ones. It's a little late to be getting it, but now I have another incentive to actually go and mine. Do, do, do. Getting some fish. Didn't know I was live already? Oh, it could be because of, like, uh, daylight saving stuff out here. Um, damage and growth speed. Fish spawns and ore spawns. Let's get the damage and growth speed. Fish spawns and ore spawns. I tend to be not... I tend to be the one waiting. Or, or the, 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 they tend to be the ones waiting on me. The ore nodes and the uh, fishing nodes. Nice. I was able to reach both. Okay. Okay. Doki. Resistance will also boost our HP, but projectile speed sounds good to me. Didn't mean to rhyme. Didn't mean to rhyme. Okay. Eek. Let me fish. Let me fish. Ooh, let's go harvest some weapons. Water beam. Amount. Frequency. I like the idea of frequency. Um, more frequency. So much money. Uh, let us get... Part of the reason that I do like 5, 5, and 5, or actually, you know, we'll do max out on that, is because I'm still not exactly sure... Um, let's do this, do a reroll. I'm buying all the most expensive things I can see. I think that's the best way to stock up on seeds. Okay. Um, what was I saying? Got distracted. Do, 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 do. Oh, the weapons. Because I don't fully know exactly when they max out, like how many it takes to max. Like here I am maxed with the tongue lash. I probably bought more seeds. You can see I have an extra tongue lash seed already. It's not gonna do anything for me. It might give you XP. I'm not exactly sure what happens to excess, but I don't think it does anything. Let's do the way increased attack frequency. Boomerang, amount, duration, and size. Yes, so let's do that. Let him bounce around a little bit longer. Okay, let's get... Knockback in frequency? Yeah. Let me fish all the fish. Okay. Damage, duration, and size. Uh, super piercing. My boomerangs will now just hit everything. Which, when you're dealing with hordes of enemies this large, pretty nice. Okay. Apple spawns at the start of each day. Let's do the projectile speed. 
Watering speed, less of an issue. We've only got two more days. It's 15 days um, per round or per level, at least in level one difficulty. Like I said, I've only done level one so far. Every time I've done level two, or I guess I have done level two, I have died very quickly in level two. Um, but we will try that next. Regardless. Do, 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 do. But I'm feeling pretty good. Let's get another axolotl. I've still been having to come through to water a lot. Uh, mining speed and yield. Fishing speed when a fish is caught. So this is, again, one of those builders. That would have been really nice to have had early on. I've gotten it to the point where my fishing speed is so fast that I just walk over them like they're pickups. Do, 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 do. Okay, let's pick up some of these guys. Grab some gems. Let's... Well, the only one we need to max out on is the uh, water. That's way more than I needed to do. Whoops. All right. Pet dog. Exit. Okay. Oh, let's make sure... I, I'm cycling with LBRB to get over to make sure I use those seeds first. Um... Plus two attack size. Oh, plus two resistance is nice because, again, that gives us even more HP than what we were already getting from it. It's a nice big boost. Amount in damage. Damage frequency, size, duration, speed. That one. Even though the other one, it makes it so that you have, like, eight. Right? So you have, like, diagonals and cardinals. Or is it diagonals and orthogonals? I guess cardinals might just be for compass. I don't know. I don't know words. Okay. I do think they were giving me XP. Um, max health and duration minus damage. Projectile speed. Regen. Let's reroll. Let's get something else. Let's get this guy. Damage and frequency. Okay. Mining yield, fishing yield, crit chance, crit chance speed. Resistance and attack size. Let's do... Let's do that. I don't need more mining yield. Again, we're doing fine on money. Fishing is all that matters now. It's me and Stardew. Frog Prutes in Stardew. Oh boy, we got a lot of murder hornets over here. But I'm doing fine. I'm keeping them away from me, which is nice. Damage, duration, frequency, minus crop yield at this point. Not that worried about crop yield. Like I said, one more day. Could I quickly explain the game? This is a Survivors-like, so if you know about Vampire Survivors, um, Deep Rock Survivors, any, any such Survivor-type games, Brotato. It's like that. Um, it has A. It's, it's frogs taking out um, bugs on a farm. That's why it's called Pesticide Not Required, because you are the natural pesticide. Um, the gimmick is that you also farm and gather other resources, which basically means you're moving around the map and like making sure to like drop things off at different places. It's a really nice balance. Um, the way you get XP is through farming. The way you get money is through killing enemies, but also you can get XP through fishing and you can gain money through mining. So it's like you balance those um, actions uh, and... Um, yeah, let's do some re-rolling. Let's buy all of the raspberries. Let's buy a bunch of these guys. Let's move on. I don't need any more. I don't think. Do, 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 do. My goodness, so many enemies. I need all of the attack durations, attack speeds. I don't want more enemy spawns necessarily, though. All right, well, damage and frequency. All right, we're about to take out a couple bosses. Oh, all their stuff is spawning on the outside of the, the water, it looked like. All right, another cat. Another cat. What in God's name have you walked into? The end of a run of pesticide not required. Hold on for the next 20 seconds, and then we will go what is called 
Wumbo. Just y'all wait for the Wumbo. Brian, this game's amazing. It's a farming frog uh, survivor game. Attack frequency, sure. We even though it's got the negative, we we've got ten seconds. Kind of like Atomicrops. I dig it more than Atomicrops because I think the arc, I think it's a better balance. It's slower. The pacing's good though. I like the pacing more. Okay. And here we go. Wombo. Yee. Yeah. We womboed. And there you go. That is that is a completed run of Pesticide Not Required. How neat is this game? How neat is this for a survivor's like, you know? It's just got this nice little added chill component to it. I love it. I love it. Okay. Let us do another run. Um, who was that? Blood Carnation with that resub for 57 months. Happy Tuesday. Thank you so much, Blood Carnation. Um, Y'all, I haven't showed you this guy yet. This is the Carp Anter. That's what it is. Not the uh, Anchor Tech or Architant. It is the Carp Anter. Um, woof. So, um, this is where you can buy cosmetics for your home. Um, and I haven't showed y'all, I do have the shrine and the garden tools. Um, I haven't showed y'all, but, uh, outside, we have like a little farm area of our own. I bought these little pathways. There are other types of things. Let me move my mouse. I don't know why I got up there now. Um, there are other things that we will be building this out with. I don't know if they have any effect other than being cosmetic, but I'm looking forward to seeing what they are. Um, so let's do some of our, our upgrades. Um, I would like to build my resistance, honestly. Just, just do double on that. Oh, I maxed out the resistance, I think. That's why it's yellow. Um, so in my last 400, let's do a crit chance, sure. It's the only one I haven't really upgraded. Uh, and let's look at a different dude. We got all the different frogs. What are the last five I need to unlock? Win a run with less than 10% health left. Reach 20 water capacity. Finish a run without getting hit. That'll be a rough one. Reach 75% or higher move speed, or reach 75% or higher resistance. Those are the ones we need to do, so something to consider for me. All right. Who have I not played with personally? I have not played Bubba. I have not played Stripe. Uh, I have not played Plotty. I have not played Truffle. You can't see Truffle. Um, I've not played as Truffle. Um, I have not played as Sprout, or Pumpkin, or Swifty. So, let's go with, I love this guy, Bean. Let's try out, oh, Pumpkin is a crit build. That's different. I've never really done that. That's interesting. Um, Swifty, attack frequency for 30 seconds after harvesting. Oh, yeah, Swifty is like grow things, harvest things, and then you get like a minor, like a little boost. And so it's like kind of constantly doing that. Um... Do, 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 reduce yield, but increase crop speed. So yeah, you're, you're cycling quickly. Um, he's the guy you want to go for if you want to go for the full capacity. Um, he gets plus six watering capacity, which if I start with plus nine, we're at plus 15 to start with. Um, okay. Damage per crop yield. I like that. So we can do like a really plant focused build here, which last time I was really not working on that. I was more fishing focused. So let's do this. The Stardew Valley update is today. It is, which means it broke all the mods. So we will have to wait a little while for the mod loader to be updated. They're working on it. It probably won't uh, be that long. Is it small attack size? Is that what it said? Minus 50% attack size, effectiveness to future damage change. So, few, okay, so damage boost, not going to really work so well. Attack boost, or attack size, I might want to focus on. Okay, we're going to try a level two. We're going to try a level two. I worried. But I want to be building up. Oh, I have not seen the lawnmowers yet. Are they targeted? I think they're like the fireballs from Vampire Survivors. Let's do this. But yeah, we're going to be very plant-focused on this one, which is good. 
which is good. I'm excited because I actually have on my own been doing my best to really try the non-plant focused ones to really explore the kind of breadth of the game. So getting back to something that's really focused on it is kind of kind of good idea. Damage and resistance, minus to crop growth speed. I want everything crop focused. Crop growth speed. Yield is what I want the most of. Damage ups are not actually that good for me. Uh, so none of these are great for me, so I guess we'll go for the crop growth speed. Okay. Um, pick up range and knockback. Move, move speed, mining yield, fishing yield, minus crop yield. Don't want that. So we will do another reroll. Um, not what I'm looking for. Mining and fishing speed down, though. Not a huge deal. Damage up is only going to be 15% instead of 20%, but that's still not bad. We'll do it. Like, just because they're reduced doesn't mean I have to avoid them entirely, you know? Uh, fish spawns and ore spawns. Minus to crop yield, no. Uh, we'll go with resistance. I think building up our defense when we're going to have to really hover our farm is going to be a good idea. I think. Fishing because my farm is full, so it's not like there's any reason for me to really stick around. I might need to do one more watering, but, you know fish mining speed damage and attack size effectiveness to future projectile speed changes up it's not a bad one those are nice when you're like okay i want to really focus on that one thing okay day's over give me those gems give me these coins i did not make a lot of money this day it's unfortunate um let's get let's get pickup range why not why not? Let me mine this. Okay. Give me a little bit. Okay, there we go. 280. I might want to do a little bit of mining to start with. Okay, new weapon. Let's just build up our lawnmower while we can. That took too much. I can't do a, a, a farm plot. Let's get some potatoes. Okay. Do, 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 do. Ow. Let me water my weapons. Brown. All right, amount and attack size, piercing and projectile speed. I like the piercing. Do 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 do. Because it does seem to be a bit of my limiting factor with killing enemies is that there's a lot of them. And my attack is slow. Okay. I may go run up to the minerals now. Yeah, these guys will grow. Uh, damage, watering, range, and watering speed, fishing yield, and damage. Let's get the watering range and watering speed. I do think that's nice. you grab those coins and these coins okay now we're in a good spot for the shop oh we can get a little axolotl we'll buy you we are gonna buy one plot we are then gonna buy weed whacker and that actually was all my money okay whoops i did not get a lot of seeds this day is not gonna be great for me for um for crops but it's the yield that I need to build up anyways, so I'm just going to focus on, you know, trying to do um, fishing and mining then. So, um, the weapon that I got is the Weed Whacker. You'll notice it's like a little blade that spins around me. Um, so, a little orbital. I dig it. It'll be good for taking out the enemies that get a little bit close. Planting speed, watering speed, watering range. More resistance. Let's do the, let's re-roll on this. Coin gain and pickup range. Effectiveness to future projectile speed changes. Sure. Getting one of those pretty early on can be nice. It's a multiplier, you know. Balatro rules, y'all. You need chips, you need molt, and you need multiplier. Do, 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 do. The multiplier, multiplier. The Markiplier. 
Okay, cool. Let's mine. Let's get all that money. Blade. Okay. Fish. I don't want the minus effectiveness. Damage up, crop thirst down. I think that's good. Frog Sun. Indeed. Indeed. Celebrate the Frog Sun. Rejoice. Ooh, we're gonna go run over there and hit all them fish real quick. Uh, let's boost our Weed Whacker. Let's max out on that. Um, let's buy another plot. And let's buy all the cheapest seeds. Cool. And then I can fill the fields. Cheapest seeds usually have the highest water cost. So that's like the downside, but I think they also end up giving you the most overall. They just require the most attention. But I have improved my watering range and speed. Amount, duration, and size. I need increased size because I, I have very small. Do, 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 do. Yes, uh, amount, knockback. Yes. Shroom. Okay. Okay. We're mining. Up to coin gain would balance out the other one, but I don't want to reduce my water capacity or anything. Health per resistance, minus enemy health, future effectiveness to coin gain change. Let's do the enemy health, enemy damage. So, like, reducing the enemy's health will be nice. I think, you know? I'm turning them into glass cannons, but I just have to avoid. Damage, frequency, projectile speed. That seems pretty good. Planting speed, also good. This goes along with me pretty well. Let's do this one. Do, 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 do. All right, I need another weapon. Just hope they give me a good one. I need a good, like, like targeted one, like or, or like one I can point. Duration and yield. Yield gives us damage. Yield gives us damage. It's actually our best way of getting damage, right? Will you die, please? I would love to use what you give me on this shot, but I don't think I'm going to be able to. Okay, well then, items-wise, ooh, I would like to get a bunch of these mower blades. Um, and let's buy the cheapest stuff. Really try and do that. Planting speeds up, so that'll help. Okay. Nice. I love it. My little dude's running around watering stuff. Mower blades. Let's go with amount and damage. I have yet to determine if like the ne the um, the negatives to like damage gains if they apply to like the the upgrades that the weapons get on themselves. I would assume they don't. Right? Because that would really nerf just a lot of upgrades in general. So I assume that refers to just, like, passive items. I may be wrong, though. Um, attack size, pickup range, watering range. I think XP gain? Not a bad idea. Alright. Did I grab that guy's chest? No, it's all the way down here. Okay. Fish ponds per fishing speed. Minus two attacks by adding uh, speed and gain. Ooh. Effectiveness to fishing yield changes. Fertilizes crops. Sure. It increases yield. That's nice. Because we're also going to be building yield on our own. All right. Now we got some monies. Capybara! Buy it. Um, I would like to increase to boomerang. Let's do that. Let's buy another plot. Let's buy the cheapest things. Okay. 
Do 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 If I haven't looked at chat in a little bit, I apologize. Very focused. Very focused. How y'all doing? Hope y'all are well. Let's get fishing. Let's get fishing. Okay, cool. We wanted swift things before. Choice made. Okay. When my blades come up. It's so good. That's why I want frequency and um, speed. Projectile speed. Spoder! I apologize. There is an arachnophobia mode, I think. I apologize for not warning of that. I assume those of y'all who are uh, arachnophobic, though, you know when there's a bug game, you kind of avoid it. Um, duration, size, damage. Speed, crit damage, damage. Let's do the, the uh, duration. Boomerangs. Speed and frequency. Watering speed, watering range, water capacity, damage, frequency, speed, crit. I mean, I've been doing a lot of fishing this time around, but it has been good. Watering speed and watering range and capacity. Let's do that. I am still, at the end of the day, the best thing for me to do is focus on plants with this build. With our yield, you know? Come on, blades. Kill the enemy. Let's grab all this stuff. Damage and frequency. Crop yield! I lose capacity, but that's worth it. Because yield gives me damage. Okay. Let's... These are all weapons that I don't have. I don't love them. I'm gonna use a reroll. Tadpole. I love Tadpole. You've seen Tadpole, though, today. So let's go for twin sides. They're not bad. Let's max out on those. I will not buy another plot this day. Instead, I will buy a lot of seeds. Okay. Do, 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 do. Do I have a toucan? I don't think so. Eek. Twin sides. Amount and speed. Sure. So you'll see they kind of like swing around me. Damage and frequency. Yes, please. I just want them out all the time. Okay. Do, 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 do. Spider's almost dead. Everything just takes a little bit of time, you know? It's fine. Do, 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 do. Oh man, I want my my mower blades or my my weed whackers out all the time. Okay, duration and yield, yield and spawns, growth speed and damage. Let's do the duration and yield. This one reduces my water capacity, which is a pain. It does do more of it, but you know. Hey, I wanted one of y'all. Cool. Let me grab a bunch of this. Watering speed and watering range and capacity up. This is a good balance for that other one that uh, keeps costing me. That's going to be reducing my capacity. If I had planned ahead, this could have been the run where I um, um, got the, the increased, you know, get how, how many did it want? 20 water capacity. Um, we are gonna go- oh, what level am I at? I'm only at level 3 on it. I'm gonna max out on just the blades. I think that'll be worth it. We will buy one more plot. We will buy the most expensive things, and then some of those. Okay. Oh, wow! Next time I should just buy a bunch of cheap ones. I didn't notice how many seeds they had. There were like 40. Um, XP gain and coin gain. It's day 8. Getting the coin gain, this will eventually get me up to, like, I mean, definitely more than that. And no reduced movement speed. I don't like the remo reduced movement speed. If I ever get to the point where I'm just that too too much slowly, then I, I'm just I'm in trouble, you know. Do do do. Ooh boy, see already, not in the best of places. Ooh those blades though, when they come out. 
Okay, uh, more amount damage duration. Attack size frequency knockback. Let's do this one. It's the frequency is what I want. Not as worried about it doing higher damage as much as I am about it doing consistent damage. So frequency up again. Right, because look at that. Like, when I can get it hitting them. It's incredible. So everything I can do to increase my attack frequency is what's the uh, the goal for all of our upgrades going forward. Shroom! Look at all that. Wrecked. Let's grab an apple, heal a little bit. Uh, duration, frequency, speed, duration, attack size, and water capacity. Let's do this. Okay, cool. Plant speed, water speed, water range, damage, watering range, water speed, pickup range. Okay, I'll get another broccoli. For the damage boost. Okay, and let's balance out the water capacity. There we go. Uh, another watering. I think that that was what was slowing me down the most. Knockback, mining speed, damage, rerolls on level up, apple spawns, healing, ore spawns, resistance, XP gain. Let's do this guy. I wanted it before. Again, it's the frequency. Uh, okay, hey, a toucan! Um, let's buy another plot. Let's get five of the mower blades. Let's max out on the lawnmower. Um, let's get as many wheat seeds as we can. 17. It's not even that much. It's not even that many. Considering. Oh boy. Oh, I'm stuck on a tree. I was like, what's going on there? Do, 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 do. More piercing? Yeah. Frequency. It's all about the frequency. It's like when you have enough passive stuff to build your um, damage up externally, then it's like, I just want my attacks going more. Uh, I think we're going to do the, the straight damage knockback frequency. Okay. Y'all, I love this game! I absolutely love this game so much. Frequency. Okay. Give me all the fish in the world. This is, this is Price, coming at you from Stardew Valley. Give me all the fish. Uh, crit chance, mining speed, damage, knockback, damage and resistance. Wrath is really, oh, wait, wait. My damage upgrades are reduced. Let's go for attack size and, and capacity. Do, 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 do. Yeah, the, the seeds didn't even fill my farm. Uh, amount and piercing, amount one piercing, frequency, yeah. Because I just need, like, my, my mower blades up 24-7. That's what I need, you know? Or not my mower blades, my, my weed whacker. That's that one. Um, More of that. Let's just kind of swing wide. Do, 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 do. Okay. Um. Let's build. Let's get our scythe up. Maybe that will um, give us a nice. Um. What you call it? Like a, almost like an orbital, like a nice little area around ourselves. Okay. Get to planting my two cans. Damage, frequency, projectile speed. We love it. But yeah, who needs crits? Right, normal cat. Oh gosh. Uh, amount, speed, attack size, amount, damage, crit damage, frequency, knockback. Let's do some of this. Self-sharpening is a major snowball. It is. It really is. Oof. 
I didn't grab it, but I know it's good. Like when I did a mining run, there's a little guy named Collier who's like all mining focused. Oh, love him. We might play with him next just because I like him. Frequency, size, crit chance, damage, knockback. I feel like that's like, there's so many benefits to that. Frequency, crit damage, attack size, projectile speed, knockback duration. Let's do frequency again. Because, like, look, I'm getting surrounded. Some more knockback would also be nice for sure. So I do think that my fishing builds my fishing, right? So I think the more I fish, the greater the yield or the speed, something like that. So I should be fishing more. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. It's like when I get into that danger zone where neither of my moves are going. <laughs> They're going most of the time. All right, there we go. Cool. Let's get as much um, attack duration as possible today. Or not duration, frequency. Crop yield. Gotta do it. It reduces my other stuff, but that's fine. Fishing yield when an ore is mined. That's a good cycler. I love the ones where one thing builds a different thing, because then you just, like, you back uh, back and forth it. Sure, go with it. Crab obtained. It's a good one. Okay, I'm a little bit worried about what's, what's incoming right now. Let's... Let's go 10 on the mower blades, 5 on those. Max out the spensives, then get the, the less spensives. Okay, duration and speed, gain and crit, damage and attack size, damage and crop growth speed. I don't want to increase their speed even more than it already is. I'm really looking for attack frequency. The blue feather, the chance to gain an additional pet every time you gain a pet is a real good one. I've, I've had runs where I've had Tons of pets. All right, I need the cat. I need the assistance of a, a feline murderer. Okay, mower blade, let's go. More duration. Eek. Uh, frequency, just gotta do it. Ooh. I speaking at the start of the day. It's a little bit late for that one. That's again, it's one that's like compounding. Um, mining yield when a fish is caught. Again, that's one that would have been nice to have had a lot, a lot earlier. But with all of these, I'm not going to get minus to crop yield. Because for those who didn't see when we uh, selected this character, crop yield boosts our damage. We're a, we're a farming focused character. Okay, let me get out of here. It's like there's just slight moments where I'm very much in danger because neither of my orbitals are going. Okay. Attack size and capacity? Sure. Do 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 so, weapons-wise, our boomerang is very low. Let's get a toucan. Boink. Um, so, we're going to go five on the boot. Let's just do five of each, and then the additional one will go on the boomerang. Then let's grab, again, the most expensives, and then the least expensives. I actually used every dollar. Never seen it before. Never seen a zero other than the beginning of the level. And I think at this point, I think I start with money now because of upgrades. Not positive. Wow. The bees. Boomerang, crit chance. Boomerang, piercing in frequency. Fishing speed when a fish is caught. Little late, but also not, not that late. Okay, damage frequency or turbo piercing. 
The attack frequency on this one is so good. And eight piercing is still really good. Um, yield and damage. Yield and fishing speed. Apple spawns knockback. The the massive yeah nine 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 piercing is basically just means you can it's it'll pierce everything. Um, duration damage knockback. Duration's good. Duration's good. Higher duration means that we have a greater likelihood of one of our two major protective orbitals being activated. And our knockback, I think, is what's really doing it. Catching fish. Doo -doo -doo. I think we've almost reached... Yeah, yeah, we have now reached, I think, normal weapon size. Finally. Um... More axolotls. I think our planting has been fine. Yeah, all of our seeds are down. I bought so many seeds. And they're all planted. It's the watering that I need. Okay, yeah. That's what I just got, right? Shop is open. We're on day 13. Let's just fill up on our money a little bit. All right, let's make our way to the shop before things are too uh, surrounded. Okay. So, we our boomerang is the lowest. We're going to go five on the mower. We're going to max out on that guy. We are going to buy... Wow, the watermelons are a thousand apiece. Let's buy them. That will not fill our field at all, but that's fine. I think it'll be easier for my little dudes to water it and keep uh, ahead of it. Um, let's just keep going with the duration there. I don't think it's that, that bad. Games like this are... Yeah, they are just bonkers, aren't they? They're wild. I love them. I love them so much. Ore spawns per mining speed. Let's do a reroll on this one. Oh, more duration's fine by me. Hey, I got a uh, an achievement for... Oh, I left the, the fit my face over here, but that's fine, because there's actually nothing... Um, no info over there that matters. Uh, I maxed out this guy for the first time. Amount, piercing, speed, duration, size. We want frequency. We want frequency. Tax size when an ore is mined. Well, I could go mine some ores. I think I can pretty much sit still a little bit. The blades. Man, it would be fun to do an orbital run on this game. You totally can. We Maybe we do that. Maybe we do that. I had said I wanted to play as Collier. Ta yield. Absolutely. Duration and size. Yeah. Oh, I meant to hit the other one. Whoops. Let's do that one. Ultra piercing on these guys. So the boomerangs will fly through everything. The mower blades are doing more of the damage. Just doing some fishing. All right, now I should go sit upper left, where generally you can fish and mine at the same time. What's our damage at, I wonder? 178%, nice. It's mostly from, from crop yield. Okay, all right, and we're done on weapons. So now, buy all the seeds. Wasn't even all of them. Okay, so it's good for me to come help with the first plantings. Oh, wow, that's right, it's the hornet stage. So many of them. Ooh! Health per resistance, I think that's probably good for- Oh, I should have grabbed the other one, I didn't even look. The other one was like a much better health one. I think it was the mantis that hit me, maybe? Or no, it was just in one of the gaps. The more I fish, the faster I fish. So it's like... It's definitely worth it to run around. Okay, it's starting to get hard to see. <laughs> Damage, duration, frequency. Minus to yield. I don't love the minus yield, even though all the rest of that looked so appealing.
Do, 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 do. Mining and fishing. Fishing and mining. Okay, okay, okay. My goodness. Yeah, I really... I think what I really love is the way that you can build abilities on top of other abilities. Like, X percent this for X percent that. So it's like it really encourages, like, builds. Hey, another cat! Bye. Alright, the most expensive. Then the next most expensive. Then the next most expensive. We almost purchased all the seats. Which is like, that's a first for this run. Cool. Max health size damage. Okay, cool. More damage up. Oh, wait, I forget. I only get half of that. So I really... It's less valuable for me. <sighs> Let's do the knockback up. I do think that the knockback has been a big part of how these orbitals are saving me. They're not necessarily killing them in one go. Right? My damage isn't necessarily great. But... If I can knock them back far enough, I can just keep them away, right? More plant watering. <clears throat> Let's do the damage. <clears throat> Goodness, I just, all of a sudden, I got a frog in my throat. I wanted to do the, the damage up. At this point, that stuff is useful because, again, it is the end of the run. We have 25 seconds. Do, 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 do. Make sure to grab what I can. Just want to make sure to grab all the gems, is the big thing. If there are any of those around. We got a Wanderbot. Yeah, 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 PC man. I mentioned it earlier, but I guess you weren't here. But yeah, Wander's in the game. Isn't that great? He's a skin for the Golden Retriever who goes out and gets you items. So he wanders out and grabs me stuff. We're going Wombo! Was this spring two? I think it was. Yeah, or summer two. Survive summer two. We un... Uh, okay. Bunch of gems for doing some accomplishments. Or achievements. We went Wombo! Okay, we got some more gems. Minus the crop thirst I could get. Plus to rerolls. I kind of I kind of like the idea of getting plus to rerolls. <clears throat> so this is the higher level of the tier... You know, system over here. So, uh, I've gotten like, as long as you buy one in a previous level, then it unlocks the next highest level. So these are kind of like the really expensive high level boosters. So I think we'll get the rerolls. That's a lot of power right there. Um, if you ever make a game, you're hiding the stumpy somewhere in it. I'll allow it. Um, okay. So. Uh, I'm gonna take a quick break, just kind of like stretch, get myself some more coffee and stuff. We'll come back. Y'all look at the characters and let me know, who do you think maybe we should look at playing as? You know? You just discovered this game and you're already enthralled. It's so good. It's so good. So I'll leave this screen up. Y'all, um, look over these guys and, um... You know, we'll talk about maybe picking one of them. Um, this guy over here, this is Collier. So like I said, he's the one you gain damage as you mine um, and your yield goes up and everything like that. So it's like, he's very, very, um, very good. I like him. Uh, what else? Bubba is uh, HP focused. So you, um, you get things for building your HP. Uh, Swifty. Swifty is about growing things quickly and getting little boosts while you are growing things. So you just want to be like cycling through growing a bunch of stuff. Um, yeah. But yield will always be low. Two frogs in a trench coat. Human. Uh, I think it's three frogs. Um, so this one's all about like attack speed, having your weapons out all the time. Obviously, crits aren't going to work, and um, damage ups are less effective. But with as much attack speed and whatnot, you know, again, it balances. 
What else? Swifty starts with the uh, Scarecrow, which is like leaving bombs behind you. Yeah, because you can see the one on the bottom, it's like you can see its feet, and then you can see the eyes in the middle, and then you can see the, the one at the top. Yeah. Uh, what else? Dr. Hops, I've beaten it with. He's apple focused. You gain HP for getting apples. Finn is fishing. Love Finn. Stripe is instantly. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, I did play a little bit of Stripe. Stripe's neat because you plant your stuff and it will not really grow that well on its own. But as you mine and as you fish, they pop. Like they grow instantly. So he's a really good one for going and and doing that. Um, aren't apples a doctor's mortal enemy? No, they, they, they survive on only apples. Bean. Damage when a crop is harvested, attack size when a crop is harvested. So yeah, he's all about harvesting crops, but your frequency goes down. Mignon is the pet build. Love Mignon. Uh, we did Sprout. Uh, okay, we got Swifty. We, okay, we've looked at every- oh, Billy Bob. Um, planting and growth focused. So, farm boy. Uh, okay. And then we need to- let's try and do one of these. Reach 20 water capacity could be good. Higher move speed or higher resistance. Okay. Crit build. Crit could be fun, and I haven't really done it. Okay. But I have gotten high crit from the Greg from accounting before, I think. We could try pumpkin. Let's try pumpkin. I haven't tried pumpkin. Look at him. He's so cute. Uh, I spent my money, right? Oh, I still have a bunch. Um, watering range. Planting speed. Crop yield. Apple spawns. Fishing yield. Let's see. Coin gain. Oh, there's crit over here as well. So why don't we build up our crit a little bit over here? Double it. There we go. Okay. Let's do it. Crit focused. Let's try another level two. Uh, just to remind myself. How does our boost work? Okay, it's just overall crit chance, overall effectiveness. So as far as growing things, everything's normal. Regular damage ups aren't great. Enemies are very dangerous. That's the main thing. Enemies are very dangerous. All right, we're going to Autumn. All right, you can see I have the fairies, so they are orbitals. I would say they're, like, the closest to the, um... What do you call them? I thought they're supposed to be orbitals, but they actually, like, stick around, like, a, a center area. Um, sort of like the Bible in, uh, Vampire Survivors. Shroom. Gonna try to be doing a little bit of everything. Crit, fishing, attack size, more effectiveness to future crit chance changes. So even more crit, right? So that's good. Because that's our build. And you can like over crit, I believe, because I got a triple crit before. Are the seasons just for aesthetics? As far as I can tell, there are different enemies that spawn in terms of like visually. I don't know if they're that different mechanically. Damage, attack size, crop yield. Significant HP issues. Right, that's not a bad idea. Coin gain's not... I don't think it'll be a huge issue. Um, I just need to make sure I'm, like, mining. Which I can build on here. Let's do that. And I want to remember to build all the crit that I can. Because that's the build. Okay. Mining speed, mining yield. The fairies kind of seem like homing or orbitals. Sort of. Yeah, they just kind of have like a nice speed to them to where they kind of whip through, it seems. Uh, Rerolls on level up. Fish spawns or spawns. That's right, I have two rerolls now. Crit damage. Fishing speed. Damage up. Mining speed down. Resistance, move speed, attack size down. Mining yield when a fish is caught, that sounds great. Considering how I just talked about how I just need to make sure that I'm mining, right? Okay, so first things first, new weapons. I want the bouncy balls. 
then, you know, I want to buy a new plot, but I should probably get seeds, you know? Oh, you know what? I just bought a bunch of seeds and I still have enough for a plot, so let's do it. Okay. Doot, 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 doot. Get some water. <laughs> Eek. I need my things to grow so I can have another weapon. <laughs> the fairies are going to be great later on. Right now, not as good. But now we got Bouncy Ball. So Bouncy Ball is going to help a lot because it's a targeted move, right? Fishing Yield in Aura's Mind. Oh, we got the double. How exactly do weapons leveling works? You get those from the fields. Those are what you grow. The tall boys, I know, right? Um, the daddy long boys, don't love them. Um, so plants give you XP and you also grow weapons from weapon seeds. Uh, enemy kills give you money. Uh, fishing gives you XP and mining gives you money. Doo -doo -doo -doo. But yeah, the only way to get weapons is to grow weapon seeds. Okay, let's do a little bit of this action. Ooh, that mining was fast. Uh, more effectiveness to crit changes, awesome. Coin gain when a weapon is harvested, that's always a good one to get early on. Let's do that. Oh, let's buy a toucan. Weapon wise, let's boost the bouncy balls. And then let's buy a bunch of seeds, let's get some raspberries. That's all I can afford. Cool. All right, well, it's one field's worth, but that's fine. Gives me more time to uh, fish. Effectiveness to coin gain, so that would boost what we just did. But let's go for uh, crit chance and attack size up. Because if we look at our crit chance right now, we're at plus 95%. So if I can boost my crit um, chance and my crit oof, damage, um, then we're going to be in a good spot. Because now crit damage up is going to be, you know, essentially damage up. Um, crop growth speed and water capacity, projectile speed and planting speed, attack size and crop yield. Wasn't crop yield bad or something? I can't remember what our negatives were. No, just damage. Just damage. Okay. Bouncy ball, damage and duration. Let's do damage and duration. Should we be concerned that we're buying another animal? No, they're friends. They're friends. We freed them. I, I, we f they're our friends. Mine. Thank you. Fish. I forget, do I have an axolotl in this one? I don't think I do, huh? No, we're still early. All right, yeah, weapons are... Give me a little bit of issue right now, but we're fine. Fishing yield and damage, coin gain and pickup range, attack size and water capacity. The fishing, the yield and the fishing damage, or damage and fishing yield isn't bad, except we get very low on those. But crit damage, we're losing some water. But wait, did I get the wrong one? No, I grabbed that one. It didn't reduce my water capacity as far as I could tell, or did it? And I just have not been paying attention to what my water capacity was. Maybe it did. Maybe nine was what I was at. Okay, let's build. Um, let's get the blades. Yeah. Yeah. And then, for XP-wise, let's get a bunch of these potato seeds. Our little guy, our toucan, will help plant them. We're hiring their services. There you go. Yeah, 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 because they're only here for like 15 days, and then, you know, we have to rehire them the next season. You know? If you think about it. So really, they're seasonal contractors, if anything. You're glad this is the day you came back to Twitch after months of inactivity? You picked a good game to come watch. That's for sure. 
Alright, alright, alright. Get away from me, Squapanuck. Amount and damage. Let's just do amount. Our damage is based off of crit. But we have a 100% crit rate now, right? Right? Did I get another one? No, 95. But crit damage up 30%, so... Nice. Fish spawns and yield way up. I like that. I like that, because that's a lot of XP. It's day four. It's an early XP boost. You want that. Early game XP boost. Profit. Damage and knockback. Attack size when Nora's mind. We love to see that one. And we mine pretty quickly, right? Yeah, look at that. Okay. Um, stock is six. You know, I want to show you guys the mole turrets. So even though normally I would go for just boosting the bouncy balls, we're going to get the mole turrets for y'all. Let's make sure I'm on the right seeds. I am. Do, 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 do. Okay, give me, please, some crit damage ups soon. Because, you know, the fishing yield and the mining stuff, it is getting me, like, more opportunities at that stuff, but also I haven't been getting any. 95 is still pretty much guaranteed crit. Yeah, I personally, in any game, if I hit 60% crit, I treat my run as if I am always critting. You know what I mean? In any roguelite. Because at the end of the day, if you have a greater than 50% um, likelihood of critting, you know, it's going to be happening all the time. You can rely on it to be a part of your build. Ooh, that was a big hit from them. Wow, they really do a ton of damage. <sighs> Crit chance up. I mean, that would get me there. So now we're at 100%. Okay, get some XP. Let's see if I can't do a little bit of attacking here. I should buy some more, um, let's see, crit chance of crit damage, hell yeah. Um, some more plots now, I think. Resistance and move speed. We can do that. Toucan! Farm plot! Um, weed whacker. I love the weed whacker. And then, ooh, watermelons. I can. I could only afford one. Let's get some more seeds to fill out the the farm. Let's make sure we're on blades. Plant the blades first and foremost. All right, we got mole turret. All right, look out for little moles to spawn. Do 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 do. There's one, out in the water. Okay. Do, 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 do. Weed whacker, amount, duration, size. HP regen might help, yeah. For sure. A lot of HP up stuff, and, and some resistance as well. The enemy damage is super boosted in this one. Amount and crit chance. Uh, getting over 100% crit chance, as I mentioned before, is definitely worth it because you can double crit, triple crit, etc. Retrieve loots or attacks enemies. Let's let's attack enemies. Pick up range, projectile speed. Resistance and crit chance. Minus on fishing speed is fine, because I think I boost my fishing speed whenever I fish, right? Or whenever I mine? One of those? Or at least yield goes up. Do, 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 do. Mining, please. Mining's how I make my money. Okay, I really could use some watering capacity, though. Reducing that was a pain. Mine, please. 
Minerals give a ton of money. Okay, so weapon rise. Let's go five on the bouncy balls, four on the blades. Get another plot. Let's buy a ton of these and those and a couple of those. Wow, all right. Seed number's going up. Damage and frequency, but lose all those speeds. Crit chance and mining speed up, but projectile speed down. I'm okay with that. Okay, okay, okay. The damage is big, though, that they're doing to me. Like, as you can see, I'm having to go wide, which means danger. Okay, okay. Serpentine, serpentine, serpentine. There's an apple. Give me that. Woo! Dodging. Eek! Okay. Uh... Crit damage. Yes, I'm, I'm okay to lose the mining speed. I'm okay for it. Ours is already really fast. I need that crit damage. I need some more attack frequency. This is where that HP regen would really come into play. All right, frequency. Let me get some money. I didn't get a lot of money that day because I was just running. All right, they're gonna start spawning. Let me grab this apple. Okay, need to get to the shop. Let me in. Let me in. Okay, damage and planting speed, knockback, mining speed, knockback, actually. Uh, bouncy balls, let's max it out. Boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. It's like I need to be here to grow my plants. Um, water for me, thank you. Crit damage and crit chance. Okay, cool. Eek! Oh, I'm in trouble. Oh, I'm in trouble. Definitely need some HP regen of some sort. Gosh, just like last time. It's when I'm in those periods of time where I have no weapons going. Um... Chance to gain an additional pet whenever recruiting one. Chance to gain an additional pet whenever recruiting one. Crit chance mining speed. I mean, these, I love these because if you get them all the way, it's a guarantee, right? We're on day eight. Honestly, let's give it a try. Even though I just realized I really should be re rolling to try and get HP based things. But I want more pets! Crit damage. Apple healing crop yield. Projectile speed. Fish spawns per fish speed. This one's a good one. Chance to gain an additional pet again. Okay, now I got it. That's 75%. All right. What did we talk about percentages earlier? That's a guarantee. <laughs> okay, there we go. Max health and regen. Thank you. That's exactly what I was looking for. Exactly what I was looking for. Give me the mining. Okay. Stop it. Yeah, let's get another little dude. Let's. Are we out on weapons? Bouncy ball's almost maxed, so let's get five of those. Let's get the rest on blades. Then, big guys. Next big guys. Oh no! Oh, I'm in trouble. Oh, I'm in trouble. And y'all, it's two o'clock. What about the moles? The moles are good, but the uh, the blade is gonna be better to protect me 
Um, because the moles aren't, like, next to me all the time. Oh boy. Alright, that's gonna be the end! I think we're gonna reach the end here. Ooh. Oh goodness. Serpentine, Serpentine, Serpentine! They just do so much damage, right? Because they get the 100% boosted damage. Oof. Oh god. I just gotta survive like 20 more seconds. Give me that! It's not a lot, but it's something. Oh, I see another one down there. Oh, dang it. Oh, okay, the fence doesn't count. The fence doesn't count. I can walk around the fence. It's not a tree. Repeat, the fence is not a tree. Crit damage. Okay. Oh, no! Ooh. Crit damage. I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm okay. We made it. Attack frequency. I just need these things moving faster. No pets for today. Let's get some more mole turrets. The rest are going on these guys. Oh boy, I'm not even going to buy more seeds because I have a lot still to grow. Right, I need you to die because then I can get double pets. Okay? And that's what I want. We're going to get Double axolotls. Look at that. Look how many little dudes watering my plants I got. Attack size and capacity. Pickup range. Knockback mining speed and damage. Down on the fishing speed. The knockback, though. I would love some HP, though. <laughs> well, fishing spawns and fishing yield. Amount frequency and crits. Oh boy. Oh boy. Alright. I think I've reached the danger zone. Of no return. Oh gosh. Give me a pathway. Give me a pathway. Woo wee. Goodness. The magic wand. I forget what the wand is. Um... Right now, though, I just want to make these things more <laughs> effective. For protection purposes. Okay, 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 okay. Do all the mining. Now do all the fishing. Give me all the XP in the world. Come on, come on. I wish you he uh, healed on level up. Okay. Just gotta take advantage of the blade locations. Alright. See, now having these guys over here doing all the planting for me is wonderful. With all these little axolotls. I don't have to water at all. Alright. Mount damage duration. Frequency and knockback. Again, knockback. Very important, I think. Ah, projectile speed and planting. Let's reroll. Minus to crit damage. Mm. Do attack saves. Oh, goodness. Give me that apple. Like, I don't go for, like, apple healing stuff because you need to find the apples, but I might need to. Fairy dance. Oh, that's the fairies that surround us. So, actually, let's... Let's max out our fairies. Yeah. Do, 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 do. It's like, I knew it was just something that I've done before. Okay. Ooh. I would love to kill that spider. And then maybe get a bunch of cats. Crit, da crit damage. Oof. I see an apple. I see an apple. Yeah, I wish harvesting healed you or something. 
frequency. If I can be knocking them back. He's almost dead, he's almost dead, he's almost dead. Okay, cool. Well, I guess we plant more seeds. I need to get down there so I can get my upgrades. Eek! Come on! Okay, they're about to die. Alright, cool. Give me all my things! Fairy dance, frequency and speed. Yes. Fairy dance, crit chance and frequency? No, crit damage! Duration and size, projectile speed, da damage! All the crits. Okay. Crit damage and coin gain. Let's do it. My watering capacity is reduced. Guess what? I have like six little dudes doing it for me. Don't worry. Crit damage, crit chance. Okay. Okay. Gimme. Alright, so... <laughs> another another two two cans. Uh, let's go five on y'all. Five on y'all. Five on y'all. Back to that. Then the most expensive. And there we go. Okay. Okay. Ugh. I forgot it's going to be a harder day. I need my things to grow so I can level up my, my weapons so I can be slightly stronger to be able to potentially deal with this onslaught of pain. Amount, duration, frequency, size. Amount, damage, crit chance, crit damage, projectile speed. Frequency is nice. And four more. That We'll do that. We'll do that. Because, again... Oh, it's about, like, the knockback and stuff, you know? Like, look at that. That keeps him at bay pretty well. But I have to stay within it. Which is unfortunate. But it's not bad. Not bad to create a little safe zone for me. Create me a little fishing safe zone. Do it. Cowards. Cool. Cool. I like it. I like it a lot. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. The safe zone's gone. The safe zone's gone. Oh, my God. All right. Um, turbo piercing. Kill everything, please. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Hey, I survived until morning once again. <laughs> oh. Such a nightmare. All right. Five of those. Five of those. One, two, three of those. The rest on those. Bunch of these. Bunch of those. Bunch of those. All right. Oh, I don't even have a full plot thing. I thought I already did. My goodness. It's day 13 and I have like half a field. Okay. I need heals. Man, they really don't want to give me a cat. Duration and size and damage. Yeah, that works for me. Oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh. Oh boy. Safe zone, please. Safe zone, please. Safe zone, please. Okay, come on. Come on. Weed whacker to max. Crit chance, crit damage. Health regen. Okay, yeah. Hey, we reached 75% or higher resistance. So that, I think that unlocks a character. Look at all my little, my little moles. Okay. Now the fairies are helping a lot. Uh, frequency. Yeah. Frequency is way more important, I think. Mole turret maxed. Okay, let's do it. All right, so let's buy the rest of the field. Let's buy the most expensive things. And there we go. All right, the fairy protective field 
It was nearly a run end. There have been several times that have nearly ended this run. And now that we've maxed our weapons, I'm feeling much better about this. It's when the bosses show up because I can't stay in the protective zone for that long. Enemy damage weighed down. My damage down a little bit. Duration sounds really good. Actually. Because if I can keep my, my fairies up long enough. I wonder if I'll get to a point where um, I'm recharging fast enough that they overlap. Okay, okay, okay. Up, oh, double. Okay, okay. Lots of money. Protect me. Thank you, fairies. All right. Let's grab all this stuff. Good god. <laughs> Got all this money now. <laughs> like, the way it just got so out of control with the money. Max health and regen? Yeah, I can take my resistance down now that I uh, got it above 75%. Why not? Another toucan. Wow, they really just want me to go all toucans. Toucan Sam showing up. All right. I have bought all the seeds. You know what? Let's do a reroll. Let's buy even more seeds. There is absolutely no way that these are all getting planted. I have... Yeah, like, I mean, you can see up there. It's like 200 seeds. Okay. Max health and attack size. Sure. Ooh, boy. See, I'm still very... Uh, squishy. Oh my god, the only ones they're giving me! Axolotls and toucans. You know, I went and I got all those upgrades so that I can get multiple, multiple pets. Alright, well I guess I'll take the capybara. They, they listened to me as I whined. I wanted a cat! Max health, frequency, damage and frequency. Alright, we're almost done. We're going to just go ahead and grab that. I'm not doing much more fishing or mining. It's not, it's last day. We're not even going to be spending any of the money we make. Oh, the wave of the, uh, the mower blades is so good. What up, Sin? Yeah, how's it going? We're playing some, uh, pesticide not required. We're going Wombo! Yeah! Heck yeah. Survive Autumn 2. We want to run as Pumpkin. Sir Hops a lot. Sir Hops a lot has been unlocked. Oh boy. Frog. New Frog. This is a fun game to watch. Good to hear. Yeah, it's a fun one to play. It's a fun one to play. All right, we can spend another 50 or 5k. We'll get that minus to crop thirst. So now I have all the, the uh, top, second from the top tier, silver tier, we'll call it. Um, uh, I, uh, upgrades, so that's nice. 16, 15. Um, sure, let's get some move speed. Upgrading move speed is not a bad idea. Is there anything I haven't upgraded? No, so I probably don't have enough to upgrade anything. Alright, I have 600. Let's go see about making something pretty. Oh, uh, garden. We have the plank pathways. I have 600 to spend. Is there anything I can get for that? Stone bench, let's do it. Look at that! Cute! Cute! Attention, Frog. You have clearance to enter Wumbo mode. Indeed, Ninja Puppy. Ah, uh, it has been 15 days. Uh, commence, Wumbo. All right. Sir Hopslot. Damage per resistance. Effectiveness to future attack size changes. Minus projectile speed. Minus effectiveness to future attack frequency changes. Big hits. Slow. Cool. 
Cool. Frog with sword. Okay. Interesting. Okay. I mean, I think I want to do Collier or Finn next. Fishing versus mining. Like, both of them, you want to do both. Because crop yield is really bad for them. Um, or like for Collier, it's enemy loot yield. Coin flip, I mean, it really is. Y'all, let's, I was going to say, let me go. I'm going to go real quick and y'all think about it. Because I might want to get more coffee. Coin flip. Do I have an actual coin? Oh, you know what? I do. Guess what? Great, great usage. Faz coin. It's a Faz coin. Because Anna got me Faz coins, Faz tokens. All right. Uh, heads mining, tails fishing. Oh, hold on, hold on. I'm not looking. I'm not looking. Tails, we're fishing. We're fishing. Let me go put these back. Um, okay. I can never escape the fast. Never. All right. We're going fishing. Cool. Well, that's great because I haven't recorded any with Finn. I've played both characters, but I haven't recorded any as Finn. So this will be fun. Um, so we're going to be increasing our attack size whenever we catch fish. Um, the more we fish, the better our fishing is going to get. Um, uh, and, and yeah, uh, but crops are not that important. So I don't need to be focusing that much on crops. Um, I'll let my pets do it. I'll make sure to really focus on my weapons from my crops, but, um, more about fish, 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 and also mining. Okay. Okay. Let's do it. <clears throat> but this should be good. Things should get real big. The web is taking up half the screen. Yeah, if you if you're fishing enough. Do 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 do. All right, let's try winter. I don't think we've done winter today. Okay, we'll plant the things that we do have. Okay. Do 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 do. So you can see in the winter, it's ice fishing. Um, crop growth speed per crop yield. Well, we know that we're not a crop build. You know, XP gain this early on. Let's go with that. So yeah, earlier someone asked if um, stuff is different in the different seasons, like if it's more than just an aesthetic change. I don't know. What I do know is that different enemies do show up. I don't know that their behavior is any different because pretty much all the enemies just walk at you at different speeds. Oh, fish spawns and fishing. Absolutely. We're fish focused. Cool. Mining speed as well. Mining and fishing because my heat, my crops do not yield me very much. Dude, dude, I gotta... Mentally, I keep walking around like the, the holes and things. So I was like, I don't have to. The only things that block you, I think, are the trees and the, the house. Coin game per crit. No, we're not going to lose fish spawns. Knockback and damage. Damage and planting speed, but minus the fish spawns. No. Crop thirst and capacity. Or spawns. Let's do it. If I'm not going to be getting damage stuff, then I want to be getting fishing and mining stuff. Let's grab these two things first. See, the amount of money you get early on from mining versus um, getting... Uh, what do you call them? Crops. Um, or... Or fighting enemies, um, it's it's huge because enemies are what actually give you money, not not crops. Um, okay, let us buy. What weapon would I like? Scythes are not a bad idea, but y'all have seen those. Let's do the hay bales. Let's do the hay bales. For those familiar with Vampire Survivors, these are like the train carts or the mine carts, whatever you call. You get Snowhead Temples PTSD whenever you think of ice physics. What's Snowhead? Or do you just mean like Winter Temples? All right, we're going to buy both of the hay bales. Let's buy another plot. Let's pet the good boy. And then let's buy the more expensive one so I don't have to worry about 
coming back too much. The more expensive ones generally require less water. They just take more time. Which works for me. Do 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 do. Okay. Damage up, but crit damage down. XP gain and coin gain up. It's not bad. I kinda like the base damage up. What's my crit chance at? Plus 15%. So that would take me to I could never crit, but I'm already at a pretty low crit chance. And we just did a crit build. It's it's a rare item. It's a plus 50% damage. Like, I gotta do it. It's ice everywhere. No thank you. Um, effectiveness to future XP gain changes. That's pretty cool. Because again, it's the effectiveness thing, so then the more you get those other things, the better, right? It's like, it's so neat. It would make these, the next three times I get this, increase by, uh, instead of plus 12%, it'd be like plus 18%, right? Or maybe plus 16%. Let's do some rerolls, though. Uh, mining yield when a fish is caught. Love it. Because it builds. As much as I would also love to just get the flat fishing speed, um, I think that um, the ones that build... The ones that build. Dynamite? Yeah, exactly. Uh, damage and crop growth speed. I, I could use just some damage at this point. Let's just go for that, not, not risk it. So I think every morning I gain fish yield. Is that what it is? 15% extra fish yield in morning. So right now we're at 41%. We're about to be at... Um, uh... uh how much did it say I gained? 50%? We're gonna, about to be at 50%. That's nice. Above 50%. Doom. Doom. Yeah. So I will be buying only the most expensive plants because... Hey, hey, I got my hay mail! Finally. It grew. Look at that. They're not bad. They're not bad. What I like over the, um, the minecarts in Vampire Survivors is you can aim these with the, uh, with the right stick. Um... Mining speed up is nice, but with our crit damage being so low and our crit chance being so low, the rest of that's not so great for us. Let's just get the damage boost. Last time we did a crit build, now we're doing a reverse crit build, which is a no crit build. <laughs> uh, health regen's not a bad idea. Let's go for the health regen early on. We had that issue last time. Plus 100% is double damage. Exactly. Exactly. It's like... We got some, some good here. Ooh, I only have 134 bucks. Shoot! Ooh, that sucks because that puts me behind on weapons. Oh well. Um, can't even afford the pet. Wow! I did not grab any money. I guess I was only fishing. Um, bombs? Y'all have not seen bombs, y'all have not seen yo-yos, y'all have not seen katanas. So, it's whatever I prefer. This is a crit weapon. Let's do bombs. I can only afford one. <laughs> okay. So today I need to make sure to, like, do some mining and stuff. I know I don't have a toucan, so I do need to go plant my plants, but... Like, already, just mining those two things would have given me enough money. I wish I had been paying attention, I just wasn't looking. Do 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 But that is how it goes. Okay. Nice. Crop thirsting capacity, pick up range and knockback, damage watering range, watering speed. None of those jump out at me. Mining yield, but mining down on fish. Ooh, attack size when an ore is mined. Look at that. More attack size. Jay the Fay, how's it going? Apple healing crop yield, resistance and move speed. Doing all right. Man, we're really getting ore build stuff. I'm cool with it though. I just need some more to spawn. Cause like my fish stuff is also doing very well. We gained a lot of levels there very quickly. Cause the innate fishing growth that we have is incredible. Uh, Jay the Fay, this game is awesome, by the way. This is a survivor like with a, a we're we're a, a frog uh, and and that's about it and we run a farm 
Doing some D&D based theorizing, playing a new Stardew update. Cool! I hope that the new uh, update's fun. Um, sorry, I just got increased fishing uh, spawns, apple spawns, etc. My crops are going to go slower, though. And mining spawns. So that all that is going to be very good. All right, no minerals are up there, which tells me there's going to be a lot over here. Do, do. Just going to mine a couple of these, because we know that last time I didn't have enough money. Now let's go on overboard, huh? Okay. All right. Um, let's, let's just get our hay bales increased. Let's buy some farm plots. We'll buy two. And let's buy a bunch of the most expensive plants. And let's pet the dog. Was the dog behind me now? See, that's why I need to move my camera back. Even though it's elsewise, much better to have it over here. The new farms are your, your favorite. That's awesome. Now, I'll be curious in a couple of months, you know, once the, the newness has died down. I think that I'd be curious to hear your, like, refresher. Um, but at the same time, they've probably learned enough, or a lot at this point. So maybe it is, like, legit the best one. Which would be cool. We've got already, uh, we've got health regen, right? The runs might, might be mixing together for me. Uh, attack frequency per knockback. What's our knockback at? 5% right now. Minus crit chance to crit. Well, you know what? I've already given up on any crits. Um, it's your personal favorite. I mean, like, that's the thing. Like, it could be. It could be that, like, just... Because the first farm is so simple, right? So it could be nostalgic in a way, but it can also be, like, it's boring. Right? Whereas some of the more modern ones, I agree. Like, I think the Four Corners map, is that the one? Um is awesome. It's probably the best one, even if you're playing single player. You only ever did the basic because of lack of experience. Got it. Now, the other farms are fun, for sure. Once you've played it enough, um, any of those other ones are a lot of fun. Minus frequency and crit damage, but way up on duration and speed. No. Damage and resistance. Damage, duration, frequency. Planting speed, crop yield. Well, again, we're not worrying about crops too much. We have reduced crop benefits. Frequency. Okay. Fish spawns, yes. You only play Stardew via Xbox Game Pass? Oh, that sucks. That sucks that it messed up your file. Okay, yeah, there's a lot to get over here. Fishing and mining, mining and fishing. We're doing the mining and the fishing right now. Hmm. Plus the damage per 1% max health. What's my max health? 102. So this would reduce my damage right now by 29%. Right? Because my max health would boost me back up, or 28%. But then, if I focused on getting more max HP, then this would be really good. This is, Chunky is really good for Bubba, who I have yet to play. Um, yeah, 130 is a major downside until you look at, you know, you start with 100 health, so really it's a minus 30%, um, unless you've been tanking your HP. Duration and yield, tax size, water. Let's let's try again. Mm, none of these are great, so we'll we'll go just for the damage and crop growth. Because I don't think our damage growth is nerfed; it's our attack size or our attack frequency. Maybe I'd have to check. Because one of them is nerfed by picking the character, I think. Do, 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 do. Yeah, it'd be great for Bubba. I, I need to try Bubba. I haven't tried Bubba yet, and that's another different build. For those who didn't see, who weren't here, um, Bubba gets boosts for max HP, but otherwise is limited in where he can gain boosts. So, like, his crops aren't as good, his um, mining isn't as good. 
Let's do the just the damage up right now. Let's have you water for me. The ant is here. Did I never go to the ant shop today? Jeez Louise. Well, let's max out on the bouncy balls. Let's buy a couple of these. I've never done that before. Where I've waited all day. I was actually curious... Um, what happened? If you, you know, like, is there a limit? Would it take too long? I do want to make sure I'm doing it every day, though, because... You know, there's a limit to the stock on weapons. Unless it builds up. Like, unless... No, I don't think it is, because we... We learned that the hard way once, didn't we? I haven't been paying attention. I don't I actually know. Yeah, let's go ahead and just boost that. A lot of my fishing and mining stuff just builds itself as we do it. Um, XP gain and crit chance isn't a bad idea. Nah, let's reroll. Love this guy. Um, duration, move speed. Let's get let's get Swift Wings. I think it's a good idea to get right now. All right, give me some goods. Now that I know I can like take my time. Do I have a toucan yet? No, we got another watering guy though. All right, weapon wise, let's boost our bombs. Let's max that out. All right. Let's plant everything. And then we can let our little dudes take care of the rest. You uh, appreciate the characters that deviate from the norm. That's always my thing. I love trying to figure out the different types of builds you can do. Damage and duration? Yeah. Not the crit one. Down on the shot prices, up on the move speed. Let's do this one again. Bombs, attack size, and damage. Okay, we'll do that. Having bigger bomb areas is a good thing, I think. More amount or size and let's do size and frequency. Because again, if you get frequency up fast enough, you know, it'll be as if. Be as if the same is true. It would just happen faster with uh, the increased number. Um, range and knockback, damage and thirst. Let's do that one again. I just need to be building a little bit on my offensive uh, abilities. I don't want to get in a situation like I had before where suddenly the enemies are getting like incredibly close to me and I'm having like moments where they're just hitting me, you know? All right. So sometimes, as you see there, what are those things? Those are like, I forget what they're called, but they're some kind of beetle, but their heads are on the end of their, like, long knuckle necks. Um, I forget what I was going to say now. More watering. Um, Wanderbot's good, but um, right now I just need to make sure my farm is taking care of itself. Oh, I forget what I was going to say. All right, knockback per resistance. What's my resistance at? 25%. Yeah. Heck yeah, that's good. Let's get everything planted. I got a good good chunk of money, but let's do a little bit more mining. You want to call it giraffe beetle? All you know is that they're also in Hollow Knight. <laughs> nice. Um, yeah, they're gross. There's a great documentary that I watched. At, at this point, it's 25 years old, I think. Um, uh, called... I think it's just called The Undergrowth. It might actually only be like 20 years old. It's from um, David Attenborough. Great stuff like that. I think you see those guys like fight. Territorial dispute. It might not be those beetles, but it's some giant beetle like that. And they're like way up in the trees, like way up. And they fight and they will like throw each other off. But because they're, you know, an insect, they're, they're a certain size. Um, there's no 
it doesn't hurt for them to fall. They're not heavy enough to cause um, uh, impact damage at terminal velocity. Um, because it's not the falling that hurts you; it's your weight. <laughs> it's your body having to slow down. Um, knockback and frequency. Stereo roll. Resist <clears throat> resistance to regen because the resistance also gives us knockback. C -c -c Combo. All right, let's get some fish. Um, frequency and speed. Yeah, let's do that. Trying to get it so I can protect myself just sitting still. Plenty speed, watering speed, watering range. Chance to gain an additional pet. We'll go for that. It's early enough on. Give me all that money. Do, 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 do. Did I forget the store again? Oh, you're right, I did! Attack size per resistance. Thank you for reminding me so I didn't miss out. It's because I waited so long last time. Um, toad oil, lawnmower, or crow boom. Let's do toad oil. It's, um, it's like holy water. Okay. Might as well. Just get them all. Literally, bought all the seeds. Okay. Well, let's get as many of them planted as I can. Grab the apple. I love that there are minerals, like, pretty close to the uh, farm. So you can plant and go. See, I know that the shop's open now. Paying attention. Frequency and damage. Ads at the worst time. Oh no! I'll um, I'll hold on for a second. Let's uh, let's grab some money. Let's go to the shop. Damage, size, duration. Well, well we're not gonna do crit chance. There's a minute left in it. Let's. I'm just gonna hop up to the shop. We're gonna sit in there for a minute. Okay. Let's get some more hay bales. Let's get some more bombs. Pet the dog. How'd my weekend go? My weekend went all right. Um, first time back in the studio in a long, long time. Is it the mining that increases my attack size? It's both. It's both, I think. Because my basic ability is attack size when I catch a fish. And then the mining one, attack size when I mine an ore. So yeah, both of them. So my attack size should be pretty big. 136%. 136%. Do, 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 do. All right. That ends in 10 seconds. Big attack. All right. Hello, people coming back from the ad. I basically came right back in here so you didn't miss anything. What does toad oil do? Toad oil is, um, it's like, um, Holy water from Vampire Survivors. You leave giant puddles. It's that. My attack size is huge because of the amount of fishing and mining we've been doing because that's the the benefit of um, this character, Finn. Do Damage and move speed, max health and regen, water capacity, growth speed. Let's get some damage and move speed. I need, I need some damage up now. I have a lot of good AOE abilities though. The, um, the hay bale is piercing, obviously the, um, the pools, um, will affect every creature in the area. The balls bounce. Um, okay. Bombs, bigger damage and frequency, I don't want crit. What's, what, how negative is my crit right now, I wonder? Minus 20% crit chance, minus 135% crit damage. Look how big the bouncy balls are, my goodness. All the money. I didn't miss the shop, did I? No, okay, we're good. Okay. Yeah, damage leaves a little something to be desired, but 
It's not terrible. Actually. Okay, yeah, I need I need these things to uh, protect me a little bit. I want a cat. Sure. Did I get two? No, just one. Do 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 do. I'm gonna sit there and fish here in a sec. A cow. Mama had a chicken. Mama had a cow. Dad was proud. He didn't care how. Um, what do we want to boost, Max? I need, I need to get more toads, or, uh, tadpoles, because they're only a level, level one. Let's max you guys out. I need a toucan. Fishing yield when an ore is mined. It's a combo. We're at, you know, we're more than halfway through, but we're, you know, we're not, we're, we're under two thirds through. So there's still plenty of time to get the benefit out of this. Frequency and damage. Projectile speed and damage. Frequency. Do, 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 do. Piercing and duration. Look at the little frog guy go. Look at him go. Um, this guy. Basically, if I see that crit is a part of the benefit, I'm like, okay, we're in, we are fully missing out on that chunk of it. Uh, future coin gain changes. Let's just do the damage up, or I can be rerolling. I forget that I can. I have two rerolls now. Give it a face. Do 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 do. Give me the minerals. Okay, yeah, the hay bales. Love it. Fishing yield and damage. XP gain. I mean, fishing yield and damage now at this point, you know. I'm gonna be doing a lot of fishing here. And, like, money's not a huge issue right now. Uh, okay, let us... Where are we at levels-wise? Threes across the board, mostly. Let's, um, let's get our bouncy balls up. Maxed as much as we can. Let's get some more of these guys. And these guys. Well, let's just get them all, huh? Just make sure I'm on bouncy balls first. Those are the ones I care about. Dude, the, the... Toad oil is doing some goodness. It's doing some goodness. Fish spawns, ore spawns, apple spawns. I mean, that's not terrible. Max health per pickup range. I think I might have reduced my pickup range, to be honest. Where's pickup range? Oh, up top, minus 2%, yeah. Um, let's just get more spawns, you know? Like, if I can just sit here for this day, you know? Ooh, I need to plant some more seeds, though. Bouncy balls, not the crit one. Okay. Yeah, look at that. All right. So these big guys, the, one of the issues is that, like, multiples of them will spawn, but only you'll only get one chest for them. Frequency and watering speed, attack size and capacity, growth speed during the day. Oh, so that's basically, this is the effect that the Grim Reaper guy has. Like his innate effect. It's a reduced version of that. Damage and enemy damage, projectile speed, planting speed, projectile speed. I mean, damage up isn't a bad idea. Like damage up on our puddles, our toad oil. That's pretty nice, you know? Boss guys. You're ruining my thing, dude. You're ruining my thing. All right, cool. I've survived. All the money in the world. Okay. 
Um, XP gain, why not? Okay. Oh boy. Oh boy, I need y'all to die. Okay, let us boost our puddles. I want them as fast as possible. Oh boy. Um, alright, let's go ahead and get a water bottle. I don't need another water. Do 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 do. Massive bales, indeed. Um, well, let's get more fishing yield. A little bit of damage. I wish I got, like, HP for fishing, you know? Do 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 do. Okay. Don't want to reduce my health regen. What are some good sights to see when you're in Portland? Nature stuff. I mean, the weather right now is actually really nice. So if you happen to be here when stuff is nice, got a ton of hikes. Um, I don't know if any of the gardens, pro like the botanical gardens or the Japanese gardens or anything like that, I don't know if they're in season. Um, but, uh, but anything nature-y. Bullet hell atomic crops? Yeah. Yeah, very much. It's good. It's good. All right. Do, 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 do. Okay. Eek! All that XP. Chance to get an additional pet. Love it. It's a little late on that one. That's a good one early on. Let's get the additional chance. You're going to be in Portland soon? Oh, okay, so it's a really nice day today. So go just, you know, wherever you are, just look up, like, nearby trails or, like, you know, go to the river or something like that. Because, um, you know, nature stuff is the best stuff um, up here. Like, unparalleled. You can't get what we got over here on the west coast of america it's just it's so many wonderful forests do, 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 do. okay okay another axolotl i don't really need them Let's get five of you, five of you, max out on you, because I don't know. Um, I don't know how many I need to level each of these up. Toad oil, let's get size, more size. If I can cover the whole screen, wouldn't that be nice? Look at all that. All right, let's get in the middle here. Give me some puddles. There we go. Projectile speed. I mean, that's a lot of health regen. That's a lot of health regen. Oh, he's stuck on the tree. You can get them stuck on the trees, the bosses. Sometimes, if you get lucky. Because you can still shoot over the trees. Yeah, look. Eventually, I think they just kind of like... The game has a uh, mechanic of just like, Oh, okay. He's stuck. Let him go. No clip for a moment. Sure. I, sh I don't need any more axolotls, I don't think. wonder if I got an extra. I have a 75% chance of getting an extra. Damage, attack, size, frequency. I think that's what I want. Ooh, 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 got a little hit there. Got a little hit there, but guess what? We got boosted regen, so we're cool, probably. More resistance and regen. Damage and move speed, XP gain. I mean, more regen. Like, looking at my HP now, it's going back significantly. You can watch it go up. 
bombs. Damage frequency. Amount. See, at this point, we go damage. Attack size isn't that important because we've already got enough stuff doing attack size. Okay, damage. More damage on the right-hand side. More piercing. Let's do this one. The crit stuff obviously doesn't mean anything to me. Um, again, what are our weapons looking like? All right, everything's at four. So we're going to just do five, five, max, most expensive, next expensive, last expensive, exit. Okay. Make sure we are on weapon seeds. Again, LB and RB to cycle through your seeds at the top. Because you automatically plant as you're walking around. I guess I haven't really talked about the mechanics. I'm sorry about like how it works. You just walk around and that stuff all automatically works. Just like in, you know, any other um, survivors like. Uh, oh, later Williams. Hopefully uh, you heard me say that. But otherwise, you know, safe drive. Yeah, damage speed, knockback, etc. Frequency damage duration. Yeah. Oh, I love it. They're so huge now. That's awesome. All right. I'm going to stand over here by the fish pond slash mining zone. That's all very close together. Wow, that would have been good on the last one. Fishing yield and damage. Yeah, let's get the max health. Dude. Giant sprites, yeah. Okay, there's minerals here. Let's get them minerals. Okay. Do, 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 do. Okay. XP gain, more fishing speed, minus to mining speed. I mean... Why not? Do, 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 do. Hey, Shiffy, how's it going? I see you lurking. Okay. Attack size, yield, speed, range. Damage, resistance. Do I have a thing that boosts from resistance? I think I do, don't I? It's, again, it's like when I have so many... There we go. Knockback per resistance. Ooh, I love that. Yes. I love knockback. Bombs. Not the crit one. Alright. So we're almost maxed out with our weapons. So I have a feeling that... Yeah. We will buy max, even though I definitely don't need that many. But I also don't need all these seeds. So, alright. Uh, weapon seeds. Those first. I probably only need like three of the tadpole seeds, but you know. Better safe than sorry. Those are some big boys. Those are some big boys. This one. Okay, let's get near the fish. Let's fire back in that direction while they're kind of stuck behind some trees. Take our time. The, the massive attack size from all the fishing has been incredible. I just love how wacky the builds get, you know? Do 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 do. Sure. Let's go find our plants. They gotta be done by now. Yeah, there we go. Get ready, max it. Oh wow, it actually needed a lot. Damage knockback. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's fine. Okay, actually. I needed all those seeds, right? Or did I already max out? No, I already maxed out. I already maxed out. Okay. They were just sitting there still, I guess. Man, I'm gonna get so much fish over there. Capybara! Give me multiples, please. Who was that? Noonie! What's up? 42 months. My goodness, how's it going? How's it going? Good to see you. This game is awesome. It's a uh, roguelike... Oh, pet the dog. Um, 
It's a roguelite, you know, like a, a survivors type game, but you're a frog and you plant things. Do, 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 do. Okay. Get, get zapped. I think it's a fairly uh, cheap game as well. I didn't actually look again, but it was less than $10. I think it might be like less than $5. I'm not sure. Do 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 Okay, another chance to gain an additional pet, so that's a guarantee, although we're not gonna have the opportunity again, I don't think. So let's just go ahead and do this kind of stuff. I mean we're we're done. This run is cleansed. Alright, <laughs> more fishing speed, sure. We are the fisher frog. Lord of the Ice. Finn causing massive ecological damage. I know, right? Nickname BP. Damage per apple spawns. What's my apple spawn rate? Who's 60%? Let's do it. That's... That's a good one. Wow. Granted, I think I got a lot of bonus apple spawn stuff, because it also boosted my other resource gathering, but that's a lot. If you do this build, look for that thing. Alright. We're done. Go Wumbo! Yeah! Finally started the Magnus Archives, and oh man, it's intriguing. The meta story just started getting good. Got a favorite episode. Oh boy. Oh, Noonie, I'm so happy. I'm so happy. I'm so happy you started, because it's so good. Um, gosh. There's, like, arcs that I really love. Um, I'm trying to think if there are, like, specific episodes that are just, like, awesome. Like, memorable ones. There definitely are. Gosh, like, I've listened to it so much that it's uh, hard to pick out. Let me think. Let me think. Um, but, yeah, the meta story really is the big part of what, like, gets you going. Um, okay, we got 6k in the gems. Let's boost. Last time we boosted our crit a little bit, right? Our defense. We boosted our defense. That's right. Um, let's boost our HP. HP on level up. Let's get ourselves some good defensive stuff, you know? Cool. Maxed on the HP. Let's get a little attack duration too. Okay. One short of a clean 50. Dang. My highest level, because you can actually look up in here, I think is 50. So, now, you see how many of these are. There must be, like, endless modes or something. I'm stoked. This game is so good. It's so good. Oh, man. Best Magnus Archives episodes. They're, um... I like a lot of the ones... I'm not gonna, like, get too deep into it. The ones that have to do with, like... Shapeshiftery slash doppelgangery type characters. There's some really neat stuff in there, and that's all I'm gonna say. Um, yeah. Because it really is more like there are arcs within the series that I'm like, I love those. And I guess this, the first season has a lot of like disparate episodes. So I really like the Bone Turner's Tale, and I really like, um, oh, what is it called? Um, it escapes my mind now. There's one in the first. Oh, uh, uh, Grifter's Bone. Do, 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 do. The Bone Turner's Tale and Grifter's Bone. I like a lot. Oh, and then way later on, so it's going to be a while before you get to that. There's one called, uh, it's like Welka, uh, Hello, Mr. Spider or something like that. That's a good one. And then there's another one, a hacking, not a hacking one, but like a computer related one. There's a lot. There's a lot. You got to watch this show. It's a podcast. It's called The Magnus Archives. Go look it up. It's incredible. It's incredible. It's all on YouTube. Um, it's, uh, it's not like chock full of ads or anything like that. So um, strongly recommend. Strongly recommend The Magnus Archives. And they just started their follow up series, The Magnus Protocol. It started like two months ago. It's so good. New episode would have come out today for me because I'm a early backer. Anyway, all right, let's pick a new character. 
Y'all, if you're watching on YouTube and I just included all of that, go check out the Magnus Archives if you're into horror. It's incredible. Podcast. Okay, um, let's see. Yeah, Nuni, the doppelganger stuff. Oh, man. And it, it's, it's so good. I'm excited to hear what you have to say as you uh, listen to more. Um, okay, so who did we play today? We played Sprout. We played Pumpkin. Oh, let's do Bubba. You know, we've talked about Bubba a bunch today, but let's 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 do some some Bubba. Hold on. Okay. Also, the the neat thing about the Magnus Archives, I'm not too deep into the community, but it's got a very like rabid community, like a very strong fan base. And a big part of it is because they have a sort of thing associated with it where it's like you can freely make content that exists within the Magnus universe. Um, I think as long as you're not like selling stuff, I think it's something to that effect, but they have like a whole like non, so some kind of license associated with it. But if you listen to the episodes, they say that. Exactly, Noonie, exactly. It's good fall asleep stuff, even though it's horror stories and some of them can really kind of get into you. But um, his voice, his voice is so good. Jonathan Sims of the Magnus Institute, London. All right, let's be Bubba. Okay, let me let me read Bubba's thing again, though, just to be for sure. All right. Max, <laughs> you die for Bubba. <laughs> Following Rusty Quill. Yeah, exactly, Sinya. They have a whole bunch of other stuff, but I'll be honest, I've tried listening to some other Rusty Quill projects, and I'm not a fan. Um, but... Scroll through, they all have a nice production quality, if there's something that tickles your fancy. Um, okay, our health boosts are bigger. We always want to do health boosts. Our health boosts give us damage. Our base damage is going to be low. Um, our... Let's see, effectiveness to future move speed. Okay, so we're going to be slow. So building our damage on its own is going to be bad, and our damage at the start is going to be real bad. So... We just want to get boosted health. Oh, and then hold on, hold on. Actually, damage per max health. So actually, we only start at like a minus 50% because we're going to get our health's worth. Okay. So health, 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 health. Got it. Let's do it, Bubba. This game is so good. All right, we're going to try spring two. I love it. I've actually, we've been making it through, which I think a big part of it is because now I've had more upgrades. I can survive a little bit longer. That's what the beginning means. Yeah, that's what that whole like... The Magnus Archives is a non-compete something, something or another, uh, share alike, something license. It's a whole thing. It's a very long thing that they say, like, to the point where it's like, it's comical. Um, let's go, uh, damage ups don't really work too well for us, right? Let's look for an HP up. Let's look for an HP up to the best of our ability. Ooh, the plus 50% damage though. That's still going to be plus 25%. Do, 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 do. Right? Like, let me look, let me look at our stats now. Yeah, now we're only down 9.6 when we were down 50. So, you know, I think it was worth it just to kind of jump us forward because we will get plenty of more XP and level ups, you know? All right, let's do some mining. Actually, that's right. I learned last time. Mining is actually the best way to get early money. Yeah, I need you guys to be dying. Like, normally I would have assumed it was fighting enemies, but no. All right, let's 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 leave a puddle here and let's let them kind of run into it a little bit. All right. I did not get all my things planted today, but that's fine. I need another weapon. That's what I really need. Tell you, Jazzy knows. I know this is on Jazzy's wish list, and I uh, posted it in our group chat yesterday. So Jazzy is aware. Um, I don't know if Jazzy has played it yet, though. Let's do a reroll. Damage coin gain, damage attack, frequency damage resistance. Max health. There we go. All right, little guy. Let's get the weed whacker. Looks like we could go for a whole, uh, like, orbitals build. Let's go for one of the Weed Whacker and one of the Fairies. Let's get a second plot 
And let's buy the cheapest ones real quick. Okay. Chance to gain an additional pet. It's early on. It's early on. The reduced XP is going to be annoying for a little bit, but I'll just make sure to get another XP booster. Like, that's just going to be one of our little goals. You know, your wad is low. Oh, no. Coin gain when a weapon is harvested is really good. Oh, max health, attack size, and damage. I mean, this is very good. Ad break in less than a minute. Okay, y'all. If you don't want to see that ad break, make sure you are subscribed. You can use your Prime sub if your Amazon Prime account is attached to your Twitch. You can get a sub for um, about $5, maybe 6 if you're on mobile. Or one of our wonderful uh, community members might gift you one because they're awesome. Um, anyway, that's going to happen. We're going to keep on playing. Max health and attack size, I think, is good because it'll boost our damage. Oop. Eee! Eee! Okay, let's water some things. I need my new weapon. Yes, there we go. My new weapons, there we go. Got the fairies, got the blades. I would love if we can build a really nice... Oh, max health! So it's minus 15% damage, but... It's actually plus 30% damage, so it's plus 15% and plus 2 attack duration. It's an overall benefit, plus 30 health. Okay, nice. Attack frequency, water suit, max health. Gotta go for it. And I can get another Concord here in a bit. Yeah, let's do some fishing and some mining. Again, this early on, mining is the way to go. Apple healing. Resistance, I think, is worth getting. Because <clears throat> a lot of the health stuff, I think, will also give us some resistance. As we get to the later ones. I think. PC Man, thank you for the ad warnings. It never warns me going forward. I think it's... I don't know what it is. It's something in my settings, probably. Probably my error. Um, let's just go for that big boost of damage. What's our damage at now? Plus 71%. Not bad. Get a little cow. Let's, um... We're gonna just max out our blades. We're gonna... I'm gonna see if I can't get the, uh... Um... All orbitals built. Like, what other orbitals are there? Um... There's gotta be more. Let me think. Let me think. I know they're... Oh, I guess... I, so I treated the scythe like it was one. It kind of treats like one. Like, it's just like... Goes around you in an area. So the scythe kind of is one. What else are there? It only started showing up for you mods a few days ago. Interesting. That's so interesting. Weed whacker. Up on the duration and size? Or amount? That's it. This is a tough one. Duration and size. I think size ups are gonna be really nice. Because <laughs> having the size ups in that last round were very good. Crit chance, damage attack frequency, attack duration, no. Crit damage, fishing speed, mining yield when a fish is caught. It's the ones that like build stats over time, it's hard to say no to those. So it, what's interesting is that, you know, what I've found is that the game, unless you have a build that's specifically tailored to one or the other in terms of farming versus like mining and fishing, it actually is the the best way to play this is to um, do a little bit of both. Do a little bit of both. Get your plants going and then don't be like hovering to try and get like the most efficiency out of growing things. Instead, like cycle. Use your time effectively. Okay. Okay, um, oh, yo-yos are a bit of an orbital. Yeah, y'all haven't seen those yet. So let's go ahead and get a yo-yo. I want to build up my cutters first, though. Some of these expensive ones. Expensive means less plots. Okay, yep. The max health one, love it. Our max health has to be pretty high already. 235. 
How much do we get per? So that's one damage per max health. I have 235 max health, but my damage... I guess my the amount that I have reduced my damage from other things. Yeah, there. Interesting. Interesting. Maybe the damage ups or the damage downs are worse. You know, like how the damage ups are worse. Amount knockback frequency. Yeah, we'll do that. I think I've already kind of messed my crits up. Yeah, the damage is way low from the Concord. All right, so you can see the the yo-yos like bounce around. So I would say that's an orbital. It's like it's it stays very close to you. Minus shot prices when a weapon is harvested. This early on, that could be good, but shot prices aren't really an issue, to be honest. Duration and projectile speed. Let's do that. That's a good amount. The projectile speed is getting that stuff going really quickly. The projectile speed's really good for, like, the yo-yo, because the yo-yo sort of bounces around randomly, but if it's doing it frequently enough, you're going to hit a lot of the things. I've had it before where it's really slow, and you basically are dragging it behind you, and it doesn't work that well. This is a new game. If so, it seems pretty cool. Yeah, it just came out yesterday. Um, let's get an axolotl. Obviously, we love Wanderbot. Um, let's see. Mining and fishing in a bl it, Exactly, it's like Atomicrops, but I like the balance of this one a little bit better. It feels a little bit less stressful, but I guess that's the whole thing about, like, Bullet Heavens, is they feel a little bit less stressful than, uh, Bullet Hells, which I think Atomicrops, you would argue, is more like a Bullet Hell. Uh, okay. None of these are orbitals. Let's do a reroll. You can get more yo-yos. Let's do that. Let's buy a plot and the most expensive things that we can get. And the reason I do that is just simply so I don't have to like deal with my flipping farm. And now that we have an axolotl, he will slowly water things if I'm not there. So that's that's nice. Do do do. Next time we get back, I think I would like to spend some of our gems on a new pet um, thing. Attack duration per missing health, crop thirst per missing health, minus to max health. We don't minus our max health. You kidding me? You kidding me? How dare you suggest such a thing, second wind? Fishing speed when a fish is caught. That's a growth one. That's a real good one. Every fish I catch is going to increase our fishing speed. So eventually, we will get to the point where we are fishing pretty much instantly. And I've been there before. It's pretty wonderful. <laughs> Um, effectiveness to future attack frequency changes. Effectiveness to future planting speed changes. We'll do that because of the attack frequency changes. Damage, duration, and speed. Let's go for some damage. Oh, uh, I still don't know. That's something I would like to know, if anyone knows. Do the reduced damage bonuses apply to the weapons or just to your upgrades? You know, like to your stat boosts. That I'm very curious about, because otherwise, then, like, getting the damage boost on these guys actually matters. But if it gets reduced, then it's like, oh, okay, well, then you kind of want to balance around that. Um, let's go for more fishing speed and fishing yields. Um, fishing gives you XP, so, you know. Size and duration, frequency and damage. Frequency and damage. If you get fast enough frequency, you don't need any duration. But... Full duration does not cancel out frequency because uh, the uh, reload will only trigger after the thing has finished its cycle. And yeah, and you need the exponential growth. There's a lot of exponential growth mechanics in this game. It's real nice. They made, I feel like they made discovering builds pretty easy. Damage and knockback, but minus to the mining and fishing. Where's my fishing speed at right now? It'd take a little hit. Um, let's do a reroll. Knockback duration resistance, water speed, watering range capacity, planting speed, watering speed, watering range. Nah. Well, 
Resistance and attack size. I like that. I like that. Let's go talk to the ant. Toucan! Love it. With a toucan and an axolotl, now we're in a good spot. Okay, um, toad oil seeds. Let's get all the toad oil. Let's get a new plot. Let's buy some of the really expensive ones. Okay. So yeah, the toucan <clears throat> will plant for you. The axolotl will water for you. The wanderbot will pick up items for you, not harvest. The cow will increase the yield. The capybara increases the growth speed, and cats do damage. Damage and planting speed. Or spawns per mining speed. Attack size, crop yield. I mean, let's, let's try the ore spawns per mining speed, because then there's one that I can get, I think, that's like, as you mine, you increase your mining speed, so it's like, you know. Do, 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 do. I'd love to get the ones again where it's like, increase your weapon size, your attack size based on the mining and fishing. Frequency and damage, duration and damage, frequency. Damage, attack size, duration, frequency. No, it's all crits. I've already ruined my crits. You make sacrifices, you know? For those who don't know, we're going for like an orbital build. Uh, I'm not sure if there's another orbital that I can think of. We'll pay attention. Doing the best I can to do an all orbital build. All right, let's get bonus pet. Am I at 100% bonus pet or only 50% bonus pet? Do, 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 do. Okay. Let's get... Oh, Scythe! I had said Scythe counts. Because it still does, like, attack, like, right around you. Um, trying to... Because, yeah, it's, like, almost like it sends, a, like, a thing around you, right? But it's just the Scythe curving around you. Because, I, I honestly, I can't remember if there's any other orbital. So we're going to go with that. As we go through, maybe I'll remember that there is another orbital, and then, you know, next time, gadget. Okay. I mean, because I guess the, the, uh, the puddles aren't really orbitals. They're areas. Just, if I were to stand still, it would act like an orbital. Kind of like how the fairies don't actually, like, emanate from you, or it's like, follow you. They, like, more create, like, a, a zone. Right? But, still. Shroom. Let's get more watering. I feel like the watering is always slower than the, um, the planting. Let's get some fishing going so I can increase my fishing speed. I need to go to the other side. There's probably a lot of minerals and fish over there waiting for me. So yeah, I'm calling that an orbital, because once it goes fast enough, it, um... It works like an orbital. Amount, damage, frequency, yep. Max health and max regen, damage, frequency, projectile speed. We'll do the damage, frequency, projectile speed. Oh, that's right, I should get max health because I'm, I'm big frog. Healing and yield. Damage, water range, crop growth speed, water capacity. Fish spawns and fish yields is a good one. I mean, the other one also looks very good, but... Um, this gives us more XP, right? It's, it's, it pays. You think a no move run is possible in this game? Um, no. Because you need to go to the shop in order to upgrade your weapons because you can't get them naturally and you won't get XP unless you move around. Um, Max health per pickup range. There we go. So now I want to boost my pickup range. Um, later, Jay. Let's see. Let's... Where, where am I at on all these? I think we'll go with the... I don't have the weed whacker up in here, so... Let's get five on the yo-yos. Five on the sides. Let's buy another plot. Probably almost full on plots. Do 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 do. 
I fight you. I want fish spawns increased. Let's go, Bubba. My mom used to call my older brother Bubba. So we all called him Bubba. It's been a long time. <laughs> thick boy, yeah. The Bubba Frog is a thick boy. Oh, no! Use the puddle. Speed and size? Yeah, speed and size. And, and more amount. Shoo, 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 shoo. Damage size duration. Let's do it. Oh, the max health! I keep forgetting. I keep forgetting. Max health is my thing. Mining speed, mining yield's not bad. Not bad. Generally, the ones that, like, cancel out some of your stuff pay for themselves, you know, um, in other ways to the point where it's like, it's worth it, you know, as long as you need both stats. Okay, another toucan. Or maybe two toucans. All right, let's increase our fairies. And more on the sides. And let's grab another plot. There we are, done on the plots. Duration and speed, or spawns per mining speed. Let's do that. Oh boy, the mining speed. It's pretty good. Nice, the sides are doing some work. Uh, we'll go with the cow. Why not? Okay. Frequency, speed, damage, size, duration. Let's do the frequency. 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 Projectile speed. Give me some HP. There we go. The one that I keep passing up, even though it's very good for me. Um, more fish spawns and fishing yield. Heck yeah. I feel like it's still early enough on. Get shrecked. Oh, I need pickups or pickup. I need pickup boosts, right? Because I got the thing that boosts based on pickup. So I should think about that. Do, do, do. Fishing. Okay. So uh, I've also been playing a ton of Balatro. That game's incredible. Um, let's go with this guy. Give me the fish. Give me the fish. This build is somewhere between the Doom Slayer under Berserk Power Up and a Slam Ma Mage Priest of Metal. I don't know what that is. The Slam Mage Priest of Metal. Is that a uh, d and thing or a, a Warhammer thing or something? Do, 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 Okay. All right. Ooh, man. When all my moves are going, it's good stuff. Resistance size. I can't reduce the frequency, I don't think. What do I get for mining speed? There's something that I get for mining speed. Let's go ahead and do that. Do, do, do. I think it's like fishing yield or something, or maybe it's ore yield. The sides are good. Attack size, knockback, duration, damage, damage, attack frequency. Again, I just need my things out more frequently. Duration and size. Well, we'll go for that. Warhammer, okay. It sounded like a the the mage priest of metal. I was like, that sounds like Warhammer. Oof. 
frequency, the crit stuff is useless, but the size and the frequency is real good. But the knockback, I think the knockback seals it. All right. I do want like just a general, some general attack uh, frequency upgrades. Do do. If I can do some mining yield and fishing yield changes, minus the crop growth speed. Crop growth's not a big deal to me. Let's do it. Because I'm gaining a lot of fishing yield and mining from just doing those tasks based on some of the upgrades I have. Oop, don't get caught. Okay, um, well, once again, five of each because I have no idea how many I need to upgrade. And buy a bunch of the most expensive things and move on. And I buy the most expensive because then I don't have to really spend too much time planting. Do, 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 do. Um, let's get Wander out. Pick up range. Oh, pick up range. Yeah. I just mentioned that I need to be getting more of that. Because I think it gives me max health, which then gives me damage. So it's, again, it's one of those multipliers. Basically big toads that can swing power. Oh, got it. Well, there you go. The slan are big toads. Then Bubba is, Bubba is slan. Okay, weed whacker up. Duration and size. Yeah, we'll do that. Up on the health, probably. Size and knockback. And frequency. Frequency. Having reduced damage ups really helps you make some of those decisions because it's like, well, that's not actually a 30% up, that's actually a 15% up, so. Do, 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 do. Oops, went a little bit too close. Let's get some more resistance. Okay, let's go fish over this way. Fishing and mining, fishing and mining. Day 12, okay. All right, let's see if we can't max out all these dang things. Buy pet, most expensive, next expensive least expensive because it looks like I am actually getting through all of my plants right am I mistaken right now I still haven't planted all my weapon seeds so I'm trying to clear space until I at least have my last yo-yo down all right yo-yo is down yo-yo is down I repeat yo-yo is down Fishing speed when a fish is caught. Sure. No, I need, I need to just try and do the, the frequency for right now. That one would be great. If it were a few rounds earlier, no question. Right now, it would still be very good. But, um, you know, two rounds ago. Absolutely. It's just realistically, I'm trying to think, how many fish am I going to fish up? And would I rather get frequency to keep me alive, you know? Ribbit, ribbit. Okay. We're fishing. We're mining. We're fishing. We're mining. Ooh, boy. Frequency and duration. Frequency, size, knockback, hell yeah. Frequency. Yo, yo, Max. All right. Crit chance mining speed. 
more frequency. Absolutely. The less downtime, the better. Okay. Five, 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 one, one. Not even going to worry about the other plants. I'm just like done with it. Max health. That'll do. Bubba. I wish I could get that like meat hawk or whatever. The one that was like boosted damage and something else for attacks um, for health, right? How much health do I have? 362. Wow. I generally don't come out of a run with a little bit more than 100, you know? Do, 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 do. Duration and frequency. All right. So I do think we're now at a essentially a sit still point. Um, frequency and duration. Do, 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 do. Health per pickup range is 25%. It's not going to fully make up for itself, but whatever. Right? Because how much HP does it give? 374. It's like, it does give me more damage up. I don't think it gives me, like... Then again, I might have, like... It's right, he has boosted effectiveness to health gains, doesn't he? I didn't even think about that this whole time. 50% effectiveness to health gains. So that's why I've been so off on my calculations. I forgot about that aspect. Okay. All right, yeah. And so we have max on all of our weapons. So now we're just buying all the seeds in the world, but none of it matters. Just let my toucans and my axolotls handle all that nonsense. We're just going to fish. We're going to mine. Resistance and size. Let's do that. The blades. All the blades of doom. Okay. Whoop. Hopefully y'all can't hear that. There's an alarm going off outside. Okay, it's done. It's done. It's one of those ones where it's like, oh great, the alarm's gonna go off and then it's gonna be there for the rest of the stream. Uh, more resistance, why not? Day 15, final day. Another pet! Just buy all the seeds. Because eventually you get to a point where money means nothing. Just frequency. Do, 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 do. Love it. Things are working great. Just need to kill these. Ooh, I got caught on a tree there. It's all right. Didn't quite see it. It went a little transparent on me. Okay, come on. Let's get this, this wasp out. Let's get a capybara. Why no cats? You know, why no cats? Past couple of runs, no cats. It's rude. Frequency. Frequency.
Just never stop items. Never stop my weapons, please. Do, do, do. Tax size is pretty good, though. Look at that. Fish. Day's almost over. We're about to go Wumbo in three, two, one. Wumbo! Love it. Just got in. What game is this? This is uh, pesticide not required. It is a survivor's like um, where you are frog. It's good. It's a very good. Big frog. All right. That's a win with Bubba. That where have we unlocked anything else recently? We have three. No, four more frogs to unlock. I think this one's going to be the hardest for me, honestly. Because you have to, like, deliberately put yourself at that low health, and then, but then win, you know? It's, it's tricky. Every time you all back to the stream, it's bo just bonkers. Ad break in 45 seconds. Jeez, there's gonna be an ad break here in a second, y'all. Well, we're probably gonna call it here, because we've got, like, 20 minutes left in the stream, so I don't think we could handle another run within that time. Um, so, we'll just go a little early, and I'll send y'all off to one of our friends. Um, and then I will probably on my own record some, um, uh, Sunray OS. So, yeah. All right. Let me, uh, let's, let's start saying our goodbyes. Uh, YouTube, goodbye to you. Hope you have a wonderful rest of your day.